Jeff Meacham Network, Multiverse of Media. For over 15 years, the recognized symbol of excellence and the standard bearer in coverage of sports and entertainment. JJ, Jeff, you want to kick this thing off? Because I'm still trying to process everything here. Yeah, it's like... Um... Who wants okay. to go first? <laughs> well, come on in. It's open mic night with your host. You could maybe say there's really four topics, but it's split into six. The Renegade, JJ Williams. The Sammy and Eddie Kingston thing. Which one's the better smelling turd? And his panel of co-hosts. I am... Founder. We'll call me that for today since we're going with the Jeff Jarrett love theme here this week, according to JJ. The West Coast Professor, Jeff Meacham. Karma is karma is karma. That's professional wrestling! Damn it! The Simple Man, Noah Foster. It's showtime! Yeah! How's it doing, JJ? How you doing, Jeff? James. Yeah. And the Heat Man, James Hebert. Imagine Bill Burr, Joe Rogan, Paul White, the Baldies! There you go! It sounds oh, like Get in there! Short his ass and shit the bed. Uh, he's not man. Amber Heard. Give it time, JJ, <laughs> give it time. <laughs> now, I'm <laughs> sure Jeff has some stuff. The dumb move, just don't pull this bullshit again. You get one. Tony needs to stop caring about the ratings. Bradshaw said as long as the ads are in place, we're not going to lose that third hour. Real Bond does not have to be AEW light. They don't necessarily have to coexist with each other. We kind of saw that tonight to a degree. Along with a panel of guests. He's no longer glorious. Don't you bring that up. You want me to rant about what my NXT used to... No, no, we are done here for the night. I swear, James. Because you never know who may show up for open mic night. I leave our company in the capable hands of an extraordinary group of superstars, employees, and executives. The first thing that came to my mind was, it's about damn time. Amen! Oh, I literally God. touched everybody in the state's trash. So, so I've... <laughs> It's horrible, you guys. Peyton's new thing is uh, Dennis the Menace. But it's funny because she calls it... Dentist, the medicine. <laughs> and That's great. It's- when Elliot Taylor came out and did Born for Greatness live, I was popping my pussy, having a great time. I didn't care. I was having so much fun. Sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. Fuck Bill Belichick. <laughs> What is going on, everybody? Welcome to the Saturday Night Shenanigans that are open mic night, and we are kicking off our insane week plus long overload of streams with the second annual open mic night wrestling karaoke show. I am, of course, your host and moderator, the renegade of wrestling, JJ Williams. Good to see everybody start filing in here. Let's waste no introdu- no time with the introductions because we've got a bunch of people here waiting to come onto the stage, waiting to make an ass of themselves for you. First and foremost, the man you all come to see, the man whose name is on the marquee, the West Coast Professor Jeff Meacham. We're five minutes in, Jay. I've had a week. You can tell I'm in the I'm in the war attire. It's been one of those weeks. Jeff motherfucking Meacham is here and he's ready to sing his stupid ass off. Let's do the thing tonight, brother. All right. The next person we're gonna bring in is the man who looks forward to karaoke nights more than any 
night that we do a show. The simple man with the spectacular voice, Noah Foster. The man who's kicking us off tonight, baby. Noah, how are we doing tonight, bro? Fuck this. I'm <laughs> sick and tired, bloated, gutted. I'm awake doing this nonsense. You're lucky I'm even conscious enough to be sitting here while I'm playing Bellatro. Maybe I'll go to Full House deck. Get this thing started and over with. JJ, tomorrow he is risen, but tonight Noah's Noah's blood level is risen. <laughs> For real. <laughs> Next up, oh, Lordy. Noah's regular partner in crime, the Heat Man James Hebert, is in the house. He came to scene. <laughs> yes. And he's muted. He so is muted. Saying, uh, I am muted. I came to sing. Sorry. I also was muted. Uh, so, listen, correction. In my case, it's not only sing our stupid asses off. In my case, it's sing my stupid fat ass off. Yeah, okay, that's fair. That's fair. I, 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 oh, oh, I got okay. donuts. All right. All right. So, Greg's using this phone. He's here now. <laughs> yeah, you know. <laughs> that, that, I forgot, that's I forgot the whole thing. Of, of, you know, exactly, like, there's no way to fix that, so... Yeah, that, there's nothing I can do. Like Hi. when I find it, in case. Great Hi, Greg. Hi. Hi. Hello. So we'll go ahead and introduce Greg Cherry next. Greg Cherry, how are we doing, sir? Not too bad. Not too bad. Looking forward also, to this. Yeah, uh, pretty much. All right. Yeah. Well, since Greg went ahead and popped in, we'll go ahead and bring in a man who you can generally see every Wednesday on the Greg Cherry Show with Greg. Matty Laws is in the house. Yeah. Hello, everybody. Hello. I feel like dead. (laughs) You feel like dead? I feel like the dead. Oh, no. Food poisoning from yesterday. But I'm oh, fine. that's why you needed to go. Ah, I see. Lovely. Ah, right. I'll do it. <laughs> I'm alive, but God is testing me. God is that's testing. fair. Next person we'll bring in drink. is Maddie Laws's number one fan. Josh Mansfield is here for a limited time only. That's right. Limited I engagements. I am tired. <laughs> I am very tired. I think you and me both, brother. I just had an hour and a half Easter vigil I had to serve, including, and that's, you know, in addition to the allergies I had yesterday, and an 8 30 a.m. mass I have to serve in the morning. Oh, wow. Hey, 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 hey. hey. There is no complaining. You're doing right by the Almighty. I don't mean Bobby Lashley. So there you go. Thank you. And yeah, hi, Maddie. That was the most of you ever seen. I was muted for a second. I hope you feel better, buddy. Oh, I I always trust Smashburger, but this time around. Oh, it was Smashburger that did you in. Smashburger, it had to be the chicken because their burgers are always cooked all. Yeah, I was gonna say Smashburger is usually pretty safe, especially well the one here in LA anyway. Except the fact that they're over overpriced for us and the lines are rococo, especially when you're trying to get somewhere. Yo, next time you go to Smashburger, tell Mario and Luigi I said hi, will you? We're barely 10 minutes in. Damn it, James, you freaking idiot. It is far too early for the James, you freaking idiot bit already. Come on now. It always happens when I pop up, up, to be You can be happy about that. I didn't simp for him. So, yeah. I mean, that's out. That's out. To be fair, any I think any time I think we've noticed this every time it happens. If you get me, Walter, and Maddie in a room, ten yeah. tends to go off okay. the road. Once yeah. Colin, for real, dude, I've been following the story. We love you, Cleaver, and we love your yeah. little girl. Dude, that is that is some fucked up shit going on. We are glad to provide. I mean, you're calling this normalcy. God bless you for that phrasing, because that's completely incorrect. But we love you for it anyway, and we love you guys. Dang. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And last but not least is a man who requested to come in last. So I assume he's got some kind of shtick to do. So I'm just going to pop him in, let him do his thing. All right. All right. Hello, everyone. So I'm a little under the weather, but I wanted to do something since Aaron is taking a sweet ass time with the whole saxophone thing that we're supposed to bring him on. I'm going to set the mood. My son's a violinist, so if you can indulge me for a minute, we're going to set the mood since we're talking about karaoke and wrestling themes. 
I'm going to let my son, who doesn't want to be in camera, play a little something, something to get us started. So Ooh. go ahead. <laughs> it's the only thing you guys get tonight, folks. Uh, uh, yeah. Curious? I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. When I when I went and saw Mick Foley at the Ice House in Pasadena for his one man show, and Nita Strauss played him in with with her own version of uh of Wreck, <laughs> she did the Nakamura thing before. I kind of played like, oh oh, that's why she's here. She's she's the girl with the Nakamura. Of course, we all know Nita Strauss is if you're a rock and roll fan. But it was yeah, so, yeah. So I've, I've heard Nita do it. Now I've heard Walter Sun do it. Man, that song just just cooks no matter how you play it. Absolutely. Uh, Next time maybe we can get him to do the violin from Basic Thugonomics. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. He said technically two days, but really like an hour and a half. Right? Nice. <laughs> that was damn good. Days, he got it that quick. Yeah. Who knows? That That's, That's, That's crazy. I like that. Good for him, man. That's awesome. All right. Well then, Noah, what did you think of that? Impressive. <laughs> <laughs> That's impressive. The most, most impressive. <laughs> but you have not oh. got Noah smiling yet. Not yet. <laughs> well, Dude, he, he was like. Uh, uh, this is uh, go, go for ahead, those bro. of you guys that haven't been here on a karaoke show before, and I'm <laughs> talking more so to the audience. These nights are honestly the nights that Noah dreads the most. He does yes. it because yeah. he loves helping out friends. Damn it. But <laughs> yeah. if there was one night a year that he could skip, it would be the karaoke nights. Yep. That being said, he has owned, owed Dwayne Atkinson a performance since Steen's final match at mm -hmm. Revolution. Mm -hmm. Mr. Foster, are you ready to kick off the show as we have been promising people with the man called Steam? Down, 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 down. This crap over here, so maybe I can figure out how to do a damn flush. I will say, after Walter's performance, I love how Noah just sounded like Shane Top's uh, chosen character. Hmm, impressive. Yeah. <laughs> I will. While, while, while Noah finishes his prep, I will, I will uh, as head of network and marketing or whatever, thank you to the Dominguez siblings. They are not going to be in the chat room as they usually are. Yeah, or, it's not uh, as are... often as normal. They said they may pop in here and there. Oh, okay. To kind of okay. Hear if their stuff is getting done, but Got they it. are not going to be able to be here in full force like normal. Okay. Mm. Keep with what you're going to say. I Yes. I, I do want to thank them in advance because... Like, I usually don't try to pressure the rest of the audience, but I'm going to pressure the rest of the audience here. Okay. Each of them, each of them combined, sent to the two channels that they knew were going to get payouts, triple digit numbers in what? Super Chat. Wow. So we, we've got a ton of songs already, y'all, but yeah. they're going to go quick. Because they go. made specific requests. There you go. So the ball is in the audience's court to get on that, especially for the we are trying to help the man in the middle. Yes. For that for at least the first hour or until we get him past the finish line, super chats go to the Pennsylvania sensation because yes. he's almost there. He's almost there. He's like Tiana Prince and the Frog. He's almost there, but not quite. 
That is that yes, is neat. What that what was that say? No, the pen's too light. I need something help. <laughs> He's yeah. trying. So just get a sharpie. The first yeah. few super chats, especially if you're gonna pick somebody to sing and what song they're gonna sing, please send those to Greg's channel, the Greg Cherry brand. Yes. Two of those super chats should put him over the mark. Yes. yes. If you're, yes. yes. Just a friendly reminder, and then I'm sure, you know, if Jeff wants to get the ticker going, he can. Ah, uh, yes. $5 Super Chat means we spin both wheels. We have a wheel with everybody's name on it and a wheel with theme selections. And by theme selections, I mean companies. WWF, WCW, ECW, AEW, TNA, WWE. Yes, we separated them on purpose. Yep. NXT, indie wrestlers, deceased wrestlers, Hall of Fame wrestlers, WrestleMania theme songs. So a $5 Super Chat gets a spin of the name wheel and the theme wheel. A $15 Super Chat. You pick who you want to sing. We then will spin the theme wheel and the person you selected to sing will get to pick what song they want to sing based off of where the theme wheel lands. $25 Super Chat is pick your poison. You pick who you want to sing and what song you want them to sing as long as it is a wrestling theme song. Correct. You can't come at us talking about, you know, seeing Taylor Swift blank space or some shit. No, we did Taylor Swift back in February. Yes. We're not repeating that. No. And don't give me that look, Josh. It was just the first thing that popped in my head because my daughter was here yesterday and she likes Taylor too. So, yes. but... It has to be a wrestling song. Are we are we offering the the premium we offered back in previous karaoke's as far as fifteen to twenty five dollars? I just said those, yeah, five, fifteen, and twenty. No, no, no. Are we, are we offering the premium on those tiers? What I was asking you. Do you remember what I'm talking about? No, I do not. Bogo. So, no. Okay. No. The needs, I say. Okay. We only did that for Christmas. Because it was like, you know, it was the holidays. Yes, he's so close to hundred dollars that 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 payoff should get him a better marker to use next time. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> my writing utensil supply is not that great. I haven't had like my home office in months. No, that's that's valid considering you all the renovations you've done. I'm surprised the pens aren't strewn about the property somewhere. So. Noah, are you ready, good sir? Yeah, I get this over with. Oh, over with. This is not your first one, homie. You I was going to say, yeah. you've got at least two more that have been prepaid for that I know of. Good <laughs> sir. Hey, go until later. I'm trying to get through this damn game, so let's get this over with. Stupid Jack. <laughs> Rogue like poker my ass. There's no, but there's no better way to sell the karaoke show than, hey, let's get this over with. Yeah, That's exactly. It. Well, That's well. To be you fair, in Noah's case, it's the best sell in the entire world. No, it is. Yeah, I was going to say <laughs> Noah Actually. does that, and then people pick him to sell him out because they see how much he doesn't want to do it, or how he's so focused on other stuff. They're like, "Oh, okay, we're going to make you seen now." Mm -hmm. Noah just wishes they would act like his whip, and they should have said no, but they won't. So they'll keep, they'll keep so, on going. So here's what we'll do then, Noah. Do the man called Stain now, and then at the top of every hour, we'll have you do one of the ones that have already been prepaid. That way all whatever. you have to worry about is whatever comes through in the meantime. Whatever. Damn. <laughs> he's he's cold-blooded tonight, this guy. I'm saying... That's hey, even a, hey, that's even a he's fun he's song to do. Hogan, the man that the man that forced Sting away from the man called Sting theme, at least uh, at least you got the motivation here in the upper tier. Dwayne, if you do another five dollars separately, that would be the twenty-five, since it won't let you do twenty-five, and then you can do the pick your there you poison. Go. There you go, brother. There you go. So, Which I appreciate that. That is on my channel. Thank you, Dwayne. Hey, yeah. You so do Dwayne. another five there to Greg's channel, and then you can do the pick your poison, Dwayne. All right, yep. so here to sing the man called Steen, whether he likes it or not, is the simple man <laughs> with the spectacular voice, uh, Noah Foster. <laughs> this past his freaking themes back in the what the hell was this 80s? Yes, sir. Man, actually, man called Sting was from like 
mid like actually it was the last one he used so like uh, up to 96 i think it started like in 93 or 94 Yes, yeah, so it on like the WCW Slam Jam album or some shit like yeah, that. Yeah, because yeah, because the, the 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 one he used the most was the damn. Let's damn, be damn, real; damn, damn, those damn. songs were beyond cheesy as hell. Like even the Sting one, bro. Like holy. Oh crap. yeah. I mean, I mean, Noah has lyrics in front of me. We're gonna hear just how cheesy the man called Sting theme is. Just by oh itself. yes, yes we are, yes we are. Person feels like they cracked their voice without a heart attack. Yes, uh, you're not wrong. See, I bet I bet Paul would know every single word to this song. Yeah, probably accurate. That's accurate. <laughs> Freaking give a guy rainbow face pain and a guitar riff, and all of a sudden it's a wrestling character in the '90s. Well, Ultimate this Warrior, did it too. <laughs> Ultimate Warrior did it too. He actually played guitar, Jim Hellwood. What did he? Mm -hmm. Do you do it well though? Because otherwise, it'd be very much Jim Helwig anyway. I gotta say, no. the, the, playing is one thing; quality of playing is another. Yeah, well, he did play his theme song, but he, he at least know the chords to do a good theme song. For Fair that. enough. If his guitar, if his guitar playing was as good as his wrestling, then that's why we haven't seen him play guitar. Um, <laughs> yeah, that's put in the freaking judge here. Full heel Hogan, give no fucks tonight. Yeah, go, yeah, yeah no oh, All right, that's fair. All right. Ready, brother? Yeah, there it is. Man. All oh, right. Long guitar riff. <laughs> it is a long guitar riff. Down, down, down. Down, down, down. The man right. called Sting. Down, <laughs> down, down, down. The man called Sting. <laughs> Ooh. The man called Sting. <laughs> the man called Sting. He does this. He does that. <laughs> Big as a bull and quick as a cat. He looks fine. He looks cool. Ugh. He's a man and he's nobody's fool. Don't double cross him or get in his way. Because if you do, you're going to have to pay to the man called Sting. The man called Sting. He's a man called Sting. <laughs> called Sting. He's not like anybody else. Yeah, if the friends help. ever need him, he's there to help. And all the kids, they go wild. And all the old people start to act like a child. Don't double cross him or get in his way. Because if you do, you're going to have to pay to the man called Sting. I love this. He's a man called Sting. Man called Sting. He's a man called Sting. He's a right, man bro, you're good. called Sting. Right, man, yeah, no, you're, you're good, good, bro. bro. You don't got to go. That's enough of that. They repeat bro. that shit over and over again. No, God. no, can I? No, can I be real with you, dude? I did Fuck. not expect that screaming falsetto to come from you, bro. That was dope. that was good like, shit. Yeah, right? that was fantastic. Like, I, 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 I popped with that. Such good shit. Seriously, for and somebody dude, who doesn't want to do this, like you hit that perfectly. And just to entice the audience to stick around, if that didn't scare people away, right? Coming up later in the show, Noah's going to have to sing and do the dance to Rodas Clay, somebody call my mama. Yes. So Fuck is on a roll, stay kids. tuned Fuck for that, baby. Yeah. Yeah. But for uh, real, for anybody that has not okay. I'm I'm going to encourage this against my better judgment. Find the WCW Slam Jam album somewhere on YouTube. That is the least cheesy song on there. Yeah, for real. Yes, yes, and it's still it's still ridiculous. It's By still god awful, but that is the best song on the whole album. Yeah. Can we, can if we you, oh, go ahead. If you if you hearken back eleven years to Mick Foley's Hall of Fame induction, and he talks about Ricky Steamboat's theme going loves his wife and kids and does the best he can. That is legit. That is legit the lyrics of that goddamn song. Yep. Now, now I want everybody on camera for this because we're going to talk about one set of lyrics that Noah just Everyone read off. On and camera, bro. What's up? I'm, sa I'm saying, like, face two. He said, the, the Sting song said, yes. you better not double cross me. Uh, All the double crosses. All the double crosses. Who wants to tell Sting <laughs> Steve's okay. been double-crossed as many times as Big Show has turned face and heel. I'll be right back, guys. 
I'll be right back. Okay. Oh, God. That was hilarious. Right. That's All the right. first so, thing that came to my head. Uh, so, Dwayne has now paid $25 for Pick Your Poison. Dwayne, you need to let us know who you're picking and what song you want us want him to sing. What we'll do is we'll go to some spins because Arlene sent money for 10 spins to my channel and 10 spins to Jeff's channel. So we will start doing those while Jeff is gone. That's a very powerful right. joker, actually, as long as I don't have a Do stupid even... two in my hand. <laughs> there is the name wheel. You can see everybody is on there twice. There is Super Chatter's Choice, and I have been told from Arlene that if Super Chatter's Choice comes up on any of her spins, we, the panel, get to pick who sings. Ooh. Since, obviously, she's not going to be around to be able to make that decision. Uh-oh. I see. So well, we, we already know who that's going to be, so. So we will do five at a time, just so we don't get overloaded. Let's do it. This shop sucks. Wow, well, what, what shop? Wow, we got a Walter. And I just noticed Attila's name is on there, and she is not here. Yet. So let me go ahead and remove her name until she shows up. I think Maddie is, is supposed to show up. Uh, I think Maddie is going to be gone too because he said he going to yeah, the bathroom yeah. for a hot minute. Unfortunately, so you might want to remove him at some point. Oh, God. If you don't come back, I give it like at least fifteen, but you never know. Yeah, if he it said, lands on he Maddie, just give it to me. Okay, yeah. so we have there Walter for the first one. Do I? Oh, we got Jeff. Jeff. You named Jeff. So I am okay. here. I am not busy, no, no. but I am. You're you're good, Jeff. We're just doing the spins right now. Oh, okay. Got it. Oh, hi, Jeff. Hi, hi. hi Jeff. Name number three. Oh. Is Josh? All right, good, because he's, he's here, so that's good. Name number four. Two pairs are actually pretty effective. It's oh. me. And the last one for the first set. I don't know if you missed it, Jeff, but I'm only doing five at a time for our lead students. No, that's fine. I appreciate that. It gives us, gives us more to do. Maddie. Oh, geez. Well, we'll give so, it some time. <laughs> well, yeah, he's last. So we've got four other people that got a scene before him. And if he's not back, I'm taking his, remember? Yes, that's I know. Right. Yeah. All right. So, Walter, you get to pick a song that was a WrestleMania theme song. All right, a WrestleMania theme song. Yep. All right. Jeff, you get a TNA theme. By the way, if you were supposed to share the screen, we don't we don't see it. Oh, I thought I clicked to share that one. Yeah, I, I just wanted to clear it up now, just so that was made evident. <laughs> oh shit! I must have hit stop sharing instead of share this tab. That's my bad. Yeah, no, you're fine. I could have swore I, I hit. You make that share mistake all the time. I make that mistake all the time. All right, Josh. Yes, good sir. You See it. Get an ECW theme. Okay, I don't know any ECW themes. Do uh, you know Enter Sandman? No. There. I'm okay. No well, I, okay. Uh, hang, 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 hang on. on. Yeah, hang on. There. Hold on. There. Let's just finish these spins real quick. I get I a Hall of Famer. <laughs> and Maddie, if he gets back in time, 
or Josh, if Maddie doesn't get back in time, we'll do a Hall of Famer. Okay. May may I ask a question real quick? Yes. Does EC the WWE version of ECW their show's theme song count? Uh which one? Their last one. Hey. Don't question my heart. Yeah, that one. Yeah, I'll allow it. It was the yeah, ECW yeah, okay. theme. Okay. How do you? Okay. If that's yes, you know, Walter was. And James, to be clear, I never really watched. No, him. I know. I was just about to say, you know, he's the youngest here. When he's he just the baby. baby. But he knows that. Yeah. How the last he's not to even not enter Sandman, Sandman. bro. I am the baby. No, Why come now, Pantera. <laughs> I started watching wrestling right when WWE ECW. That's not wrestling. That's a Metallica again. song, dog. Like, what are you it doing doesn't. to me? I don't it listen to Metallica. You're fuck. You're a fuck out of my studio. <laughs> <laughs> fuck that shit in the ass. You better hope my wife isn't watching it here. Oh, there he is. Mr. Right man for real. Oh. No, that okay. was me removing oh, okay. her. Okay. That, was, uh, no, that was JJ having a comedic time. And yeah. Even yeah. my son, who is trapped in the the abyss of hell that is his mother, shamed you for that one. Good Lord. Oh, my oh. God. Look, even my 15-year-old daughter knows most of Enter Sandman. Like, she doesn't know every single word, but yeah. at least she knows Metallica and knows, like, the melody. All right. If I ask her how does Inner Sandman go, she'll sit there and at least go. Do, 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 you know what's gonna be awful? You know what's gonna be awful? We say, well, did you know that Motorhead did a cover, uh, did a song called Enter Sandman, and then Josh was like, yeah, oh, I know that song. I would have face right. if he did. All right, good. Yeah, good. we're safe there. Yeah. We're safe yeah. there. <laughs> Motorhead, Motorhead, well, Motorhead. Time out. We're getting carried away. Yeah, yeah. We have certain people for a limited time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Walter, are you ready? Mm-hmm. All right. So kicking us off here for this first rotation, doing the theme song for arguably the greatest hype package in WrestleMania history. My way by yeah. Limp Biscuit for WrestleMania 17. Here is Mr. Reliable himself, Walter Cruz. Check, 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 check out my melody. Special. Check, melody, my melody. You think you're special. You do. I can see it in your eyes. I can see it when you laugh at me. Look down on me and walk around on me. Just one. More fight about your leadership, and I will straight up leave your shit. Cause I had enough of this, and now I'm pissed. Yeah, this time I'ma let it all come out. This time I'ma stand up and shout. I'ma do things my way. It's my way, my way of the highway. Woo! There I can we see go. the Rocky Stokes faces doing that hype thing. Oh man, that whole right. package right now. <laughs> yeah, my favorite part of that promo too. I could just see Deborah being inserted for no reason in that promo. <laughs> <laughs> Jeff, you're right. muted. Jeff, you're still He's muted. Trying. He's still trying. He's trying. Oh. Okay, he may be doing voice text or something. Talk to text. Oh, I, see. I, see. <sighs> I thought he was talking. <laughs> no, 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 I am now. Okay. Yeah, I... Je- Josh has put a message in the private chat that he does need to go sooner rather than later. So if we can do his first one, then we'll probably throw to Jeff, and then he can do the one for Maddie. That way he's got at least a little bit of a break in between songs. Mm -hmm. And then I'll just close this out since I'm 
running everything here. That way I have a little bit more time to figure out what I want to do. So here to do the WWECW theme song is Josh Mansfield, the Melter of the Multiverse. Screw Melter. <laughs> and we appreciate that, Sean. Yeah, what the hell, Sean? You look for trouble. You're going to see that you, your words are dangerous. Your talk is cheap. So now I'm standing here. Now I'm standing here. You tell yourself you know what to do when you realize that I'm coming for you. Then you change your mind and run like a child. Well, you see me standing here. Now I'm standing here. Don't question my heart. Don't question the fire that burns inside. Don't question my heart. Don't question a heart prepared to fight. Oh, 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 what? What? It is the new very ECW. Nice, very nice, very nice. Yeah. Probably one of the only good things about the new ECW. Thing. That's like, yeah, I, the, that, I will say the uh, Marilyn Manson's The New Shit was way better, though. I will say that. I will stand by that. Yeah. Um, yeah, WWE did not have a problem with their theme song, that's for sure. Um, by the way, of all people to comment on our video right now, Sean's View Entertainment is not who I expected to be on. Our, our right? right hey. Well, what's up, Sean? How you doing, we'll bro? Take it. We'll, we'll take, take it, brother. Love. Again. Thank you. All right, Jeff, who are you doing for TNA? Specifically for our man with the spectacular voice, Jeff shall perform Jeff. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, boy. All right, everybody, give him the wee woo intro. One, okay. Two. One. Wee woo. Wee woo. Wee woo. Wee woo. Wee woo. I got him here right now. Just give me a second. <laughs> this earth is not your place. No pale skin is on your face. If you step inside with me, you will see a king. He ain't dead. He ain't the rock. Don't want to hear your big mouth talk in my world. My world. In my world. My world. My world. My world. In my world. My world. I get high. Well, early. I was early. That's okay. We're done anyway. So. <laughs> you, you Tina, the the TNA theme. We're here. We're no, we get to the Jeff Jarrett theme first, right? Saying that. That's true. That's true. The leader of the NWO at one point, by God. And, and it even came with a dedication. Huh? How awesome is that? I what? am just. I am just the host gift that keeps on giving. By God. That's true. That's true. Anyway, dead, that was really rugged. but that's okay. He ain't uh, dead. He ain't the rock. Don't yeah, I, I, because that's that, that, because that's the right lyrics. Amen. Amen. He ain't Jack. Freaking pussy's not. Oh, we're pissing off Johnson. Fuck you guys, dude. Like, he was, dude. I think the rock heard that that was said once, and he's like laughing about it. It's like that's right? hilarious. Yeah, that's hilarious. I would have done the same thing. You know. Oh, let him do it now and fuck around and find out what the rock moody's in right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the final boss will whip him with a belt and be like, Mama Jared's right? gonna find out real quick. <laughs> oh, like, Mama Karen, Mama Karen, Mama Karen, you like that, huh? Oh, Jesus. That yeah, would be no. funny. Anyway, Rock's right. gonna get his jabroni ass beat in a week. Nope. Oh, no, he's going Iron Cheek. Well, uh, he'll okay. be fine. Okay, yeah, Rock, yeah, Rock probably isn't losing that tag match. Nor is but... Roman. No. Oh, no. Blood Runs winning that tag. Anyway. But Roman's getting his ass beat yeah. next, uh, next right. week. WrestleMania predictions later this week. Yeah. Yep. For, for, for everybody in the room. <laughs> Depends what day, because Tuesday's my birthday. I don't know if I'm doing anything that day. If you're going to be part of any stream, including WrestleMania itself, Josh, you can say, I pick these people. Go along with the stick and do your next damn song. Yeah. yeah. So oh, the up. next one that Josh is going to be doing, he'll be subbing in. For Maddie Laws, and he has to do a Hall of Famer theme song. Which theme song are you going to be doing? Okay, and, and be before we get to that, I have been 
messaged by Dwayne what his pick your poison is for the twenty five dollars. Oh, yes. I saw it. You did because he messaged me directly. You saw. I, I I saw it in the YouTube chat at least. Oh, okay. I oh, didn't okay. see it pop in there. I didn't either. No. So <laughs> for everybody it's... else that missed it, then he wants Greg to do Swerve Strickland's theme with the Prince Nana dance. No. Yeah! Oh, yeah. oh no. <laughs> oh, that is, that All is I gotta quiet. say, James. All I gotta say, James, is after I do mine, we'll throw to Greg for that. Make sure you timestamp so you can clip that shit. Oh, my yes. God, bro. Hell yeah. White boy, man, we, should, we, should, we should force Josh to do Hulk Hogan since he didn't contribute anything to oh, the yeah. wrestling Mr. Hall of Fame. Yeah. I already did Hulk Hogan's theme. He did do when we Hogan. did the Hulk yeah, Hogan did Appreciation did. Night. Did. You did. You did. He did two American Hulk Hogan. instead. Before but Jeff we... starts to super chat his own channel. That's true. JJ just said it. You could do the WCW. American <laughs> can. I don't know the WCW version. Okay. Which Hall of Famer theme are you going to do, sir? Edge. That's kind of what I figured for you. Knowing that you had a Hall of Famer, too, I looked up somebody a little bit less obvious. So, yeah. are you doing Metalingus? Yeah. Are you doing Never Gonna Stop? Or are you doing the other side for the Judgment Day since he was their leader for a while? Metalingus, duh. Okay. Don't dumb me. It's not that uh, obvious of a choice. I'm yeah, sorry. you got choices. Tired. So here to do Metalingus, <laughs> the Edge theme, the Meltzer of the Multiverse, for his farewell performance, Josh Mansfield. On this day, I see clearly everything has come to life. A bitter place and a broken dream and we'll leave it all leave it all behind <laughs> on this day it's so real to me everything has come to life another chance to oh gosh <laughs> He's getting so into the song that he's coughing. Yeah, that's going to be it. I'm sorry. I'm losing my voice. <laughs> it's all he, good, bro. He got metalingus and got COVIDingus. Goddamn. <laughs> that's okay. I've never, I never heard metalingus so, sound so opery. James? <laughs> that was great. I had to sing an eight-minute long chant tonight. I'm no, I've, I've, I, I've, I believe it, brother. I believe it. We would like to thank Josh for popping in and singing the theme of the Rated R Superstar tonight on the show. <laughs> Yes. First dog. Yes. Full transparency to the viewers at home. Josh originally was not going to be here tonight, but we called in a favor. He came and he hung out with us for just a little bit. Good Catholic church boy has got multiple services tomorrow for Easter. So we're going to go ahead, let him take off. I, I see the super chat. Josh, do you have anything that you would like to say before you take off, or would you like to chill your shit here? Follow me on take, Twitter there. Farewell? Oh, yeah. Follow me on Twitter there. Follow me on Instagram there. Have fun, everyone, making Noah mad by your singing like Emmanuel's doing right now with that beautiful super chat. Uh, Noah, love you, buddy. And to Maddie, my buddy, I okay. love you. Even though you're on the shitter right now with food poisoning. So, thank you all. I am tired. Good night. Happy Easter. Holy Take shit. Take it easy, Mansfield. To pair carrots. So, uh, uh, JJ, right. major ding, ding, ding. Yes, I see ding, that. Ding, ding, $60 ding, ding, ding. super chat from Emmanuel. Has Noah been behaving... The Lord tells me he hasn't because he doesn't believe in Chase U. Oh, More oh. random spins since there isn't enough seeing. All right, so $60 worth of spins is 12 spins. On Thank top you, of the 15 that we still have for our lean. Damn. <laughs> so we've we've got plenty of spins here. So Something tells I me it's going to be a long next. night. 
Yes. I am going next. And I, full transparency to the viewers at home, once my woman goes to bed, I will still be here, but I will no longer be seen. Yeah. Happy wife, happy life. I ain't trying oh, no, to get gutted real. like a tauntaun tomorrow. So, you know. Yeah. Make sure you take your name off the wheel so we don't have the redundancy then. Yes. Actually, thank you for saying that right now. I will go ahead and remove Josh yep. and Maddie yep. before I do my performance. That's a red that's Joker. I can't use that. Duh. <laughs> this may be the most clipped Noah show I think we ever do. Dude, it was it, it was like that with uh, the Christmas show too, where it was playing the that's switch. That, that was, was great. Well, nothing will right. ever beat the Bell into Rainmaker thing. Like, I don't think anything will ever beat that, that ever. Was, that was hilarious. <laughs> that was unintentionally the most golden thing of all time. Hi, so, right, Jay. I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna ask Greg since he is the game show guy if he would like to give me the introduction for my song. Ooh, I will be what? doing the Big Boss Man Hard Times. Yes. Ladies and gentlemen, performing the WWE Golden Era Classic, Hard Times, from the Big Boss Man. He is the renegade of wrestling, Mr. J.J. Williams. <clears throat> if you ever take a trip down to Cobb County, Georgia, you better read the signs, respect the law and order, you serve hard times. Bow, bow, bow. Hard times. Hard times. You know the big boss man will make you walk the line. You better watch out, boy, or you'll be serving hard time. Hard time. He carries a big stick and a ball and chain, too. If you're looking for trouble, he'll be coming after you. You'll serve hard times. Bow, bow, bow. You'll be serving hard times. Bow, bow, bow. You know the big boss man will make you walk the line. You better watch out, boy, or you'll be serving hard time. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Hard times. Thank you, Greg. Very well done there. Thank you. Hopefully I'll... you are ready now to swerve when you drive. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> Unofficially, oh JJ, that was an attitude era theme for one night. It was. What's up? Unofficially, Hard Times is an attitude theme for one night. Yeah, it was. Yeah. All right, so ladies and gentlemen, here oh to my God, scene, Swerve Strickland's Big Pressure Remix. <laughs> the sure Pennsylvania enough. sensation himself. Oh, my God. The longest reigning wrestling trivia challenge champion greg perry man, this man is a legendary trivia of mine he's doing the nana dance i'm just throwing that shit out there y'all dude oh my god oh. and i better see everybody in the green room doing swerve, it so swerve. Put you on screen here we go swerve 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 garmin hot break Oh my god! Big pressure, I got in the ring, you won't survive. Yeah, I swerve when I drive. Yeah, I swerve when I drive. Yeah, I swerve when I try to beat me. You lost your mind. Hot rope, catch your body. Oh, what? In the ring, you won't survive. Yeah, I swerve when I drive. Yeah, I swerve when I drive. <laughs> What's your mind? All right, that's good. No! What the hell? Craig! You have your good like that, brother. Craig! Are you kidding me? Do you body that? Dude! Dude, I was going to call him out for having the whitest guy in the room do that, but fucker did pull it off. I was oh. not expecting that at all. Breathe. Holy okay. shit. Gabe, uh, right. make sure you clip that, bro. Yeah. Bro, somebody bro, make sure you clip that, bro. Yeah, bro, for real, bro. No, and not only that, he got the cadence down like oh, yeah. perfectly oh, yeah. as well as he's doing the shit. 
Dude, dude, no, this is like bro. a game show. Greg does not fuck around with this stuff, man. No, dude, dude, I forget. You know, sometimes I forget that Greg is like, oh, no, I'm a, I'm a fucking do this right, and then he does it right, yeah. and then it's like nope. shit. This you is stuff you could see every Wednesday on the Greg Cherry Show. For the longest time, Greg had a random wheel, and with the donation, I believe it was ten dollars, you got mm-hmm. a spin yep. of the wheel. He would do yep. wrestlers' entrances. He would do karaoke. He would do yep. goofy shit Dude, like this. Made, this is shit you could have been seeing every Wednesday on his show. But no, <laughs> I, no I've no, made him do entrances a few times. Yeah. Yes, let's just. I do want to just say Ray this though. Ray Carey did the Val Venus entrance, complete oh, with towel. <laughs> yes. Okay. Yes. He, he, Much he, too. Much to Sean's chagrin sure. and my yeah. expectation of it, because it was funnier and fucking yeah. he called him out on it. Sean Ross Sapp was on the show when Greg did it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> kind of helped. Dude, no, it, it, well, here's the thing. So I'm sure it's usually goofy, right? Yeah. This was not yeah. goofy what he just did. He, no, it's he, the thing. he pulled it off. He nailed the whole thing. Like, it was, it was so good. Doing, dude, you thought he okay. would have been doing hip hop for years. So, All right. Greg, uh, Jay, Jay, a couple things before we move on to the next thing. Matt, if you would like me to do that song, that is a 25 for Pick Your Poison. Yes, JJ? Yes, sir. All right. You want me to do that song again? Because I haven't done that song enough in my 20 years of doing this shit. I'll do it again, for Christ's sakes. My God. Also, um, what was the other thing I was going to say? I saw. Oh, the next super test going to go to send James a tranquilizer. Do breathe, James. Ooh, sorry. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. Hey, listen, we already got Britt Baker to share a clip of Jack of all trades. This that week, so was why, why not get that was nuts, dude. Dude, I felt so bad. Like, cause like once 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 Chris explained, it, I'm like, okay, now it makes sense. But the fact that I had to listen again and Britt, God bless Britt, she didn't miss a beat. I miss her. I do. So, oh. mm-hmm. so, so that means we got Mick Foley. MJF and now Britt Baker endorsing the Jeff Meacham Network Multiverse of Media. So that's pretty we're, we're doing pretty good for ourselves, guys. I'm just hey, saying. Britt, I mean, Britt, Britt gave me an endorsement on the cruise just for the design of the shirt that somebody did based on Back to the Future. I'm not gonna, you know, spend a point and whistle the guy. Um, you know, he, she she was digging that shirt. So there you go. Statilla just popped in the chat room. She just got back to her hotel, let her rest and eat, and she will be here. All right. So awesome. There you go. And we'll do three. All right, right back so wonders of WonderCon. We are going to do our next five spins, which will finish up ten of our lean spins. The water, I mean, I'm gonna die here. It's like a, <laughs> take this damn ear. Right, so like the first guys. person that is going to sing. That's just being good. You don't forget we have Emmanuel's specific request too. So I know. Straight two pair. Walter. Straight two pair. Straight. I have Second not, up. I have not got those are specific straight. call outs. I think it would be easier to get through the wheel spins first. That's kind of why I'm not, doing that. I agree. Noah Uh-oh. has come up on the random wheel. He's actually gonna have to somewhat pay attention here now. Straight, two pair. Two pairs come up more often than straight. So we'll do two pair. Not, better off that. That's all right. Jeez. Yay! I got selected. Everybody's got their own so far. Yes, sir. Yeah, I think everybody will have sung at least one song now. That's awesome. There you go. You love to see it. Jeez, oh, peace. That's a large line. Super chat. Oh. All right, well, he's not. That She's not here. I know. Um, Give me a second. I, I a, have instructions. That's a Ooh, large. Good. That's a and stupid. the last spin for this round is. Blind. Walter again. Oh, okay. Well, there you go. Mm-hmm. Select. Play it. Share this tab instead. There, there we go. go. All right. So Walter's first song Full is house. going to be. Full house three of a kind, two pair. Arm <laughs> the random commentary in the background. The deceased superstar. Ooh, there you go. Full house three of a kind, two pair. I think that's Fripp's full. Noah is going to get... I played two pair ten times so far? That can't be right. (laughs) A deceased superstar. 
Noah, <laughs> Noah, pick somebody who has passed on to the beyond. Yes, Noah, pass. Uh, pick somebody who's passed on. Yeah. <laughs> James gets. Ooh, I I excited. Full house. A WCW theme. Ooh, Ooh. man. Flab dip, flab dip. Very <laughs> random uh, theme. Very random theme. Just do it. Super Chatter's choice, and again, I have instructions, so hold on. Yes. Okay. Gets a Hall of Famer. Ooh, okay. And Walter's second choice. Play that. An ECW theme. Yeah, James, either Barry Windham or Rick Rude, dude. You'll thank everybody. Will thank you later, either way. Barry Windham or Rick Rude. Okay, yeah. I had one in hang mind. On. Okay, hang on, JJ. What's the what's the super chatter uh, instructions? Okay, so I was told that if super chatter's choice came up, we could pick who sung. Ah, panel sing. Okay. So, looking at who all came up on the wheel. You know, Walter's got two, Noah's got one, James has got one. Mm -hmm. I would say in the order, the interest of fairness, it should be one of us in the top row because we weren't selected by the wheel. Valid. So out of the three of you in the bottom row, who would you rather seen, James? Who would you rather have seen of the three of us up here, me, Greg, or Jeff? Mm. I think I, I'm, I'm curious on, on how Greg sings, like with just okay. without dancing. So I'll go with Greg. Okay. Okay. And Walter, it's a Hall of Famer. Out Steve. of the three of us, up, up top, which may include dancing rather, anyway. There you go. Out of the three of us up top, Walter, who would you rather see sing, me, Greg, or Jeff? You're Greg. muted. Greg. Greg. Okay. All okay, right. Well, so, Greg, yeah. not to be rude, Noah's choice doesn't really matter because it's too. <laughs> Anyway, that's the majority. Noah, who would you like to see seen up on the top row? Me, Greg, or Jeff? Doesn't matter. Yeah, so. yeah I mean. Oh, no. Oh, so, no. Greg, pick a Hall of Famer, and you get to sing that one. So, Walter. Oh, crap. <laughs> Is that Super Chat directed towards Noah Emanuel? Oh, how the full house works. I don't barely get the full house. <laughs> Oh, no, he's having a bad day. Not only Emmanuel, is he having a bad day here, but he's having a bad day. Emmanuel, is that for Noah or is that for somebody else? Please Let's clarify because you didn't say. He will. He will. He, he'll answer momentarily. I'm sure. Yeah, he's at church. That's part of why he's not able to be here. Really. Well, no, I, I mean that's valid. Some people do the thing on Saturday instead of Sunday, so that's valid. Uh, these cards suck. <laughs> for Noah, I'm gonna. <laughs> no, Part one of no. donation, making sing his favorite, favorite song, song, which is "You Look So Good to Me," Billy and Shaq. Oh no! Well, that has it's to Noah. be a Noah. It has it's to be a Noah, Noah, right? Noah. But I just want him to clarify. Yeah, yeah that I, I have a, I have a feeling it might be that. And this, is be, this is gonna be Noah's darkest day. He's got to do freaking Brodus <laughs> Clay later than his Billy and Shaq. Oh my god. <laughs> And he's got to do that slammy song from like 1987. Oh God, yeah. Oh, the... I know I my know. first one was a deceased. Right. What was my second one? ECW. Uh, ECW. Okay. So any ECW wrestler, dude? Yeah. The different songs from the slammies and the one I gotta do out of context are just so what? The... So it's yeah. yeah. It's bad. I have mine. I have mine. I'm ready. Well, Hold Walter. On, it's Walter yeah. first. I know, I know. I'm just saying. I'm are you ready, Walter? For your deceased superstar? Who are you going to be doing so we can give you the proper introduction? I'm going to do myself. We call me Mr. Reliable. So I'm going to do Mr. Wonderful Paul Orndorff's WCW theme. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so here to sing the WCW theme for Mr. Wonderful Paul Orndorff. Mr. Reliable himself, Walter Cruz. All right. <clears throat> Wonderful. They call Mr. Wonderful. He knows he is so wonderful. And 
he knows it too. Hmm? Wonderful! <laughs> you call him Mr. Wonderful! You know you're so wonderful! And he knows it too! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that song is literally that on a loop for like five minutes. Yes. <laughs> and then, that's the whole song. Oh, Dude, my favorite All right. When he went reroll in like in like the first ending of that. Oh, but it I mean, worked. Be fair, somehow it worked. Him going reroll. I was gonna say that that whole, that whole theme in '95 was reroll to begin with, James. That's true. You know? <laughs> All right, <laughs> Noah. Which deceased superstar are you going to serenade us with, good sir? Oh, One God. Minute. How many freaking... Uh, uh, uh... Did Mr. Brody Lee's theme have lyrics? Yes. Yes, it did. Mm, there you go. No, it was like Join the Dark Order, then a bunch of dramatic reverb. Uh... No, no, that was that was Dark Order's theme. Uh, Brody's theme did have lyrics. Remember, he is a joker. He is a... That one. No, I don't remember that one at all, James. And I think there's a reason why that what? is gone. We're trying yeah. to figure up deceased because I'm not gonna lie, Big Boss was probably when I was figured about, but that's been done. Big Boss was always one of my favorite big dudes during our world WrestleMania watch alongs. Uh that's fair. deceased. That's fair. Deceased. Deceased. Who died? I'm so used to thinking about the living. Too uh, bright. <laughs> this is a test. This is right, a there test. You go, there you go. Oh, there you go. <laughs> right there. Uh, you know what? Here, here. Since he's not getting the Hall of Fame induction, we all wanted him. To, apparently, everybody wanted him to get. He's got the whole. Yeah, there you go. There there you go. go. <laughs> or his catching flies, whatever. It oh yeah, that's true. Right. Yeah. Flies or whatever he says. Yeah. I no, I forget what the title of the song was. I think yeah, it was I think it was like living in fear. Flies. Fine, I'll do that. I'll look yeah, it up. I, 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 you know, you know respect Bray yeah. Wyatt with the There you go. Perfect. The song was solid, no doubt about it. Like, like, like I said, people did. He got performed yeah. to the Reign of Mania too. That first year after they debuted, they performed WrestleMania at 30. I, I remember that. I remember. And he that. lost when he shouldn't have. I no, agree. No, no, don't don't remind me. Damn it. Do, uh, do, do, do. <laughs> Hang on. Now, here. Unfortunately, Living he's not fear. There. That's what it was. Yeah. It was living fear. Got I'll it. tell you what. If John Cena comes up, I'll do the Paul Heyman version of John's song. Just do something different. Oh God. <laughs> God. <laughs> you know, for technicalities, he could also do the Undertaker's theme. That is true. Oh, yeah, because he's undead. He's not wrong. That, he's not, he's technically he's not kind of, incorrect. Kind of well, right, but he's well, not. Okay. So wait, but if I, I, I'll just thing. do the Wyatt thing. I got it. I got it. I'm already listening to the intro. I'll just do the Wyatt thing. <laughs> Besides, I actually yeah, did job. care about like him. That, Greg. If we did Undertaker's theme, it had to be one with lyrics because then it has to be the you're yeah. gonna pay, and that'll just the only I'll do is make JJ go <laughs> for two minutes. Yeah, the only <laughs> one you really can do is rolling. Yeah. Well, you can do roll on that. I forgot about that. But, yeah, yeah, but brave. Badass, but, yeah. but but if yeah, if we're doing yeah. dead, it's gotta be one with lyrics. So that the only one we can do with lyrics is "Ain't No Grave" by Johnny Cash. I would love Which is slow. We'll be here for an hour. I'm about to say <laughs> that that is super slow, and I'm a Johnny Cash fan for life. Oh, yeah, yeah. For her, bring a fire. I wear all black. I love that. I, I I think that's still one of Undertaker's best entrances. How did they not use Great. Ring of Fire and some sort of synergy with the Ring of Fire match at SummerSlam? How is that not? I don't know. know. What the shit? Now you're actually talking about stuff I actually care about a little bit. All right, go ahead. Do the intro thing. I got the Bray Wyatt Limit Fear or whatever it is. Let's just get this done with so I can get back to this game. All right. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, here to do Bray Wyatt's Live in Fear. The simple man with that spectacular voice, Noah Foster. Without the rocking chair and the plaid and the freaking hat. <laughs> He's here. I can hear it. There you go. Catching flies in his mouth. Grace in freedom while he deaths, then calling back, back to the top, top 
of the stairs of the stairs <laughs> love that great you won't see the sun again for years to come he's broken out in love that is probably like a cat Blah! that's enough I love that. And that's probably Noah's like best like theme rendition always. I always love hearing him sing that. I know. I that's what I love about Noah is he hates doing this, but he's got one of the best voices on the whole fucking show. Like that's why so many people super chat him. Cause they know Noah can actually sing and carry a tune, and like me and Jeff. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah we're on. All right. Or Next me. Up, I can't carry a tune either. <laughs> Next up is James's WCW theme. What are we doing, James? <laughs> so, what's ironic is I'm going to be dropping a rap song soon, but <laughs> I am going to be doing the West Texas Rednecks Rap is Crap <laughs> theme song <laughs> from WCW 1999. <laughs> All right, so here to do the West Texas Rednecks rap is crap. Oh the Heap Man, James Hebert. Uh, well, I, I was trying to get the sawed out so I could stick with the damn thing, but then, I, then, I, then my search engine autocorrected the rap poop. I'm like, huh? wait, wait. This is not what I wanted. To... That's not what I'm trying to look up, you stupid. No. What the hell? That's a stupid ass large blind. What? <laughs> what, are you, what are you talking about? Don't uh, worry about no Noah's yeah. no wow. having Tourette's. Yeah. I mean, he's not wrong. He's not yeah. wrong. Noah's having card Tourette's. Don't mind him. <laughs> yeah, 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 true. <laughs> All right. I'm ready to go. Here we go. I got to wait for an ad, though. All right, here we go. There we go. All right. I like country music. I like country girls. I like Willie Nelson. And don't forget about Merle. There's only one thing that I hate. Because it's a bunch of crap. I, I hate, hate crap. crap. I like NASCAR racing. Rich Petty is still the king. That's true. Yeah, they Accurate. call me a redneck. But you know, that's a beautiful thing. There's only one thing that I hate because it's a bunch of crap. I, I hate crap. crap. There's only one thing that I hate, and that's one thing only I hate. Crap. There you go. <laughs> Yay, remix! Yay, remix! <laughs> Yay, remix. <laughs> Daniel's got wait. some great calls if those pop up. If NXT is on the wheel, Joe Gacy, Love is Blind, needs to get Hell gone. yeah, dude. I agree. It is a good song. And the good next song. song Noah should sing is Joe Hendry's. If Noah gets TNA, yes. that might be able to happen, Daniel. Or I think that's Super Chat $25 and make it yeah. happen that way. So I think, that would, away, I think that would be one theme that Noah would actually enjoy singing because, you know, speak his name and he shall appear. Because we believe in Joe Hunger. Or if Datilla's here, that uh, see, she's in the chat room. JJ should see Joe Hendry. I have actually <laughs> sung Joe Hendry's theme he before. Has. He has. <laughs> what we need is we need Noah and Datilla to do the Joya theme. Yeah, there you go. There you go. There I do. Go. And uh, just yeah. change it to Nola. Nola. All right, Greg, which Hall of Famer are you going to do? Well, I was originally going to do HBK, which would have been complete with dance, but I don't want to, you know, make James's mind explode. So no, uh, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. <laughs> well, no, I chose something else. I'm going to do uh, the Million Dollar Man's theme. Nice. All right. <laughs> All right. So here to do the Million Dollar Man Ted DiBiase's theme song is Greg Cherry. Good old teddy bear. 
Everybody's got a price. Everybody's gonna pay. a million dollar man. Always gets his way. Some might cost a little. Some might cost a lot. But I'm the million dollar man. And you will be bought. <laughs> Yeah, well done, Greg. Well done. Love it. I oh, love it. That's great. Uh, a little bit of trivia for everybody. The first autograph that my son Dylan ever got was his son, and the first uh, meet and greet he ever did was both the Well, there you go. There you go. Well, that's uh, probably going to do it uh, for me on the night because right. it's the East Coast. So appreciate that I could join briefly. And hey, we got we got this best. The version of the story I think I've ever seen on a on a wrestling podcast in the history of ever. So we'll take it. Shit. <laughs> yeah, that was tremendous. Uh, yeah, that'll. I expect definitely to see that clip on, on Twitter in the morning. I will. Oh, I'm sure, sure that it's done, and I will tag Swerve. I'd like immediately. So and Nana. And oh yeah. Nana. Damn it. All right. All right. Well, thank, thank you guys you very have... much, Greg. Do you want to shill for Wednesday? Oh, sure. Yeah. WrestleMania predictions are going to happen Wednesday. Uh, it's going to be me, Jeff, Maddie, if he's feeling well, and LJ. Nice. There you go. And we're trying to get the freaking graphic in there. He's trying to get the graphic. Oh, no. He's trying it's to good. get it. It's, good. It's, it's okay. Good. Where can everybody good. find you on socials? Uh, you can find me at Greg Cherrybrand right there on the screen. On pretty much any social ever. Twitter, Instagram, even though I post pictures there once a year. Uh, right. Tech Talk, go find me on Tech Talk. Good stuff. And of course, uh, the YouTube channel, the Greg Jerry Brand. There you go. All right, cool. Yes, there it is. Did it loaded, Jeff? I did. <laughs> Sorry. There, there we go. Is. Yep, there WrestleMania there prediction. There we go. This Wednesday, 7 o'clock Eastern. Join, yeah. it'll be fun. We, we're going to have him go at three and try to do the to, to not not interfere with uh, simply predicting, but with very it'll be okay. Yeah, we'll have a simulcast. It'll be great. Oh, there you go. <laughs> simulcast we'll the prediction shows now. We got so much shit going on. That's right. Overlap. Overlap. Right, well, thank you very much, Greg, for joining us and hanging out for a little bit. As always, you are welcome whenever. Yes. Yeah, we'll see shit. you guys on Wednesday for your prediction show. Sounds good. See you guys. Thank Happy you, Easter. Brother. Happy Easter, brother. Happy Easter. Damn it, couldn't get over the freaking wall. Dude, <laughs> I, when he was singing that, I was so tempted to be like, well, now the IRS has their day. <laughs> right. Yeah. I will I will say Greg did advertise me. I'm not sure I'm gonna be on that show because I do have my own prediction show on Thursday, but I'll I'll probably be if anything else, I'll be helping out in the control rooms so him and Maddie and Ella can do their thing. Oh, the predictions. Right. All right. Walter, are you sticking with the one you said in the private chat? All right. So for the ECW theme song, here is Mr. Reliable as he sleeps with one eye open, gripping his pillow tight. Yeah. Josh, here's your homework, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's true. Literally one eye open because something's going on with my right eye. <laughs> you got that get uh, you got that gas station with like the like the dude from the TikTok. <laughs> <laughs> it's hard to do Metallica. They have the longest intros ever to every song. <laughs> For real though. Say your prayers, little one. Don't forget my son to include everyone.
Don't. Tuck you in, one within, kick you free from sin till the sin man he comes. Sleep with one eye open, grip in your pillow top, exit light, enter night. Take my hand, we're off to never, never land. Well done, Walter. <laughs> All right. Now we're going to one of the prepaid pick your poisons. Noah, you are up, my friend. What? I will let you decide which one you do next because you do have two prepaid pick your poisons. You can either do Brodus Clay or you can do the Slammies. Which one do you want to do next? Brodus Clay don't even have knees. He didn't move or do anything. And yet he was still an NWA World Heavyweight Champion. We don't talk about... <laughs> His name's not Bruno, it's Brodus. First off, Disney. We don't talk Secondly, about bro. Who really is no, my blood? No, no. Third, the person that did that, you are wrong on so many levels. <laughs> God, that would that would be a manual. The freaking 1997. What bull crap? And, 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 hey, Brodus Clay did indeed dance. If you watch his Edge's Hall of Fame induction, them thighs is jiggling in that slow mo. He's moving. Yeah, well, yeah, he's it, he's he's moving. I've seen Jello with better moments up than Brodus Clay. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, I mean, it has to be Jello because Jam don't shake like that. So, <laughs> I mean, Brodus and his funkadactyl said, "I don't think you're ready for this jelly." <laughs> and one of those funkadactyls is wrestling on next Sunday and next Saturday or Sunday. God bless her. Yeah, 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 yeah. right. God bless you, yeah. Oh Lord. God. Hey, you know what? To be fair, Ariane. God bless her. She was at the Garcia Twins yeah. podcast and was super nice. Like she, she dug herself a bad rep. Not gonna lie with the the, the answers on tough enough, but she really is a sweetheart of a girl. So, <laughs> Just, so which one know. are we doing, Noah? Uh, you have the, to do this both tonight. This freaking slammy is a cover of some song. If you only knew. Well, I don't even know what the hell that song is. But it's not a it's cover. Good. That's a Jimmy Hart original they sung at the Slammies. Like, every you heel in the uh, company was on stage. Well, well, to be fair, a Jimmy Hart original might as well be a cover, just different different octaves. <laughs> <laughs> Would you not disparage the ageless Jimmy Hart? Yeah, okay. Uh, I guess I'll try <laughs> and do that so. if you only knew nonsense. All right. So here to do, if you only knew for the Slammies as prepaid – the hell? By Emmanuel Dominguez. This is actually a thing. Is actually going to be Noah Foster, but first. But first. <laughs> teleporting into the command center via the Morphin Grid, it is the Tilla. Hi. Hi. Hey. You were just in the command center to today. Noah sing a song from the 1987 Slammy Awards. Are you ready, Noah, for your solo? <laughs> he's not ready. He lost the ability to speak. <laughs> he's as ready to. as he's going to be. That's it. <laughs> he's, not he's not ready. This, like, the video of this is enough to make anybody go, like, have their brain. Oh, his mama. He's not no, doing not that yet. one yet. That will come Not out. yet. Not yet. I know. Yeah, no. Poor Noah. <laughs> Okay, He's now you're here, we maybe get you, get you some songs. They got prepaid, bro. They prepaid this shit and had it They on did. The they box. actually asked for these songs by name and for Noah specifically. These are some evil-ass people, but we love them anyway because they're contributors and they're good people. Hey, hey, yeah. they're not evil-ass people. They're just evil in one sense. They're good everywhere. Else. Oh, okay. I got it. I got it. I got you. Yeah. Hey, hey, you know what? They paid Bill for it. It's right now, so you can't say they're evil. That's bad. Don't bite That's a whole other show discussion right there. <laughs> I'm just saying. It is, isn't it? How you, do, how you doing, Noah? You trying to figure it out? This He's trying to channel like inner. This, this don't make a lick of sense. 
1987 WWE award show. I'm just throwing that out there, brother. I'm just, I'm just saying. <laughs> it's not cocaine was a powerful sense. drug back then. Cocaine okay, was a powerful drug, Noah. Dude, j- okay. I mean, when you remember that night, still a powerful drug, but back then it was just used a lot more. Yeah, ask uh, Cheeky uh, baby. Uh, yeah, at, at, oh fucking <laughs> let the poor Iron Sheik rest in peace. Well, yes. Yeah, but now we got we got fentanyl now. Wow, yeah. that was that. Okay, that one hit home. <laughs> okay, I'm good. I can't, I, can't, I can't even that one. Jesus. Okay. Wow. Now we got fentanyl. <laughs> Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to the I just had to the the hour, Dukes, uh, If you only knew, and that's it for this weird '80s shit. I guess so. For, yeah. for, for for this round, it's either the '80s song or the Brodus Clay theme. You're doing both eventually, but you just got to pick you pick the pick the the less poisonous one for now, so you can actually make it through to the next one. Yeah, that's true. I ain't, I ain't getting up and doing bro to shit. That's for sure. I'll look. I'll try and do the Xero. What's boys are favorite? I don't think you have to that. do the accompanying dance with it. Oh no 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 no! that though, James. Jesus God, are you trying to cause people nightmares? Got, 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 okay. He does. He dance. Does. Never yeah. mind. I I I'm stupid. I don't uh, know. Yeah, you are stupid. At least you admit it. All right, the, fine. Let's get this funny <laughs> nonsense over with. Yeah. You've got your close up. Oh God. So damn stupid. <laughs> You're not wrong. Oh my gosh, this is beyond stupid. All right, Let's see if I can actually find the lyrics of this damn thing. I guess that's it. <laughs> just clapping and swaying. I could just see Pretty they refresh their face. Or be the chatter, and that really does matter to me. This bird just standing still. A lot that's of you guys want to see me in agony. Fuck is this. <laughs> but the measure of a man understand is more than your common patter. It's the way I'll make you eat those words that matters. You've only knew what I'm gonna do to you. You'll be running out of here as fast as your feet could carry you. Your destiny belongs to me. You only knew. Woo! Fuck me, man. Thank God Virgil kept in care. I don't blame him one bit. That was something they did in the 80s. Fuck, yeah. people if you've never seen somebody back then. If you've never seen, oh, no, no. If you're seeing 87 Slammies, that song is the entire heel contingent of the roster on a, on a, on a, on a riser stage, swaying back and forth like they're Axl Rose and shit doing Guns N' Roses, doing uh, Sweet Child of Mine. Uh, They're all dressed in black tie. Some of them less than black tie. Rick Rude looks like a fucking Chippendale dancer on the stage, like for real. Well, I mean, anything he wore made him look like a Chippendale dancer, so that's not oh, shocking. Oh, that's valid, right. but they had King Kong Bundy in his singlet and a bow tie. Like, <laughs> sure. What? Sure, li- lyrics were never spoken then. They want to see me in agony because, no, that's what they do want to see with you. Yeah, they all, do want to see All I got to say is just hearing that description, I've got one thing to say. What the fuck? That's valid. That I That's hope valid. I am not bothered again after that shit, or my well, Wi-Fi gives to... out. That was all right. Worth a game. Eventually, Ugh. all right. <laughs> oh, where did Tilly go? No, Tilly went bye bye. Teleported out. Oh, she's back in. It's probably hotel yeah, Wi-Fi. Can... No, it's. I guess it's my can. Oh, okay. There it goes. No, I think. I all think right. you're also. I guess it's my connection. I'm going to connect to the Wi-Fi. I guess it's my connection. Okay. Man, always Maybe the way so. to go. All right. We've done quite a bit of singing here. We're going to take just a brief intermission. We're going to take a look at Noah's favorite commercial. And no, there is no sarcasm in that. This okay. is the most recent watch along trailer. Ah. Everything that we're going to be. Look, did you see the way his head whipped at the screen? Like, is that the interview? <laughs> this Michael is Myers. everything we will be covering. Starting with the Josh Barnett blood sport on Thursday and going all the way through the bash in Berlin. Exactly. Everything that we know we are covering. So, Noah, this is everything that you're going to be losing your voice to. Check it out. And now, preview time. So, let's take a look at what's coming your way.
pay close attention. So much, so much, so much, so much, so much. Yes, I love this business. All the wrestling, 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 all the professional wrestling. Damn it. And sports entertainment. But at least I find it more interesting than previous years before. That might have been the most hyped Noah's ever been for something like this. You're supposed to save your voice, not use it now. Right? Yeah, Team yeah, Mike in the chat room, all the wrestling, and Natalie got here just in time to see her what the fuck play. Right. Ah, that's great. Yeah. Welcome. There you go. All right. So, sweet baby Jesus, we still have ten more spins from Arlene, plus twelve from Emmanuel, mm-hmm. plus the other songs that Emmanuel prepaid for. My God, Jesus. we're still trying to get some confirmation on who needs to see Billy and Chuck. Yes, I messaged him privately on Insta. I'm waiting for a reply, but he is at church services, so he may not get back to us right away. If he doesn't get back to us before we are ready to get off the air, we may just have to save that performance until next weekend and the WrestleMania edition of Open Mic Night. Mm -hmm. So, we are going to do like we've been doing, five spins at a time. We have added Dottila's name back to the wheel now. Yes, who's back? Back Let me get my handy dandy notebook ready here. Handy dandy. Oh, sorry, go ahead. (laughs) Tell me I'm wrong, folks. All okay. right. First spin. Whee! Oh. Big wee. Big wee is with little wee. Oh, and it, and it lands on you. That shit's rigged. It, 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 it was attracted to his call. Well, yeah. Second I, spin. Whee! <laughs> 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 You're on one tonight, brother. I know, right? I'm wired. Choice. It's all right, man. Now just yeah, just to clue like. Attila in real quick, since Arlene prepaid for these, she is not here to actually pick. She said that we on the panel can pick who sings if the super chatter's choice comes up. Just mm-hmm. so we're gonna do the other spins. And then what we did last time is basically anyone that didn't get picked by the random wheel is up for grabs, and we let the rest of the panel vote. No one is safe. There we go. The spin number three is... Datilla. Hey! Okay, okay. Spin four... Four spins. Ah, ah, ah. Ah, ah, ah. Another detail. again. Wow. Okay. Getting her caught up for the right. time that she missed. Yeah, yeah. Pay okay, your dues, kid. And for this round is. Pay your dues. Oh. Noah. Oh, I'm poor Noah. <laughs> Noah, <laughs> this will. <laughs> That's not been kind to Noah, man. <laughs> no. ah! All right. And now for the choice wheel. James. Ooh. What do I get? I excite. What's that guy? I get a double double of easy. Okay. 
got so just for clarification, the reason why it's separated, WWE is basically anything after 2002 when we got the F out. Okay, okay. so so that, that makes sense. All right, cool. Now, if theme was used in either era, you know. Yeah, yeah. yeah the, the random person also gets a double WWE song. Oh. Why would I care the about Tilla's that? first song? Commentary is just tremendous back there. Yeah, love yeah. I love I love him doing like video game commentary. Random it's the shit, WWE right? song. Oh wow. WWE's been oh, a lot of love on 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 show WrestleMania week. Anybody? Anybody from 2002 onward? Yep. Yes. Yep. Yep. Okay. The Any way you want it. Song is another WWE song. Oh my oh, god! Man, the entire round of WWE. <laughs> da, 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 da. Somebody's watching. I swear it's not rigged. It's just like <laughs> the random here. At least there's no a lot of choices, though. The EW song. Hey, Antonio! <laughs> oh, no. I was here. You pay attention. Okay. Oh my god, I got so James, oh Attila, and Noah all got selected, which yes. once again meet, leaves the top row empty. That's right, top row gets no left. So, James, out of the three of us up on the top row that didn't get picked, who would you like to see same? I pick Jeff, Jeff. Okay, Attila, who do you pick? I pick you, okay. Oh, Noah, who do you pick? Uh... <laughs> Jeff, just cause why not? Oh, there All we right. go. So two for Jeff, one for me. All right. So any so WWE Jeff... theme from Get the F Out Onward. Okay. Yes. Okay. okay. All right. Let me see. I got to look for. I know. Well, what would have happened if he do, said Jeff? me and we tied it? <laughs> I know it's what you should do. What should I do? Jimi Hendrix, Voodoo Child. No, I had yeah, that. You're you wearing the whole I had that shirt. right up here in front of me. I was literally about to type in the private chat. Dips on Voodoo Child. I, I, you know what? I had the shirt on, so I was gonna. I was gonna. Oh, God, it was like... I, I fixed it. I fixed it. Okay. <laughs> I fixed it, man. Right for me. You fixed it, man. I don't get. You broken what? shit. That's awesome. Thank you, bitch. Uh, it would be twenty five dollars. I was gonna, uh, dude. I was literally about to. I like. I wanted to voodoo child so bad, dude, um, dude. Your daughter has evil intentions. I do not like this. Oh no! She's probably got evil intentions for me. I, I, I said what I said. Oh, but it is twenty five dollars, sweetheart, to pick Where's somebody my... and what song they sing. Here, buds. I gotta get the right to. Gotta get Jimmy in my ear to do this right, damn it. All right, so I, I, I'll, I'll pick something else, All right. I guess. Damn it. <laughs> I was sad. I'm sorry, bro. Like, I was literally having, I literally just shirt. got the lyrics up. Oh, no. Yeah, I I'll figure it out. Oh, I know. What's, I know. Really, what's, what's really funny about the Hogan NWO theme, the, the Hendrix theme, I had a copy of it years ago that I found on YouTube that had the NWO calls in it. Right, and Look. then it got deleted, but now it's back up there, so I can find that and play it. Go ahead, James. Nice. James, since you are the prelude to Jeff, you fucking Eric Bischoff, I'm back. Yes, <laughs> oh, that's a good one. Yeah, I'll do that. All right, Bischoff yeah. and Hogan, like, come on, that's fair. Oh, that's man. fair. That makes sense. That makes sense. Now, which one do we go with? Because at one point, he was supposed to have back in black, that was his unused team. Are we going he with he's been a couple times? He did. He did. He did no, a couple no, times. Do, so. do the I'm back, though. Okay. All right. Yeah. I do I'm back. And I can't believe what is hilarious to me. He used it in the WWE, right? I'm not tripping on that, right? Briefly. Briefly. Yeah. yeah. Like, and then, and like, then they're like just the first, like, nah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. The first, like, two or three weeks, he did it. Yeah. I was sad. I was sad that, that went away. Uh, Natalie yeah. said, all right, bet. Hold on. With an evil devil emoji. Oh, no. oh, God. No. <laughs> that time someone else gets attacked by super chats besides me, y'all freaking don't know how to hold your freaking money during tax season, daggum idiots. Huh? Noah, Noah has a hold your money thing for every season. He's got tax for the spring. He's got Christmas and, and uh, Thanksgiving for the fall. 
For summer, it's <laughs> take some vacation, you dipshits. You know, whatever. Yeah, don't, don't talk to your kids. That's, that's, right. that's right. Don't you need to, back, to go to the back of school sale to Target, you jackoffs? Damn it! Fucking do the rock. It's cooking, Dan. Let's do that for 20 right. minutes. The rock says. The rock. <laughs> the rock. The rock says. Well, luckily, luckily for me, post two thousand two, they don't they don't use that theme no more. So. Hey, I'm oh not gonna God. lie. When I was looking up Hall of Famer, I almost did the Nation of Domination theme. Oh my God. We are the nation, live and in color. <sighs> Gotta get the backwards black cap and the the stupid like douchey goatee that Wolfie was sporting. James, oh, are you God. ready? Oh, I'm I'm ready. I got fun. All right, okay. Are you doing this off? Uh, do I? I guess I have. You to. have to. You have to. I, I, do I, not I have to? received okay. confirmation from Emmanuel. Ah. Billy and Chuck is for Noah. Ah, oh, for no. Noah. oh no! <laughs> oh no! So here to scene, Eric Bischoff's. I'm back. All right, well, the Heat man, James Hebert. I was I was gonna go against the grain and go with the Orlando Jordan thing, but I'll I'll do Eric Bischoff. Why not? <laughs> I was gonna go. Uh, uh, uh oh! <laughs> if WWE comes up again, we'll let you do it. Uh, yeah, yeah sure, that, sure. But... Oh lord! As, I'm underrated song. Just. Shit wrestling. <laughs> be honest. Okay. Here we go. <clears throat> I'm back. And I'm better than ever. Got a knack. For making things better. Face facts. Cause your opinion no matter. This maniac. Is gonna step on whomever. Oh, it's yeah. time getting long, cause I'm making some changes. Kicking ass, taking names, cleaning house of the famous. <laughs> I'm burning down the dead wood, burning down time, cause the only way is to get your ass in line. Nice. Nice. Well That's done. Awesome. Jane. Thank you. Take the bow. Take the bow. All right. Here to follow that up with Voodoo Child for Hollywood Hulk Hogan. The man, the myth, the legend, the West Coast professor, Jeff. Motherfucker. It's too damn long. I love Jimmy, but that's too long. <laughs> There you go. I did a little guitar for you. Stand up next to a mountain. I chop it down with the edge of my hand. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Uh, <laughs> yeah, uh -oh. There we go. Uh -oh. There we go. Well, I stand up next to a mountain. Woo! Chop it down with the edge of my hand. I lose my throat in the process. So I look whiter than I did before. <laughs> Well, I pick up all the pieces and make an island. Might even a waste of a little sand. Yeah. Because I'm a voodoo child. Lord knows I'm a voodoo child, man. Long ass guitar solo. That's Jimi Hendrix, too. Very nice. They're very nice. Very nice. And <laughs> all right, Datilla, you are up. All right, what is your I, first WWE thing going to be? The first one is going to be Trish Stratus, Time to Rock and Roll. Yeah, yes. there you go. All right, Here wait, how much do, do I sing of it? Just the first two verses? Uh, first verse that song, yeah, yeah, yeah. First okay, yeah, because this is a long one. Okay. All right. Well, if you're not going to appear on camera, I'm not going to worry about a solo shot for you. So. Yes. Oh, I don't here... know. This thing keeps turning on and off. No, no that, right. that that happens. If if you're yeah, on the I mean, window, don't worry about it. Yeah, no, it's good. not a big deal. I'm just saying. So, here okay. to sing "Time to Rock and Roll" by Little Kim, the theme song for Trish Stratus, the Tilla. Okay. 
goes, whoa, it's time to rock and roll. This time I'm in control. Whoa, right now I own the streets. I got the keys to the city. That's because I get down. Sometimes I wonder how I made it this far with all these people hating on me. Y'all know who you are. Take a chance and try to come out in this game, being a star. Now I own the keys to a brand new fancy car, baby. It's my turn to burn, and I'm here to rub it in your face. When will you learn I'm the queen, and I'll put it, I'll put you in your place. Woo! Yay! All right. <laughs> I was doing the point, like Tris does, like you know the point. Oh point, yeah. Point, point thing. When she does the satisfaction. Yeah. Okay. Point to the crowd. That's the satisfaction. There you go. Yeah. There you go. Do you know what your second song is going to be? Not yet. So, okay. Noah can go while I look for a second one. Perfect. Noah, what is your theme song going to be for AEW? Hmm. Well, no doubt. Okay. I'm a curly headed moron. No, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck was that? I have no idea. <laughs> I don't recognize that at all. Well, uh, I mean, uh, 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 whatever. Orange Cassidy, I guess. <laughs> oh, yes. oh, nice. What's so one? here to sing Jefferson Airplane's Jane, the theme for Orange Cassidy. Nice, dude. The Solid simple dude. man with the spectacular voice, Noah Foster. Let's see if I can actually find the. Okay. <clears throat> You got the lyrics up, right, on that one? Yeah, it's just, you know, it's got the long guitar intro, as yeah, they do. As it should, damn it. <laughs> Jane, you say it's all over for you and me, girl. There's a time for love and a time for let me be, baby. Jane, you're playing a game called Caught hard to get by its real name. Making believe that you still don't feel the same. Oh, Jane. There's something about that guitar that just is a great walking tune, even if you don't have pants with pockets. I, sure. know, I do it all the time. Jane, you're playing a game. You never can win, girl. You're staying away, just us, you, where you, where you been, baby. Like a cat and a mouse. Cat and a mouse. Close the door to door and from house to house. That's all what I'm talking about. Woo! All those nights we spent together. Hey, hey. Only because you didn't know better. I want to know, Jane. You're playing a game. You're playing a game. You're playing a game. Wow. Damn. Wow, that was beautiful. Wow, that was great. Damn. That was awesome. Brought a tear to my eye. With a tear in the eye. <laughs> oh my god. Um I just realized how does it fit with Orange Cassidy again? <laughs> is this fan that he always yeah, uses on the independence? Yes. Oh, is that the theme song he I, I like the theme he had prior. Oh know. yeah, the whole where, where is, is my mind? Where yeah. is my mind? Yeah, dude, it's a it, it fits well with him. It really does. It does, because I do wonder where that man's mind is sometimes. Then again, I sometimes don't know where my own mind is. So there you go. I've yeah. never heard him use anything other than Jane the entire time I've been watching. Keyword, you've been watching. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> That's why I said it that way, damn it. Come on. <laughs> Jeez, bro. No one's got to uh, scale no back on the damn, man. Yeah, Lord almighty. Um, did we finish that round? We start one more for Attila. No, we still have Attila's second okay. one. Okay. 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 What is your so, second WWE song going to be, Attila? AJ Lee's Light It Up. Nice. Oh, nice. I know Natalie's going to like this one. 
here to do let's light it up for aj lee detilla let's light it up light it up light it up light it tonight let's light it up like shooting stars will burn and light up the sky let's light it up light it up light it up light it tonight let's light up let's light it up tonight like the night like the diamonds as they shine in your eyes light it up light it up light it tonight <laughs> let's light it up like shooting stars will burn and light up the sky let's light it up light it up light it up light it up right on. let's light it up I love it. Let's- Let's light it up like the night, like the night, like the diamonds as they shine in your eyes. Oh, there you that's, go. Yes. That's, amazing. that's great. I love it. Oh, that's uh, a <laughs> lot of dead to me and their stupid simplicity and redundancy, Dagon. Uh, you you know what, though? You know what though? AJ's AJ's is more of the like the whole thing. Like you get the song, you get the music behind it, you get her skipping the ring, and then yeah, and then and then crop tops and them shorts that just do not do her justice. And yeah, it, it all works. And the Chuck Taylor high and the Chuck Taylors, yes, the Chuck Taylors. Yeah, I remember those. Yeah, yeah. Did, I, did you get them from Chuck Taylor? I don't know. We don't know. We'll find out. I think Chuck Taylor got his name from Chuck Taylor. Is what happened? No, no. Um, I, I think I think you're right, but still, it's funny. The reason I was asking about if we were done with this round is because Matthew, who went to the NXT house show tonight that we that he's been talking about going to for the better part of a month or whatever. The person that debuted one of the debuts was Tamara Mensa Stock, who was the 2021 Olympic gold medalist. Oh. So there's now a third Olympic gold medalist in the WWE uh, family. So there you go. Congrats to her on making her debut on the NXT roster tonight, even if it is a house show. So hey, full house. No, not yet. We've only got three. <laughs> <laughs> no, I got three answers. Oh, wait. You're I heard what you I said. Will- I will say, like Datilla, like just reciting songs as if they're like speeches is like my. It's great. It's, it's, it's a great it's, gimmick, man. No, I know. I, I, no, don't stop the gimmick. Is my point. It's hilarious. Yeah, Mrs. No, Shat, Mrs. Was, Shatner. Yeah, I was trying we to turn a, it into spoken word promo. <laughs> I was like, trying to like keep a straight face, and then you started like the way you were saying the second chorus broke me like crazy. I was, I was That's it. it. That's it. So so now it's going to be teleporting into the command center, the mistress of the spoken word. She is the tiller. There, <laughs> there we go. That's what we're doing. That's what we're doing. <laughs> yeah, That's, what we're doing. Oh my God. That's it. Yeah, That's I'm it. not even in the command center today. <laughs> I know. You're in a second. You're in the uh, PO command well, center. It's I mean, rental. to be fair, how many people you were around today from Power Rangers, you might as well have been. Honestly, I was gonna say you're in the Zio command center um, tonight. It, it might as well be a rental. Right. Hey, I like the Zio command center. I like Zio. Hey, all right, JJ, go ahead. JJ, go ahead. Gonna throw to another commercial real quick before we do the next set of spins. Woo. We're gonna take a little bit of a longer break. So if anybody needs to run to the bathroom and everything, we're gonna show the trailer that we're probably the proudest of that we beat the shit around here, and that's the Gary Hebert documentary trailer. (laughs) Thank you, thank you, thank you. So, we will be back. And now, preview time. So let's take a look at what's coming your way. Gary Hebert, the man, the myth, the legend. I was amazed, and I was looking to become a better skater myself, and I wanted to be like Gary. When you look at a guy like this, he's one of the most talented people in his profession. He's been given gifts by God. It can get frustrating at times when you're trying things that, you know, that maybe don't come as quickly to you as other things. And, you know, you never really felt that sense of frustration with Gary. It was always about improvement and positive reinforcement. Was it really the end? Was that head injury really the end? God has called Gary to continue to be a blessing to others and to be a passionate example. My name is Gary Hebert. This is the World Academy of Hockey, otherwise known as the Inside Edge. I would recommend anybody that have a chance to go come to his hockey school. I think it'd be well worth it. It'd be rewarding to uh, all the kids and anyone coaches, from whether it's an adult, a professional player, to a little kid like a mite or a squirt. Gary, from day one, has been instrumental in my hockey career. I started out as a potential Division Three player, and Gary brought me single-handedly 
through high school and into a top division one prospect. I owe it all to Gary, the biggest legend on and off ice there's ever been. Listen, watch, learn, be confident, and have faith. Those are the answers I was brought to. Yet, I only now am really learning how truly important those five things are. Through preparation, through appropriate thoughtfulness and thinking, we can learn to untie the typical knots between our ears that drive us into underachievement and underperformance. And lo and behold, we can learn from things to fulfill our God given potential. Gary has the innate ability to make people not only better players, but better people. The life lessons they learn from Gary are incredible. You can always remember leaving that rink knowing as a player I got better or I had something to improve on to get better. And I think that's what you excelled on as a coach is giving us the knowledge to know what we needed to do to get better. There's coaches who know the game, but, but can you communicate and create passion in your kids and in your players and, and Gary's able to do that. Gary's got uh, great knowledge and the great hands but more importantly his ability to connect with people and care for them. His uh, communication skills to me really stand out and separate him and that's why he's one of the best you know in the world. Gary's a legend. You know he's a special special man. Second trailer is out now for anybody that wants to see it. It's on my uncle's YouTube channel and or mine. Uh, the speech that he gave the number one team in the state of New Hampshire. So go check that out. It's probably one of the best speeches you will ever hear in sports. And I don't say that with any hyperbole because I've seen some great freaking sports speeches in my time. So. And yeah, he's been Maddie Laws co-signed on that last week. That was one of the greatest speeches he's ever heard. Yeah. And he doesn't have the connection with James like the rest of us do to be just no. doing that. Right. I don't know if you announced this last week. The reason we're not doing that one on the regular is because of the music situation. Otherwise, we yeah. wouldn't play that. Yeah. That's a damn good one, too. So. So. Yeah, yeah. yeah which, which, you know, Bruno Mars, damn. I mean, I could probably find a way to, like, mute it and then find a way to make it funny. Right? No, no. E- either way. Like, it. It's a great song. Backing that, so I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going to try to shit on it, and we can't. But it's just, you know, it, it's copyright. Copyright is a bitch. Ah. Yes. All right. The next five spins, and then after these performances, Walter has said in the private chat that he is going to dip. Okay. Yes. 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 Everybody's got the Easter tomorrow, so that is fair. I'm not doing anything for Easter. Are you going to is are they having day two of the con tomorrow or no? It's actually day three or four. It's the last Damn. day. Hey. Crazy. Are you are you at the uh the the con that's going on in mass? No. No. Anaheim. Oh, uh, okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right, anyway, good day. Spin the wheel, make the deal. Give me a second because okay. the page is now being unresponsive. Oh, of course it is. Oh, there you go. Oh, lovely. Um, yeah, it, it, it's it's WonderCon. That's the one that this weekend, right? Is yeah, I don't know how okay, far yeah. I am from Disneyland. I said, "Well, you're at the convention center," you said, right? Yeah. You can walk there. Like you, if you walk cross street, you're there. Oh. <laughs> Seriously, <laughs> if you walk across the hill, it's right there. So, yep. It is. Oh, right you know what? There, I think darling. I saw some rides from inside of the convention center. I was on the second floor, and I looked oh, yeah. out the window, and there was like some rides. If you're on the second floor, you're probably just seeing the Ferris wheel, the Tower of Terror, which is now Guardians of the Galaxy, of course, or maybe the Incredicoaster, Jay, over on that side. Yeah. Yeah. Might, so you're, might seeing, not be you're seeing rides from Paradise Pier and Disney California Adventure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's definitely DCA rides in. over there. Yeah. I was going to say. Uh, been to... Go ahead. Oh, go ahead. No, go ahead. It's all... Go ahead. I, was, I haven't been to Disneyland in forever, so these rides do not sound familiar to me. Yeah, right. yeah, we're up and working. There we cool. go. There we go. All right, so first spin. It's gonna get me just for picking on it now. Watch. Oh, 
almost got me. <laughs> Missed it by that much. Spin number two. Doo-doo-doo. Should always have the prices right, the in play, as every time we spend the wheel. Right. Or the wheel. Set the hand wheel, wheel sounds. Boop, 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 Oh, Damn, wow. Matilda's just getting railed right wow. now. Damn it! What yeah. the fucking word is on tonight? This is it's rig, I tell you, rig. It's not. Everybody's name is on there twice. That's for not being it's there. It's all in the evenly beginning. spaced. Okay. Yeah, that's for not being there in the beginning. Hey! I did my shit and it worked. I went wee, and then it worked right there. It's your target. Oh, was I supposed to go live from the convention center? Yes. Yeah. Okay, well, I. <laughs> Please There's go. fun in the background. Please. And no one. It's the, just like the last round. What the heck? Mm-hmm. Well, they, yeah, the people can't get good sure. cars or good jokers, and I can't forget avoid the damn wheel. That's it. Bloody hell. All right. So. Bloody hell. Random person is going to get deceased superstar. Oh, okay. Man, I can't even see the wheel. And that's not because I don't have my glasses on. I am steering the cab, right? Okay. No, it, it's not that. She, she, she's on mobile, so it's... Yeah, Got it, it sucks. Just, it sucks. It's just because, remember, the first time James said I wasn't sharing it, so that's why right. I was going yeah. to make sure. Yeah, no, 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 you're good now. Dottila's first song is... an AEW theme. Oh, there you go. Oh, AEW? Okay. Ah. I accidentally removed it. Oh, no, no. <laughs> you got to add it back. I'm, I'm here you sitting go. there. Hey, no, hey, no. Here you go. H W theme. You fucked up. You, you fucked up. There you go. How's it going? There we go. It's going? back. It's back. There you go. All right. Tatilla's second theme. Poor J.T. Smith. He never prayer. <laughs> That's true. Yeah, Ron. That could be anybody from... That could be anybody? Yeah, anybody, anybody that, that is dead. That's right. Okay. Even okay. Virgil. You can, Even Virgil. The, the only person you can't pick is Bray Wyatt because right. Noah did that, and yes. I did Big Boss Man, who's passed away. Yes. Okay. Let me look for it. I did him as a Hall of Famer, but he is deceased. So. Yes. Okay. Oh, ooh, I James gets a T and A. Ooh. Ooh. I that know what song fine. he should pick. <laughs> <laughs> well, what, no what song I don't know what song I would pick from TNA. What song? Besides Joe Henry. All right. Well, no one's going to get it. Oh. Double sub double. Oh. <laughs> no, you have to research. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Oh, yeah. Everybody oh, said song. Every WWE uh, song tonight should be from Slam Jam just because it's so bad. So, so, Jeff, what would your recommendation be for my TNA pick? For TNA? Oh, God. Well, 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 let's let's have the bottom tier pick the top tier Super Chatter choice first. Yeah. yeah. Um, Since, you know, let's have JD run the show. And I'll, yeah, you know. That's so, fair. James, who from the top row do you want to sing? Uh, I picked JJ because Walter has bad eye and I feel bad and he wants to probably go to bed. <laughs> That's true. Okay, Dottila. I picked you. Noah? Yeah, sure. JJ, fuck me. I discarded a fucking All right. That was wrong. <laughs> Damn, fuck it! Fuck it! The $10 you PlayStation controller is your backward ass! Friggin' layout! Can <laughs> <laughs> wow. we try to keep the blurred outs to a minimal when I'm trying to host? Pretty Walter, <laughs> since you did not come up on the wheel... If you would like to bow out now, you can. You can always just watch us on your phone as you do what it is you said you needed to do. So, All right. All right. No problem. We appreciate you being here. Would you like to plug your shit real quick? 
Yeah, you can follow me at that uh, Rage of Wrestling uh, YouTube channel. I don't know which predictions I'll be part of. Uh, I'm trying to be on Simply Prediction. Maybe Greg Cherries, whoever's. But yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'll be on one of them. But uh, the Instagram is at yeah. Fire Farm, and uh, the X is at Walter Alex Cruz. And I just got to say, the storm has arrived. Damn yeah. right. Uh, Damn uh, right, she did. Uh, yeah. Uh, and, and she teamed up with Bianca Belair and Naomi, and that's a great team. I like it. Sorry. Yes. And, and, and I won't say who on the top tier called that a while ago. I'll just point and whistle. Yeah. 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 yeah All right, man. Well, thank you for hanging out with us for as long as you did. We will right. hopefully see you. If you're feeling better and more up to it, we will see you tomorrow as part of the big WrestleMania week hype. Yes. All right, man. Take it easy. All right. Thank you. All right. Jay to the right of me. James to the left. Here. Oh, okay. Sorry. They move me. Well, yeah. I like having you right by your name. I know. I'll be there. That I way you can just open point. Open it. Open it. That, that way he can eat his, his name for some reason. He, he's got to eat it. <clears throat> Eat my name and I shall appear. I am that guy, Jeff Meacham. There, <laughs> there you go. Nice, nice. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so you wanted a recommendation from me for TNA. Yeah. TNA. You said, you said you had one in mind, so I'm curious what it is. Well, no, well, no, 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 no. For 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 your uh, WWE, I had Hollywood Hogan because I had the shirt on. Um, I like Do I like AJ's DJ's suggestion. First- Theme, dude. You are. Yeah, AJ. You AJ's are, that, that one cooks. Man. I am. I am. Well, there's multiple versions. I'd rather go with the one that had the rap lyrics with it. Well, that's, 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 I mean, if hey, AJ, AJ's song is good throughout his entire ten year run. You do you, boo. That's true. That's true. AJ Styles I, TNA. Take your pick. I was always more partial to his original theme as opposed to the "Get Ready to Fly." As as was I. <laughs> Everybody's, but whichever you want to do is fine. But yeah, I, I would prefer the original one. But you know, yeah, yeah. And, and with TNA, if you're not doing Jeff Jarrett, AJ Styles is a mess. All righty. Well, I got my. Or not. I'll get that ready to go. I, I'm getting it on my lyric window here. Uh. So the first one was you because it came out with Supercharged Choice and you were the first one. Yes, but I need a minute to think and look something up. And since Tatilla has more than one. Oh, that's fair. Which would you like to do first, Tatilla, your AEW or your deceased superstar? I'll do AEW. Okay, and who are you going to do? I'm going to do Judas. Of course you are. Spoken word, Judas. going to be good shit. Of course you are. (laughs) Well, oh, Diana Peraza doesn't have any lyrics to her theme. Nope. I actually coming. did have one I was going to request, but you know, you've got Judas, so that's cool. Which one are you going to request? I was going to say, do Julia Hart. Ooh. Julia Hart. I do like her theme. I didn't even think I could do Julia Hart. If you got Judas ready up in your head, you, I mean, yeah, that would, yeah, yeah, I'm gonna just do Judas. Gonna that's easy. Oh, Jesus, if, okay. If, if I get AEW again, I will do Julia Hart. Yeah, Sorry. just friggin' scream, speak Malachi Black speak. Just, oh, just okay. so everybody knows, apparently Natalie asked in the chat room. I didn't see the question, so she came to oh. me directly uh-huh. about would paper money work? Just giving the twenty five dollars to me. <laughs> Oh, oh, and okay. I was I'm like, like yeah, that's, that's fine. <laughs> okay, he's okay. still getting paid, whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So she wants me to do pretty deadly. <laughs> yes, boy. <laughs> yes, yes, boy. Yes, boy! <laughs> like I said, you <laughs> Oh, that's funny. I like All right, that. so. Oh. Do, don't get too into that, Noah. You still got to do Brodus Clay. I was gonna say, get Billy and Chuck down there. The freaking, the, the freaking prelude to Pretty Deadly there, Skippy. So just relax. And you, down have, there. And you have a WCW wrestler to freaking look. I don't know WCW themes. I grew up WWF. I'll find but one. Do three I, I, count. I know you killed the man called Sting. Do three count. Do three count. 
Great cow. What the fuck is that? <laughs> I need to go off camera. I can't. I can't. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. The fuck is that? Okay, okay. I'll give him one that he can do <laughs> that he probably actually wouldn't hate. That, you know. Okay. In keeping with the aura of him doing the man called Steam earlier, <laughs> you seek and destroy. There you ah, go. Ah, yes, yes, yes. It's WW thing. You have yes. to tell him. Okay. Um, I should remain. I'll do Julia. I'll do Julia. Oh, cool. oh okay. Yeah, yeah, and then that okay. way Judas is still on the board for someone else later. Oh, my God. <laughs> so here to do Julia Hart, Harder Heart theme from AEW, the mistress of the spoken word, the killer. <laughs> it is official. It's official. This is not going to sound anything like Julia Hart. That's okay. Okay. That's point. Let me see. It says, born from... Pain inside my veins, bread for war, begging for more, none shall mourn. I am reborn. Live in sin, the house always wins. My heart grows harder, my heart grows harder, darker and darker. I see the truth. My blood flows black with you. <laughs> the kid turned the light off. Fuck. <laughs> so hard to be quiet about it. I tried to turn the light off and it didn't work. That's why you need to watch your show like I do. Watch this shit. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, that's funny. That yeah, was awesome. Oh, oh my God. That's funny. I tried to turn the light off to join the crowd and then I couldn't This is way more fun than I was thinking it was going to be, JJ. I knew it was going to be fun, but this is way more fun than I was even thinking. This is great. Yeah, we're having a good time. Oh, shit. Okay. Usa. 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 Now it's your turn, yeah, Jay? Um, or are you are, are you ready? Because you're ready. We're good. I'm not ready yet. All right. I'm ready yet. I'm ready. <laughs> are you ready for it? <laughs> Are you ready for it? No, we're last, we're last, we're last month. Never mind. Forget. It. Um, he's, he's trying to psych himself up to do this. Shit. Right. Well, no, I don't even know who I want to do. Oh, that, okay. Okay. So. Well, while you're tell you uh, what, you're you're on the production side of things too. So why don't you introduce James? Okay. Introduce Noah. Introduce to tell a second one, and by then I should be figured out what I want to do. So. All right, James. Are you ready with? Whatever AJ version you ha you have prepared, yes, sir. Yes, yes, get ready to play All right. the rap version. All right, here to sing AJ Styles' "Get Ready to Fly" from the days of TNA since gone by. Here is the Heat Man himself, James Heat. Get ready to fly. I am. I am. I am, I am. Whoa, get ready to fly. A fly, J fly. I am, I am. They say you couldn't do it. Say you ain't ready for it. Your intention is to pass and then pay for it. That's why this kid's on top. He belong here. That's why he's taking it all like he owns it. Fly high now like the birds do. It's all over when style's flying over you. Don't forget the name. Do I need to explain? Welcome to TNA. We about to chase a game. You are, you are. Everybody get ready to fly. You are, you are Styles. I am, I am. There you go. Yeah. Nice. That was Thank awesome. You. Dude, I... I went back. They, they did a whole history of AJ, uh, uh, Lone Wolf AJ there uh, a couple months ago now. Man, that song cooked member more than I thought it used. To. Like, I remember it doing that. Was, that was kick ass. That was good. Yeah, it was. It, it is a really good remix, to be fair. Like I said, for me, never beats the original. And the fact that I had the DVD they put out and it was that on loop, I'm like, oh, this DVD is going to play in my player forever now. <laughs> that's true. That's true. That's true. Mr. Foster, are you ready with. The theme that Sting is used everywhere except WWE. That is true. I think yeah, I think he's one the I remember. Right. Nothing but guitar. Good lord. Oh oh god yeah the, yeah the, 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 there's there's way more guitar and anything else than lyrics. Oh my god. 
Honestly, I think I wouldn't blame if Noah just does the guitar like solo of it. <laughs> Honestly, he could just be he could just do that. I, I, I'll I don't take do, it. I don't do that type of stuff. I barely do this stuff as it is. <laughs> I think I think right. I pretty much got the point of where it actually starts saying something. There, there we go. go. Yeah. In that case, oh, here to with his next song, the song that sent the Stinger into retirement, as well as his song in WCW, and I think even once in TNA. Here is Noah Foster, Seek and Destroy. By the way, unfortunately. By the way, unfortunately, it wasn't that. It was freaking Toby Max. Something by Toby Mac. Oh, I forgot the song. Nah, Toby, who? <laughs> Damn. Accurate. Accurate, Noah. No. Okay. Jesus. His name was Toby. And in the one scene day, one day, in the day. city tonight, we're looking for you to start up a fight. There's an evil feeling in our brains, but it's nothing new. You know what drives us insane? Running on our way, hiding. You will pay dying. 1,000 deaths. Running on our way, hiding. You will pay dying. 1,000 deaths. Searching and seek and destroy. Says like four times here. Searching and seek and destroy. Searching and seek and destroy. Search and seek and destroy. Then it goes into a guitar solo. I do that. Yeah, because that song plays like a half hour. guitar only. That's a tap out. Yeah, God. Yeah, yeah. Well, that that's that's how it was back then. If if, if the if the hard or metal rock guys weren't like yeah, song, they were just they would just play the strong guitar for half hour per song, and it's still kicked ass. So there you go. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. All right. Okay. Are we coming back to you, Mr. Williams, or are we going to Attila's second song? No, I ah. I said we were going to Attila and then to me. Okay, so I just want to make sure we're good. Datilla, what is your second song? It is China's Ninth Wonder of the World theme. Ooh. All right, well, here to make me cry by speaking <laughs> Tony's theme. Because um, <laughs> I kind of speaking with other people singing my songs. Um, Datilla with Don't Treat Me Like a Woman for China. <laughs> Don't Treat Me Like a Woman. Don't treat me like a man. Don't treat me like you know me. Just treat me for who I am. Oh, don't treat me like a woman. Don't treat me like a man. Don't treat me like you know me. Just treat me for who and what I am. Don't treat me like a woman. Don't treat me like a man. Don't treat me like you know me. There's so much more. There's so much more. I'm so much more. I'm so much more than that. Oh, and she was, damn it. Oh. Yeah, Jeff, that that one hits hard for Jeff. Considering, it, it, I year, mean, it, it's it's going to be eight years in a couple weeks. Yeah, a few weeks. Yeah, yeah. April twentieth, the day of rebellion. Actually, yeah. That it, that that maybe when they found her. Though. I don't remember if she actually passed on that day or not. But that, that maybe when they found her. Anyway. Anyway, Mr. Williams, are you ready? No. JJ, this, this is said, harder than I thought it would be. <laughs> what? <laughs> Jesus, James. JJ, try it again. I'm sorry, brother. So this is harder than I thought it would be. It's not an easy song. It's not. To be fair. Well, so. none of the no, no. I'm not even talking about the yes boy yet. I'm still oh, oh, okay. the deceased song. Oh, okay. Oh, jeez. So you're stuck. All right. Oh. All right. I'm ready. Yay. All right. I will go ahead and just give you the intro and you do do you think. Okay. Here to sing a song now used by someone who has now passed on. Here is the Renegade of Wrestling, our host, Par Excellence, and the most overworked and underappreciated man in the room today. God damn it, all poor yeah, bastards. Sure. JJ Williams, everybody, the Renegade of Wrestling. American dream. Don't, 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 don't. He's 
just a common man working hard with his hand. He's just a common man working hard for the man. Hey, he's a American dream. Hey, he's a American dream. American dream. There you go. <laughs> did the animal because you're yeah, not. Oh, what the hell? I, I didn't do that on purpose. Ah, why am I here? <laughs> no solos. No solo. Golly. Zach, that's it. If you want to do 50, you can get the Alvinus for somebody. And that's. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You Sorry, pay brother. for it. You pick it. That's right. This is you pick your poison, not somebody picks your poison, that somebody picks your own poison. Uh, my not, not how it works. My All right, so let me look up the damn lyrics for the pretty deadly shit <laughs> now. You, you want to go ahead and have one of the other pre prepaid do there since they, they already know what they're doing, or for the most part? Yes. Um, let's. You know what? Noah still has two more that he has to do, so oh, does geez, Noah right. want to do the common man boogie? Or not the common man boogie. I just did that shit. <laughs> does Noah want to do somebody call your mama? Or does he uh -huh. want to do Billy and Chuck? <laughs> Somebody call your mama, otherwise known as the uncommon man boogie. <laughs> hey, Dusty was calling a lot of people's mamas. I'm just saying. Uh, that's, that's true. It. That's true. Yeah. Noah? I want tires. I want tires calling mine or anybody else's mamas. I'm just throwing that shit out there. <laughs> that's true. That's true. George scares me. No, you got to do the Brodus Clay thing or the Billy and Chuck thing. Pick your poison. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying to get him to do that. Thank you. I. Don't even remember Billy and Chuck. <laughs> you look so Is that all that he says? good to me. No, no, no. Unfortunately uh, not. I'll look that up shit up, I guess. It gets you know, it gets even naughtier. You know, easy brother. there, kiddo. Easy there. I'm we're getting there. I gotta look the stuff up. Dilo. <laughs> I'm gonna just say yeah. like you know Tyrus is not over when Noah's trying to avoid every single time it's brought up. <laughs> like, every single time. I think, it, for, for real, though, like, it's offensive on a primal, pure wrestling fan. That man was the NWA World Heavyweight Champion. It just, yes. it just, that's yes, my it was. Ass. In, it in, in, not just in this era, in any era at it that does, point in that man's life, that, that was an insult. The, the, the fact that that title is 75. Five. Fuck, I thought I was 75 years old. Holy shit. Um, and, like, there's not even a contest for me that Brodus Clay is the worst champion that actually held on to the title. We can talk about Shane Douglas all we want, but the, they actually held on to the title and defended it and was champion. Is there anybody worse? Nope. Maybe the Sheik. Maybe maybe, maybe that, that knockoff version of the Sheik in 2011. Maybe. That's but... Time, very rarely and, and and I only talk about the Sheik bad because of my my acquaintanceship with Marquez and, and Adam Pierce. Otherwise, like I could give a fuck, honestly. Um, and Colt, but um, the NWA was such a shit show at that point, point anyway. So it's like that wasn't. You know. It's a shit show now. <laughs> well, yes, but management at least I um I can at least tolerate the management now uh, on on other levels. The women's um, division always had potential, though, even in the Billy Corgan era of the NWA. That's the one thing we can't say. No, I agree with that. The only, that's um, the only thing we can give it, really. I, I'm seeing the I'm seeing the chat, Jay. Do you want to go ahead and um throw th th her for plugs? Then, or you want to have Noah pick a song first? She said she'll do another round. Oh yeah, I, I I'm sorry, I I, I missed her. I apologize. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> I can't even, this freaking thing is not loading for me either. Uh, so, if Noah's not ready with either one, I can go ahead and do the one they, they, they prepaid for me, brother. Okay. Why, is this like a sad one? And no, it's just, it's just obscenely corny. Oh. <laughs> oh, boy. Which one may it be? Hang on, I'm, I'm okay. To load so, you up. know, the Linda McMahon WrestleMania, the Dan and oh, my God. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, Daniel yeah. wants oh, yeah. him to do the lyrical version to that. 
Oh, that's funny. Okay. I'm ready. God help me. All right. So via prepaid super chat, here is Jeff Meacham doing the lyrical version of WrestleMania. All right. Now, as I do this first line, keep in mind, this is for WrestleMania. Are you ready for the Survivor Series? Who will survive? Mm. Let's do, 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 just like that. Just like that. Go look what you got now. That hacksaw Jim Duggan. And when you get in the ring, I'll show you how to get beat up. The way Tataka sees it, to climb to the top in the World Wrestling Federation, Tataka will be successful. Big boss man now. Hey, ever since I was a little boy, I just wanted to do one thing, thing only. That's to be a law enforcement officer. Treat other people like you want to be treated. Try to walk the straight and narrow. That's the only way you're going to survive in this life. Who will survive? Oh, 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 WrestleMania. Yeah, this is our life. Pop it up, pop it up. Oh, 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 WrestleMania. Fighting to survive. Just like that. Just like that. That's enough of that shit. All right. (laughs) Fucking hell. Noah, are you ready? This beam. What the fuck, WWE? I don't want hear anybody what the fuck after what I just did. Shut up. <laughs> uh, <laughs> it was so bad when Hogan was there. Hogan left and I got that, okay? Just throwing that shit out yeah, there right yeah, now. Yeah, it did. It did. I was going to say, that was the first mania post-Hogan. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And the big ball, man. <laughs> Brett was the world champion, and he sang on that track. Damn. Um, I don't want to hear a goddamn thing about a goddamn thing. Did he sing or did they recite shit? Either way. Either way. Hey, we will not dog on reciting. We have a Mr. The Spoken Word here kicking all our asses right now. So yeah, I'm right. Talk- and she still has another that's song right. she needs to perform. That's right. That's true. That's true. Oh, damn WrestleMania rap. Freaking Jim Johnson would smack him in his head if he had a job. <laughs> um, what? Why? I love the added text if he had a job. <laughs> I'm not going to smack a guy when he's jobless. That's fucked up. <laughs> oh, That's Jesus fucking fair. Sorry. That's fair. That's Noah, fair. Don't think we're forgetting about you, bro. It's time, buddy. We don't forget about you. Here to sing the Billy and Chuck theme song. Oh, no! The simple man with the spectacular voice. <laughs> Noah Foster. Everybody go on mute. We gotta we gotta we gotta, we gotta let this one cook. Yep. Fucking hate all of you right now. Oh god. I pray to God no one in the ATW family's watching this shit. Oh uh, Jesus Lord. Why why is this a fake? <sighs> okay. Jesus, it goes right into it. Okay. Yeah. Get the shit over with and then wash my mouth out. Yeah. Oh God. Why? Okay. You look so good to me. What the fuck is this intro shit? God. And then a bunch of background noises. Almost people sounding like they're having a frigate Never mind. I cannot turn my eyes away. I hang on every word you say. You make me want to hold you. You make me lose control. And you make my heart and soul complete. God. Oh, baby, you look so good to me. Jesus, what the hell were they doing back in 2003? Oh, baby, you look so good to me. 
Fuck that to oblivion. Godly. What the fuck were they on back then? They were in San Francisco all the time, were they? That's some straight up gay shit. Damn. Ugh, that was God. them trying to be ahead of the curve. Yeah, the curve my ass. That is freaking going back in time to an alternative timeline where freaking sexuality wasn't a freaking goddamn sign of anything. The fuck? Wow, that was yeah. a god that he must be upset. Corrupted backwards ass shit that I ever fought without the old man in the chair. All right, so for the no next super chat, god right? damn, not <laughs> just on any Sunday, on Easter Sunday. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah it's, Lord, he is right? risen and he's here seeing god damn. That's how yeah, bad that shit was. This part is, Lord help humanity and Lord help my blood pressure. I've been dealing with that to, 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 right. to give To give Noah a little pass, that storyline ended up and a three-minute warning, and Eric Bischoff peeling off makeup. So I, I understand the pissed off. Like I get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. true. It was, and, and but it, and they that reused that thing. song, yeah. and they re and they reused that song. By the way, because for freaking Rico and Jackie. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Yeah, and then ah. and not just that, Santina Morella. Oh God, I forgot Remember about Santina. That era. Oh God, James, I officially hate you. <laughs> <laughs> For this hour of the show, we're gonna hate on right. James now. Um Datilla, are you ready with your second song? When did you first time? I you thought I sang it. it you did? China. Oh, okay, that's, right. Oh, that's right. That's right. That's right. Okay. We're all flustered here. All right, Sorry. So all that's left for me right now is Yes Boy. <laughs> that can only be the song to follow Billy and Chuggy at the end of the day, really. For real. I mean, it, it, it just works. All right. I have my lyrics up. I oh, hope Natalie God. is ready for this. I always forget these guys' names. So I'm just, I'm just going to do the team intro. I feel bad. So Alton Prince and Kit Wilson. Kit Wilson. Yep. Kit Wilson. Kit like Kit like the car kit. Okay. Not yeah. any names. Jesus. Man, no one's on one at night, man. On God's day. Oh, Lordy. Anyway. um, Here to sing the the only proper follow-up to Billy and Chuck's theme. Oh, my God. What the pretty deadly theme is our host par excellence, the Renegade of Wrestling. And God, God bless you, JJ Williams. Only because it was my daughter that's paying for this. Yes. Yes, boy. <laughs> <laughs> I can't if James is going to be cracking up in my I'm ear. Sorry, sorry. I'll, I'll mute. Okay, give me a second to catch my breath again. He made me a crack up so much. Like, I try and take this seriously. Yes, boy. On and on, on and on, we go on and on, on and on, we go on and on, on and on, because the night is young, because the night is young. We are so pretty. All our clothes on fleek. Yes, we strut the ring. We're pretty deadly. We're pretty deadly. On and on, on and on, we go on and on, on and on, we go on and on, on and on, because the night is young, because the night is young. Damn it. Sorry. That, okay, let me just Perfect. say. That song with no musical track behind it and out of context is the absolute worst song for a heterosexual male to be singing. I know. <laughs> but to your yeah. point, yes. it is the only song that can yes. follow up Noah's yes. Billy and Chuck song. So yeah. it's <laughs> we're so pretty, our clothes are on fleek. I'm like, God ah, damn. I just I just feel the chromosomes changing in my body as he's going along. You're like, God damn, the dream God. match nobody wanted. <laughs> Right, right. The dream, the dream song pairing. Nobody in the in the seven circle of hell could have possibly envisioned. And we're giving it to you an open mic night, by God. Okay. Billions, brief billions brief trans, beef side track here, real quick. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You want to talk about dream that nobody ever thought about? Mm -hmm. Somebody on Twitter yesterday pro posted a clip 
of the match that you never thought that you needed to see that actually exists. And I found the entire match on YouTube. Noah, I want this to be something we call at some point. It is from October 21st, 1992. The Wrestle Association R promotion. Yeah, war. Yeah. Owen Hart versus Ultimo Dragon. Oh my God. Wow. That and it's different. like high energy Owen Hart. Like he oh has the my. blue pants with the check patches and suspenders. Dude, I will produce the fuck out of that watch along. <laughs> Dude, th- th- this I is like- a match me and you are going to have to call, bro. Uh, yes. Owen yes, Hart I mean, and not, Ultimo yes. Dragon. The match you never knew that you needed to see. But now we yes. can just, just, yes. But now Inject that you know it exists, it. you yeah. want to see it. Yeah. 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 Okay. Oh. All right. So the last round before Datilla leaves. Yes. This As should you're... wrap up Arlene's super chats. And then we've only got to worry about the twelve from Emmanuel. Plus James's best of both worlds. Plus Noah's somebody call my mama. Wait. And I think that'll just about cover everybody. Wait, wow. I'm singing best of both worlds? What? Yeah, yeah like I'm Montana's go. best of both worlds. Oh, oh, I got no, it. No, 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 no. The one for Mixed no, uh, Mix Super Man. Show. Yeah, it, 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 they, they ended up using that song. I, I, found, I found out why I heard it. I remember it. It was from the um, the Mix Max Mix, Mix Max challenge, whatever the hell that was called, the mixed tag tournament they had. I don't know. I wasn't watching in twenty sixteen. Okay, so, 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 so James, like twenty nineteen, they had like they had the the mixed tag team I, matches that were I on. I know what it is. I know which, what it is. Which which uh, one? The right. one with that Miz and Oscar one, or the one the R Truth and Carmelo one? It's it, it's a we're not afraid to da, 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 we get the best of both worlds, and it all starts tonight or something like that. Or, I, I got it. No. I, I, okay, I good. You'll know when I, you hear it because James can do it very. Yeah, I posted it in the open mic night chat and tagged you so. That's fair. I, I you sometimes I don't receive the. This tag. is why we need to read production notes before we go live. Um, I know. Sorry. Okay. Um. All right. So, first out of five spins. Oh, we all got all of a sudden. Shit. Hello. It knows that you want to dip out, so it's making sure you get your songs in before you leave. Okay. Yeah. 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 Me. Spin three. Again, Ooh. awesome. Not really, kind of being sarcastic at this point. <laughs> I want to hit like actually once regularly, huh? That's crazy. Oh shit, we didn't take Walter's name off, and he dipped. All right, well, so yeah, go ahead and respin that, and then I'll yeah. take his name off when I take the show off. James. And the last one. Oh, great. I sure yeah. laugh. There we go. Finally got it. There we go. All right. So Noah actually has a pr- reprieve this time around. There you go. Attila, you get a TNA theme. Ooh, I can't wait. Do Joya. That way you can you and Noah can do the dance together. The hell? <laughs> there you go. I'm not, I'm not dancing. <laughs> hey. Aww. 
Ooh. If it's true, I'm not going to stand up and dance. I'll do it from my chair, but I'm okay, tired. I get an NXT theme. Hmm. Okay. Considering it is my NXT, that should be good. And what else do I get? John. WWE. Okay. Okay. James gets. I wonder. NXT. And yes, you can pick your NXT. It doesn't have to be my NXT. It just has to be I, I, a I, NXT theme. Yeah, I figured. I figured. I figured. Switch is something. And Jeff gets. Something I know. Something I know. A WrestleMania theme song. Crazy. Okay, cool. Just don't pick anything by the weekend, please, God. I will drop, dude. Come on, who are you talking to? No way. No, I don't really says, like, no. Well, I heard my sparkly dudes, and I'm content. I'm heading to bed. Thank you for making my night with that lovely image, Dad. <laughs> Like I said, you're welcome, with... smart ass. <laughs> <Evil and Jeff. laughs> from, the, from the teenage audience. Um, Probably laughing right. her ass off before bed. <laughs> oh, fuck yeah, dude. Uh, These are right. actually going to be easier for me because I know exactly who I want to do yeah. for these songs. Yeah. As far as the weekend goes, the only song I would remotely pick is um, uh, Bonnie and Lights because I know that one, but I'm probably going to hear it tomorrow at the show anyway, so I'd, I'd rather just let the girls do that. James, I do have a request if yes. you want. Yes, yes, yes. And I think you might even get Noah to join in here. Too glorious. Oh! <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's a good one. That's a good one. That's, that's tremendous. One. Uh, I need uh, you know what Noah doesn't even have to necessarily join in, but Noah, if you could do this for me when I sing it, I need you to do the Bobby Roode head nod, like from the TikToks. <laughs> glorious bombs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah glorious bombs. Right there. We, we don't need to be in that shot if we do. Uh, uh, oh, good lord. Uh, that was such a thing for a short period of time, but damn, was it good. I did it with a standee when I went to SummerSlam Access in 2019. It's funny, isn't it? It is. It's so ridiculous. And God, when they they brought it back, man, people popped their nut. It was tremendous. Like, Uh, you know, there are a few things you actually will get emotionality for, and that's one of them. That's a good feeling. Well, the whole last, the whole last one, they did Michael Hayes. They're like, "Oh, well, we like you, Michael," but no. Oh God. Yeah, that's true. Oh, Michael Hayes' birthday recently. Do, do, do. Um, anyway. He's probably like, I don't get it. <laughs> oh, I think he does get it. it. <laughs> no, I bet you Michael's probably one of the few producers that does get it. Uh, yeah, probably, actually. That's fair. Uh, Jesus. All righty. All right, so who's going first? I don't know. Who's on first? What's on second? The Tilla is first with her TNA theme. There we go. Ah, uh, yes. Okay. Freaking what? All right. The TNA theme I choose is for Honor No More's uh, theme. Ooh. Ooh. Throwback. Yes, Slight throwback. I really liked Honor No More. Huh? Slight throwback. Yeah. Look. From like what? Two years ago? Yeah. 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 <laughs> I'm surprised yeah. you're not going to do Joe Hendry. Because we always do Joe Hendry. We right? always do Joe Hendry. Oh, that wouldn't be anything new. Ooh, wow. Don't get me wrong. I like Joe Henry. I believe in 252 pounds of pure motivation, the answer to all our life's problems. Questions but... get to the pot. <laughs> well, I mean, I wish it was the answer to all of life's problems, to be fair. Yeah, it's fair. But, you know. but see, that's expected for me to do Joe Henry or Joya. That's why I wanted to change it up a little bit. Uh, JJ, or... maybe if you believe they would do it. <laughs> Joe Henry <laughs> believes in them. <laughs> that is not. Joe yeah, like... doesn't doesn't believe in Joe Henry. He doesn't uh, trust the system, but at least he believes in Ali. 
That's yes, I mean, it's Ali hard I not. To, it's very. It's hard not to believe in Ali. To be fair, <laughs> but you know. Oh. <laughs> Never mind, go ahead. Never mind. All right. So here to do the theme song for Honor Honor No More, the mistress of the spoken word, Datilla. <laughs> <That's laughs> I'm that. like that. that. here for that shit. Pop, bro. <laughs> okay. Uh, a little in the rut, patience wearing thin, they couldn't comprehend that we would never would give in. Shocker, never paid the toll, stumbled into the lion's den while looking for the rabbit hole. There's no tomorrow. Give us your best shot. We won't go quietly. Into the night you'll see. We are the tidal wave, ready to wash you away. So throw your hands up high, unlock the fuse inside. We are the tidal wave. We've come to wash you away. All right. Marvelous. Marvelous. Very nice. Very nice. Why are there so many diamonds in this hand? (laughs) Damn it, Noah. (laughs) Because Honor No More were the diamonds of the business. That's why. They were. Still are. Because diamonds are forever and so are the four horsemen. Uh, But diamonds are a girl's best friend. It's exactly. one hey, hey, and if you want the uh, if you want the silver ECW title version, Fortune Four. I mean, uh. <laughs> I knew that would get one. I knew that would get fired again, one. James. Sorry about that. You're fired again for making us remember that shit. Not again, no. Again. Not again. Not again. I've already been through this three times. <laughs> Like or right. what does F I R E D spell again? Get your ass out of here. <laughs> That's true. Uh, no, Zach, no Val Venus for you. Okay, so who next? Next is me. Oh boy, my NXT theme. I see. Oh my god, I think I know which one JD's gonna pick, or oh, but I could be wrong. Which one do you think I'm gonna pick? Chase, you doesn't have lyrics. Thank you, though. If it had lyrics, I definitely would be all about that Chase you. Um, um, (laughs) I'd do a wardrobe change, put my shirt on the whole nine, represent. (laughs) Nah. I'm not even going to give an introduction for this one because I wanted to see if it comes as a surprise to anybody once they hear it. Okay. So does anybody... Jeff? Ladies and gentlemen, the Renegade, J.J. Williams. Dun, dun. Must give solo shot. There we go. Because I'm the greatest. Ain't no hating. I'm the best here. You want your shot? Well, I guess you wait till next year. I'm at the top. Get respect while I get feared. Who got a problem, huh? Tell him to step here. Because I'm the greatest. No arguing nor debating. He in my face. Then I'm obviously going to break him. I never run from challenges. I handle them and face them. They say success, either mangle them or make them. I'm the best to ever do it. Going against me, you stupid. They know what I got to prove it. I'll win it. I'll never lose it. Only victory. The champ is what you get now. All those struggles lead to this. And who's the best now? Because I'm the greatest. Ain't no hating. I'm the best here. You want your shot? Well, I guess you wait till next year. I'm at the top. Get respect while I get feared. Who got a problem, huh? Tell him to step here. Yeah. Is that Carmelo Hayes? Uh, yes, it was. Uh, that I, was him. Yes. That's I was gonna, him. It was he is gonna I out. and I am him. There you go. Is that how the song goes? Yep. Yeah. Huh. All right. So I didn't just sit somebody... here making shit up. If somebody else pulls NXT that we haven't already asked for for Bobby Roode, somebody needs to do a trick song. Somebody needs to be Booker T in the background. <laughs> I'll do the oh, you part my FIFA. <laughs> I'll do the Booker T ad libs. Whoever does trick. All right, oh, that's fair. God. I'll do the song just so it's just going to be the two worst guys to do that. that that's what we should do. Trick right. Williams. Drop it and people say, what that trick? Because that'll oh, totally it? be me during Stand and Deliver. 
Damn I right. Know, I, I know, JJ. Isn't that my no, main event team? Yup. Trick and Mellow oh, main it, event. It, it's main event team over uh, Ilya and Tony? Uh, no, I care about story. the Don. Yeah, it's a better story, but that's, that's good for Trick and Carmel. That's awesome. That's cool shit. That is very good. I will say, okay. um, no one's gonna I'm... sit there trying to be serious, talking about you know Carmelo hates Trick Williams, and I'm just gonna be like, whoop that trick, uh huh, uh-huh. whoop that trick, yeah. Right. I feel I like, like it. <laughs> I feel like Booker T. Like every time Trick Williams comes out, his inner black snow comes back. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not Booker T. Booker T isn't the I'm Black Snow. <laughs> Damn it. Uh, well, it's better him from the stage and G.I. Bro outfits. Yeah, that's true. Oh right. Look at Freaking all these. Bad Bunny up there doing the Booker T song and he's dressed as G.I. Bro. Like, what the hell? Yeah, just Freaking... doing nothing like that. Freaking not the guys even standing and... there in like his Harlem Heat gear. Right. <laughs> yeah, well, Booker Damn, T, something. you know, he's all about that respect. All right, James, are you ready with your NXT song your NXT so I can song. get a little bit of a break before I have oh, to do yes, my yes. next one? Am I, am, I doing, am I doing glory? I thought I was doing the next match joint first. I, oh, well, no, no, that's 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 a prepaid one for later. Yeah. That is fair. That is fair. That is fair. Okay, well, yes. Luckily, it was like literally the next recommendation, so I'm ready. All right, here so now. here to do glorious the Heap Man, James Heber. Okay. Glorious! No, I won't give in. I won't give in till I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. Glorious! No, I won't give in, I won't give in till I'm victorious. And I will defend, I will defend, and I will do it us. No, I won't give in, I won't give in till I'm victorious. Until the end, until the end. All right, that's the end of the song, pretty much. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate it, appreciate it, appreciate it. We got Noah to give the nod like three times. That was awesome. <laughs> I was trying not to break every time I saw. Him. Oh my god! I was just trying to do the freaking was... thing on the edges when I'm sitting in my chair and I got like no room to spin. So. I love yeah. how stone faced he was too. That was so <laughs> great. Best. I was like, yeah, that's he, Bobby he, did. That's exactly how Bobby did it. Yeah, stone faced at first. All right, uh, All right Jeff, you ready with your mania theme? I am ready with my mania theme. Which I'm going to do one of the songs from WrestleMania 24. Okay. I'm not going to say which one, though. Fair enough. I'll be that guy. Because because I want my WWE one to be a surprise, too. I've picked a doozy. Ooh, there you go. Okay. So here to sing a theme song from WrestleMania 24 is Jeff Meacham. So here I am with my thoughts of you. And this world I've left for me. Yeah. Stone faces when I think. Still faces, sorry, Rick. And how I once believed. So now you call me. You know I won't let you through. Myself to deceive. So leave the memories alone. I don't want to see the way it is. It's how it used to be. So leave the memories alone. Don't change a thing. And I'll hold you here in my memory. Well. About that. <laughs> huh? Oh, about that with Flair. Hey, you know what? I went back there for that mania for that match. So yeah, it was a good match. It was. Should have made it minted. Yep. Agreed. Well, I only disagree with that. I can go off solo now. That'd be okay. Um, because my dad and I got Undertaker main event when we went to WrestleMania together. That is true. Can't, that's uh, fair. That's fair. I still think Taker and 
for Flair and Sean should have done it. Yeah, I had a random uh, fan friend of mine from the United Kingdom that that's not Laura um, see my picture of Dad and I with the Undertaker. Go, is that you with Undertaker? I'm like, yeah. She goes, how'd you arrange that? I said, they cost me two hundred fucking dollars. That's how I arranged it. <laughs> they didn't arrange anything for that. The money. <laughs> There was no arranging involved. There was no uh, chicanery or calling in favors. I just, here's my money. God help me later. Um, That's true. But yeah, Undertaker Edge was a great main event for Dad and I, but for the other 75,000 people, wrong main event. Yeah. Uh, All right. So I have my last one for this set to do. All right. And then unfortunately, as the Tilla dips, I'm going to have to take my name off the wheel because I believe my woman has gone to bed at this point. Okay. Tay. She has not said anything to me, but she could have also fallen asleep and forgotten to say something. So, you know, that, not to risk it. that is fair. Either way, the singing trio is down to three. So, yes. Uh, the the three musketeers, okay. boys. And there you go. So. Again, my song choice is going to be a surprise. Yes. It's one that if I had gotten this topic last time we did it, I would have done. But for whatever reason, it just never hit with me. So So looking to do it because it is so underrated. So this is a a WWE post-2002 song, right? Yes. Okay. So here to finish the round with a post-get the F out song. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, our host per excellence, the Renegade Eugene Williams. Yeah, what happened? Uh oh. <laughs> no, 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 it's it's fine. It's just the thing zoomed down on me real quick. No, Stupid right. thing. Technology, woo! I can see my fantasy. I'm so consumed with it. What I see takes over me. I'm blind beyond repair. Oh my God. It takes a hold of me so tight. A grip that does not give. And when she's done, she throws me out like junk left in a shell. Yeah, I want to have the right. I want to feel the night around the stars. want to take a flight and get back on my sights around the stars. Dude, that's, that's a solid take. That's great. David, Steve, I, I never... Has a theme song that sounds so awesome be given to somebody that is so undeserved. <laughs> well, no, no, I don't know what the song did him perfectly, though. You it did. It it did. It the did. guy won a reality contest. I want to yeah. see the lights around the yeah. stars. Like, all these guys are bigger than me. I just want to live in this moment. Right? Yeah, he's not wrong. Yeah, and he did. Yeah. And he hated that song. Dude, yeah, he did. He really said hated. in interviews that he hated yeah. that song. And I'm like, dude, that song fucking rocks. Dude, him and the thing is, is, you know, if you're a wrestling fan, like you don't want to be thrown in there as the, the starry-eyed kid. You want to like be in there like, no, I'm a badass. I belong here. But the theme fit his story. It just didn't fit Maven. Like it fit Maven's story coming into the company, but not Maven the man, right? Yeah. So I get it. I get it. And I wish I wish he could have not lost the love for it being in that damn company and, and stuck it out because he was good. He was good. He got the phone. He's still funnier than shit now. Dude, he is so. his YouTube career has been going nuts. Like he's it's ridiculous. Dude, okay, so there's this YouTube channel called U- uh CEO Club, right? Who who covers all wrestling YouTube channels. Oh, and he's about he has not even had his channel for more than a cup of coffee. He's yeah. about to surpass Jim Cornette in SEO. That's I like that a lot. ridiculous. That's ridiculous. Like that Cause he's like, and and I mean he's flying about to take over Jim Cornette's uh number one rank. Like that's oh, major. 
good that YouTube needs Maven more people like Maven it. and less like Jimmy Cornette. Like I, yeah, I, no, I, I, okay. People are going to be divided on Cornette and I, I'm a fan of Jim Cornette until he stopped being actively involved in the business. <laughs> but, mm -hmm. um, but yeah, but people need more positivity. That's why we try to keep this show as positive as possible on the regular. Sometimes it just makes it hard, but yeah. Um, yeah, sure. yeah we need far more Mavens and far less Cornettes. Agreed. Yep. Amen. Attila, I know you needed to dip out, so would you like to do your plugs and everything before you bounce? Yeah. I'm just making him for this. Okay. That yeah. Is. I'll do my plugs. Alrighty. All right. Yes. All right. So you guys can follow me on Twitter at, at Attila underscore talk all things wrestling. Um, I go live Mondays, Wednesdays, Fridays, I cover Raw, AEW Dynamite, Friday Night SmackDown. Um, uh, for WrestleMania week, I'm gonna be there, I'm gonna be doing seven simulcast alongside A Plus Hero Report. I'm gonna be doing Raw, Go Home Show to Mania, SmackDown Go Home Show to Mania, NXT Stand and Deliver, WrestleMania Night One and Two, Raw After Mania, SmackDown After Mania. As far as NXT is concerned, that's not going to be simulcast. It's just going to be simply over on A Plus Hero Report because I don't want to give people the false aspirations that I'm going to be doing NXT on a weekly basis. Ooh. So, so NXT, I have the NXT. I, and you're doing I have, the go home and the after stand and deliver, right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What's the name of that other channel? Just so I can make sure I subscribe so I can watch that. Yes. A Plus Hero Report. Okay. I um I think I set up the stream to be on your Twitch. Do I not need to do that then? Just uh after just Saturday after Mania because okay. last time when you guys did the open mic night for Royal Rumble, I couldn't live stream my review on my Twitch because you guys were Oh okay. Uh, yeah, yeah. Twitch is yeah, so that, weird with the that's show part like of that. why I wanted it to be separate streams for open mic night. That way we can set the mania one up on her Twitch. But open okay. mic night wouldn't be. Uh, that's why I want to make sure. That's why I didn't create the one for next week. So for WrestleMania Sunday, we can go on your Twitch. Yeah. Okay. And WrestleMania yeah. Saturday, we just can't do yeah. open mic night on her Twitch. Got it. Okay, I will fix that right now. Then. Yeah, you're cool. Because Same. while we're doing open mic night, she's going to be doing the review. Just. And of course, you're All more right. than welcome to pop in after you're done with your review and join the Absolutely. team. Yeah. Yeah. Hello. Okay, so hey. post stand deliver on Twitch on your Twitch or no? What do you mean? Post stand deliver. Can we deliver. do the stand and deliver on your deliver, Twitch also? And then take it off the air when it's open mic night. No, that that, no, that, no. that that's already two different James. streams, James. Ow. James, let, we got let this. The, let the guys that run the channel handle it. <laughs> Love you, dude. Now you confused yeah. me. Okay, we're uh, doing. Are we allowed to stream the watch loan for stand and deliver on your Twitch? And then stop it when it's over so that you can do your recap. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Just checking. Just checking. All right. Okay. Good to go. All right. Well, thank you for joining us. Get your rest. Yes. We oh, appreciate you, you being here for a little bit. It was awesome. I'll see you guys next week. Bye. Yes. Bye, Bye Detella. Power down, Bye. guys. All right, and then there were four. The four horsemen, as we were called earlier. Yes, yes, yes. This is my knockoff one because the other one's in the longer. James, <laughs> yes. are you ready to do the best of both worlds before we start the final spins? I am indeed. All right. So here to do the best of both worlds. No, not Jay-Z and R. Kelly, not Van Halen. James Hebert. Oh, so Hannah Montana. <laughs> Jeff. Sorry, Jim didn't do it. My bad. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Damn it, Meacham, you <laughs> idiot. I know it. I know. He's the man. All right. He's well, he is the man on the marquee, so he can get away with uh, <laughs> I um, that. We're not afraid to bring the fight. Wanted the best of both worlds, and it starts here tonight. When all the stars, they collide, now the future looks bright. Because we want the best of both worlds. 
And it starts here tonight. Did you all really think you were not going to get James Freeman? I always knew we'd be better when we were together, right? Like we would conquer the world, <laughs> even just for a night. I still remember the time and place when the vision came. From that day on, we've been elevated. I went, I went so left from, I went so left from Morgan Freeman, and I went, I went fucking. Well, you know what? We'll, we'll add him here too. Walking and just we'll, we'll, we'll add him here too. Fuck it. From that okay. day on, we've been elevated. James. We're good, bro. Oh, <laughs> no, man. No, 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 no. I got to do at least the first chorus, though. I got to do the first chorus. Okay. okay. We're almost I'll done. We're already. almost done. There's four lines left. There's four lines left. I promise. Okay. <laughs> it's like, um, it's like we took what we wanted and didn't ask for it. <laughs> kind of like this rendition. Let it go. <laughs> No concern for the past. Or if we were talking our only shot, now fast forward. Look what we built. Now we're bigger, better. And that's because we're not afraid to be the fire. <laughs> okay, okay, that's enough. All right, that's all, that's all, that's all. All right. All right. That was a whole lot of shit. Noah. <laughs> Noah, good sir. I uh, know the I know the real answer, but are you ready to get Brodus Clay out of the way? I ain't doing no dancing. I'm just sitting down moving my arms. That's all the man can do actually move arms, not move his legs. Get this weird jackass dumb theme over with. Okay. I would I would volunteer to do the Brodus Clay leg part, but we might get thrown off YouTube if I do it. I'm just throwing that shit out there. Yeah, that good call. I'll do the his shit. Oh, there you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> James, like, the fucking Jackson dance. thriller dance that he always did, <laughs> but like that's about as best as I can do. <laughs> and then we still have twelve spins to do. Oh shit! With only three of you on the wheel. <laughs> oh, my God. This is gonna be the longest last hour of the show ever. Hey, you know what? We'll make it fun for Noah at least. If it's just the three of us, we'll make it fun. Uh, we'll make it fun. Uh, we need to find a way to work your work your various voice uh, impersonations into the songs if you do it, James. That's gonna be oh, I'll, 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 uh, don't worry. All the Christopher it. Walken, all the Morgan Freeman, all the Gilbert Gottfried you can handle. Oh, oh God. that's one Gilbert I got. Gilbert Gottfried, he'll lose Thank his you. voice. We need him Thank for you. next Thank week, you. dude. I'll de no, I'll definitely do the Gilbert oh. Gottfried. He's only calling one thing. I mean, I'm the guy that's no, calling six no, different things and hosting two wait, wait, No, no. He's calling blood 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 all right, ladies and gentlemen. So here oh to God. do Rodus Clay. Somebody call my mama. Noah Foster. Noah, just think hey, of it hey. as first. Just think of it as Ernest Miller's theme because that was his theme first. The what? Yeah. Don't Ernest confuse Cat the way. He's already fucked up enough here. It's true. <laughs> I'm not wrong. Oh, With his wannabe James Brown dancing. That's true. Th 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 that's a that's an insult to James Brown, and I will do James Brown justice. All right, this ain't James Brown. Don't get me started. That's my freaking music I grew up on. That's yeah. right. Yeah, Dude, yeah, James Brown. This guy wished he had the freaking rhythm of James Brown. <laughs> Once that was done, I got a great James Brown story. Speaking of that, but go ahead. All right, let's get this done with. I'm trying to figure out the energy of this song. This song is so damn stupid. I agree. <laughs> Remember, Funky's on a roll. That's how it starts. Oh, that yeah, that's how it starts, right? Yeah. Uh, Funky's on a roll. Ah, yeah. Funky on a roll. Hey, 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 yo. Funky's on a roll. Somebody call my mama. It's about to get funky up in here. Yeah. Now, since what is this shit? Wow, the one of this was a punishment. <laughs> oh my god. Ugh. 
Somebody call my mama. Yeah, yeah. Somebody call my mama, baby. Somebody call my mama. What you say? Somebody please call my mom. Fuck me. Somebody call my mama. Oh, God. Oh, my mama. Hit me. Somebody please call my mom. Fuck me. God, what you say now? God. What you got? Fuck. Stop for me. Oh, my God. Beyond all belief, fuck me. Just run out of it. it. Whoa, make the body go. Oh, shit, that thus the girl I know. God, fuck is on a roll. Let's let it flow. Make your body go. Go home. Trust the girl I know. Oh, God, this keeps repeating. Cut the shit. Cut the shit. Cut the shit. Go to commercial. I will never in God's good eye ever okay. see that okay. again. Okay. Well, luckily, that's the most pragmatic movement and freaking ranting you'll get out of me tonight. Oh, my no. God. There's nothing worse than that. So, well, no, no, no. There, there are actually two things worse than that, though. First of all, that was the man, for some reason, that Billy Corgan decided to be the face of the NWA. <laughs> Billy Corgan lost his brains a long time ago. I yes. think I think Billy Corgan was testing out the cocaine that Jim Mitchell used on that pay per view. Anyway, um, <laughs> don't mess shit out there. It's the truth. It's it, actual. It's factual. Everything <laughs> is sad. And there. All right, so. The James Brown story. No, you'll appreciate this because you're a James Brown fan. So when Ernest Miller used that song starting in WCW, he even used a song in WCW, but for whatever reason, he had the same type of gimmick where he was like doing the James Brown thing. He had a feud with our buddy, the Stro, the Maestro, and they were going into Super Brawl, and Ernest Miller in character kept claiming he was going to bring James Brown to Super Brawl, but they never actually advertised it for Super Brawl 2000, right? James Brown was there. They paid James Brown to be there with no prior advertisement on a pay-per-view. They paid that man to be on a pay-per-view, and they didn't advertise he was actually going to be there. WCW 2000, 2000 for 200 Alex. That's yeah. a unique circumstance. Like, yep, that, that's a thing. What the fuck were they doing in that first quarter of 2000? Like, they had a very high-paid musical superstar. But yeah. we're not going to advertise you anywhere here. We're going to make you think he's not going to be there because Ernest Miller is a fucking buffoon in the gimmick. Which is hilarious because right after, and this leads into another story, Jeff, Eric Bischoff gave them royal shit for doing so and say, you are not doing that when I bring Kiss in. You are fuck off if you think you're doing that when I bring well, Kiss well, in. Well, the thing is, they, <laughs> they, they advertised Kiss and they brought them in and for like that one appearance to introduce um, the demon. Uh, the demon, which was right after he became Thorborg. I, I, I remember, I, I remember the whole thing with Kiss and all that. But the New Year's Evil thing Bischoff had planned with Kiss doing a whole concert and the divorce, not the wedding, of Dennis Rodman and um, Carmen oh, Electra. Lord. That was when Harvey Schiller said, "Okay, Eric, it's time to go home." <laughs> Good Lord, what, to go home what the boy. world is industry? Yeah, sorry, Arlene. I don't, I don't, I, I don't have the as bad movement as Brodus Clay to do that shit. You want a, some other body movement? Chat, I, with, ch chat with JJ and them later and chastise me. I will recommend against my better judgment to have Arlene watch the 2012 Hall of Fame ceremony and just get to the part of Edge's speech where he shows the slow motion of Brodus Clay. That's what you're gonna get. That like that's the best you're gonna get because it's yeah. just so funny yeah. and so yeah. gross. <laughs> It, okay. It's like, okay. It's like if Jello didn't have movement, it's what it would look like. Well, JJ. JJ, okay. go ahead. Continue this madness. Before we get to our final spins, yes, we're going to take another commercial break. Okay. We're going to re-air the commercial that Noah loves so much. Yes. And we will be right back. <laughs> And now, preview time. So let's take a look at what's coming your way. This excites me. To add to Noah's comment, Brodus Clay has cement in his thighs. Three, two, one!
freaking April and Summer going on practically every week except the last one before we go into freaking May and prepare for what's ahead with Backlash. But again, all the wrestling, 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 all the professional wrestling, damn it! And sports entertainment. But the sports entertainment is far more interesting than usual to me. Yay! And we love you for that. Mr. Foster, the last Saturday in April is not an off day. It's the return of match game. And Noah's face. Yeah, we're actually going to have back to back game night weeks. We do. Ooh. Because going... it'll be bad match game the last weekend in April. And then the first weekend in May, because it's May the 4th, we're doing the Star Wars trivia night. Ooh. That'll be fun. That's going to be a fun. So it'll basically be like Jeopardy, but it'll be Star Wars questions. No, all I'm going to do is read because I don't know anything about Star Wars or Star Trek. I'll just be Alex Trebek. On we that. know you don't watch movies. You only watch professional yeah. wrestling. You're damn right. Even though yeah. I'm sure once you were, when you were a wee lad, you saw the original trilogy at least once. Nope. No, wow. you've Gosh. never seen any of the Star Wars movies? Wow. Nope. It never is very rare that to meet somebody. That's Never not at least in the movie. Wow. Interesting. Well, I mean, to be fair, he didn't know what the hell White Snow was before until we educated him. No, that's him. fair. Now, <laughs> it, it'd be a cool hey, classic thing. That was a Star Wars thing, not Star Trek? No, yeah. no, 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 no. Spaceballs, but yeah. Spaceballs was the, was the yeah. Yeah. Uh, parody of Star Wars. Don't worry about it. This, <laughs> okay. this wheel looks kind of pathetic compared to what it looked like. <laughs> <laughs> I don't so like cool. the wheel. <laughs> hey guys, did you like it? Did you like us? Uh, now you're gonna be stuck with us, so that's get right. Ready. Oh, bloody that's hell. How many times is this gonna land on Noah? Let's see. Yes! <laughs> All right, so, so since we have 12 spins left, yes, yes, we'll do six and then six this time instead of five, five, and two. So, okay, okay. spin one. I don't want to look. I'm a scared. Yep. Noah. <laughs> Welcome to the Noah Hour here on the All Mike Night uh, <laughs> Show. Spin two. Fuck it. I look. Why not? Go ahead. I go all over me. I dare you. Just do it. Again. <laughs> do it all night. Go for it. Oh, uh, it's on it's me. It's on me, Noah, this time. It's on me. It's on me. We might get lucky and actually do the odds. 33. You got 33 and one third chance. Oh, you think about yeah. You Better see, no. It's not math. I don't see, you Foster. The numbers don't lie. And they. Nope. Disaster. You. Yeah. There we go. Good At sacrifice? Uh, oh, yeah, we're going to sacrifice. Yep. Okay, so two for me. How this four broke me before Starting Map ever did. And Starting Map got broke. Oh, uh, no. <laughs> I get to have a quiet round, I think. <laughs> why? It's just, why? Why do I do this yep. Seriously. I know, right? Oh, here I am again? Or is it Noah? Here I am again. <laughs> Forget, 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 Forget Noah yeah. James Hour, not on commentary. There you go. J James has That's been right. selected three times. Uh, it's the prelude to WrestleMania weekend where we have Noah and JJ. It's going to be Noah and James all night. I oh, told you. Wow. <laughs> I got I got, I got my work cut up for me. Damn. Okay, so Noah was number one and number two. I, I have it all marked down. Okay, cool. Okay, cool. Yeah, it was number four. Oh, God. This is where it gets fun. All right. Whew. Noah, your first yeah. song is? Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. Please be something good. Oh, shoot. E <laughs> No, no. Yeah. If you want, if you want a recommendation, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, James. Oh, okay. Let's see, what we get here first. That's fair. That's fair. That's fair. James's uh, first spin. Uh, Ooh. Oh. 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 Whoa. Ooh. It got there. It got there. James's second spin. Danny, you're right. Like I said, he has risen, and so has Noah's blood pressure. NXT again. (laughs) 
Noah's second one. Oh no. Indeed. Ooh, there we go. Oh dear. I've got a great one for you, Noah. I got a few. James is third. Ooh, there we go. Mm. Okay, so I got to do an indie. Mm -hmm. And the last one for James. WWE. Man, he got all different choices. That's good. That's cool. What? Are, uh, so what was the second uh, choice on that one, just to clarify? All right, so Noah has an ECW and an indie wrestler. Yep. James, you have a Mania theme, an NXT theme, an indie theme, and a WWE theme. NXT theme, gotcha. Okay, I'll All go right. with Rebel Heart for that one. I have a couple of suggestions for indie themes. Okay. Noah. Yeah. Do the final countdown. Oh, <laughs> Dude, you gotta do that one. Do okay. That. Okay, okay. James. Yes. Do you're the best around from the karate kid? Whose indie theme is that? Frankie right. Kazarian. Really? <laughs> yep. Wow. Yep. Wow. Okay. Okay. I was That's I was right. gonna because then we can clip that and send it, to, it to him. Yeah, you know what? Send it to him. Because of yeah. his relationship with Jeff, he might actually check it out and comment back. That's actually fair. Uh, you know what? We'll go with that. We'll Same with, with that. the final countdown. Say they both might with that. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I was gonna go with Nick Gage's for whom the bell tolls from Metallica, but that. that oh, I mean, that's a right. that, that's a solid that's second fair, choice. Right. That's fair. Yeah. yeah, but I'll go. I'll go with the. I'll go with the corporate chill for <laughs> whom the bell tolls works for WrestleMania. Just throwing it out there. That is true, but I already have one in mind uh, because okay. I'm gonna do a funny with it, and okay. we actually could play the instrumental to this. <laughs> Oh, okay. And, and yeah. Noah, if right. you're struggling for ECW, either do Pantera Walk for RVD yep. or do the Offspring Come Out and Play Raven. Noah, for, for reference, Walk is the one he uses on AEW now. Okay. Offspring sounds RVD. like the Crazy Taxi band, so I might actually know that one too. Okay. What, okay. What's that Offspring song called? I'm curious. Come though. Out and Play. Come out and you got to yeah. keep them separated. Yeah, that was yeah. for Raven. Yeah, yeah, it mm -hmm. was for Raven. Yeah, yeah. God, I I started watching CW so late, I never caught Raven in CW, like in, in his original run. So, Jeff Meacham yeah. Network Multiverse of Media Fun Fact Number Seven Hundred and Fifty Eight. This is also yeah. the theme song for No DQ CAW Easter. Oh, that, that that much I knew. So there you go. That much I knew. I was way too involved to not know that shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's fair. That's fair. The good old days. Yeah. Right, so yeah. I know Noah needs to look up his songs. I'm ready. Themes. Are you, which one are you going to do first? Your mania theme? I am doing my mania theme. And if y'all could, mm -hmm. uh, I I need you to share this because we actually uh, we actually could play the instrumental without this being a problem. So. Oh no! <laughs> He's going to do the thing. Yes, I am. And real quick, if you could also give me a solo shot with just my window in there. Yes, this is just. Well, 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 I'm saying, do you do you know the lyrics for sure that we can just go ahead and just? So, oh yeah, 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 for sure, okay. for sure. Yeah, I got it. I got it for sure. Yeah, just give him a solo then, that because because no, Jay, if you give him a solo, the music will still play in the background. Yeah, there you go, perfect. Or that. All righty. So here to sing, Limp Biscuit, Crack Addict, the first verse. Yes! Gilbert Godfrey! Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! This is gonna die right now. Before the time. Let's Here we go. Before the time. Come on, Come on. Let's go. Right about now! It's time to get busy! One, two, three, say, shut the fuck up! And being realistic, rip from the biscuit! Straight to the speakers, we go, hey, hey! Check the future shot! About revolution, punk! Oh my god! 
I forget the rest. <laughs> For a second, I blanked. I blanked because I went so fucking in. <laughs> Hold on. Let me just... Let me just let me just remind myself. All right, all right, no, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. Okay. All right, all right, yeah, yeah. Oh my god! I'll just do it. Round two, you're ready for a break. You keep on talking, I will break you up. Something like this. Or try to try to be prepared. Coming with the chicken and the skin, and I'm done right through. Rules for moving. Why you have to ruin all the music? Don't stop it, something knock, knock, knocking on heaven's door, whatever the fuck. Apocalypse now! Who's talking shit now? Give me the countdown three, three two, two, one! one. one. <laughs> Are you fucking ready, kids? No. <laughs> Chase for real. <laughs> oh, sweet baby Jesus. <laughs> you know, I've been a part of some crazy Gilbert Gottfried shit over my Disney fandom life. But goddamn, that was mad. <laughs> wow. Uh, there you go. Okay. And, and, and random. Way, okay. Random. Somewhat connected to Gilbert Gottfried. Not really. But okay. Just roll with me here. CC called me into the room yesterday. She was watching old episodes of Criminal Minds. Oh, geez. And there was an episode from the second season <laughs> yeah, yeah. that had Cameron Monaghan when he was still like a young, young man. Like, yeah, he was a baby on that show. Yeah. I told her, I was like, dude, why does he look like fucking Junior from Problem Child? Right. <laughs> right. Dude, wait, seriously. Of course, co starred Gilbert Gottfried. So that's where I made yeah. the tie right yeah. here. But yeah. Before Sweet baby Jesus, yeah. Before Cameron grew into himself, he looked a lot like the kid that played Junior, like for real. It, it gets, I mean, I mean, the right, the red hair didn't help him either. No, so. it really didn't. Oh okay. my God, James! Like, fuck! I'm so glad I'm out on this round. I can't follow that shit. Worth the hell? <laughs> I knew, I knew. If I'm like the minute WrestleMania theme came up, my brain went full like meme clockwork, and it's like, yeah. Honestly, Where once Jeff go? did my way earlier, I was like, somebody has to do crack addict. I don't think anybody was expecting Gilbert fucking Godfrey dude, to come out of all people. You are a twisted fuck, dude. You, you just, oh, God. I love all the right. part where I completely forgot and blanked, and then I blank again, and I just go, no, stop it, we're not, not, not going to whatever the fuck. <laughs> <laughs> That's a given we do. Yeah, absolutely it would be okay. all right okay uh, Noah, Noah yeah cool. are you ready with your ECW theme or your indie theme oh, you're muted bro Goddamn, rest. you are you are in fact muted Noah. <laughs> no he's unmuting <clears throat> damn it James you <laughs> freaking idiot <laughs> I deserve that one. It if there was ever is. a time, look at I, that it makes it better. Okay. <laughs> if there was ever a time, I deserved that one. I deserved that one that time. Oh. Oh. Noah, Sweet. the question again: Are you ready with either your ECW or indie theme? Um, I'll I'll do your final countdown. I just gotta get to the beginning because it's such a long intro. It is. It is, but it's it is. It's like a minute long intro, but dude, it is. But yeah, I'll, I'll do, I'll, I'll, everybody I'll, I'll, singing I'll, I'll that song, word for word, at Gorilla, <sighs> is what brought me to tears when he used that shit at Forbidden Door because, I, I, I God saw, damn, I saw JJ unlike how I've ever seen him before, yep. and then that broke my voice. No, it was. I remember American yeah. Dragon Ring of Honor. Hell yeah, dude. I mean, again, for y'all know I know, but for those of you at home that don't know, I literally woke my woman up out of dead ass sleep, popping because he was using fucking Final Countdown. Yep. And she didn't understand what was going on. I had to explain it to her the next day when she was a lot more coherent. <laughs> she still didn't completely get it. He kind of gave me the... They're there, babe. They're there. Right. But, 
But for those of us that experienced it in those Legion halls and those armories, yep. and we're part of that crowd seeing it, hearing that music hit, yep. seeing him at the scrum that night saying that he hadn't heard that song since the last time he came out to it in reign of honor right dude which at that point had been almost 13 years so ladies and gentlemen boys and girls children of all ages here to sing europe's the final countdown noah foster let's see if i can find it Oh, With the three of us on the refrain at the end, because we are all going to sing it, goddammit. I don't care. I wouldn't want any other way. <laughs> We're leaving together, but still it's farewell. And maybe we'll come back to Earth, who can tell? I guess there is no one to blame. We're leaving ground. Leaving ground. Will things ever be the same again? It's the final. It's the final. The final countdown. Carson just keeps going with that. Oh, man. I love that. That just that just felt good. That felt good right there. Thank you for thinking about that. Because like, wait, that's a well, wait, that's right. Was it D? Because we're gone. That yeah, that well, actually yeah. felt good. I would have continued probably too, but wasn't for the fact that again got the guitar going. No, nah, it's, it's all good. Like we should just do I that know, as a whole, just the whole thing. What did this in cohesion after each time it does like yes. more because of how much I, I know you, that. and I know how little you really enjoy this. <clears throat> So if I can come up with a song that I know you'll get a kick out of doing yep. that you'll actually fucking eat up. One on one hand. I'm all about that shit. Yeah, 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 and I found, knew yeah, found one. Yep, yep, I yep, knew you would yep, do found. Final Countdown. That with with honor, pun intended. <laughs> I am I am not, nor will I be an X Caliber fan. And the fact that he freaking you know, cited his damn Detroit Pistons during that, which damn the Pistons sure shot a bed for no reason this year um but the fact that he acknowledged that may be the greatest professional wrestler of all time and it's like man i will argue with it because there's a few but he is of this generation top five yeah. far none Agreed. i'm like yeah. he's, he's give me give me this brian danielson versus kurt angle yes in his prime <sighs> Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yes. The, the, there, are, there Brian are various. Danielson, new... Go ahead. Brian Danielson's last full time run has been the greatest watch along experience of my life. Professional wrestling fan. He's wrestled everybody and anybody in and out of the professional wrestling industry, and now he's wrestling his freaking idols in freaking the arena, Mexico. You yeah, can. I am. Yeah. 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 He's having a blast this weekend, and good for him. And I'll tell you what: if did ever you see there the was... video of Claudio from CMLL? Yes, yes, I did. Freaking doing the jump over the top rope, roll through in the rain. Like Freak. CMLL has hated on him for years, and he finally got there. So he was like, "Fuck y'all." Yeah. Yep. I'm, I'm doing. I'm doing the shtick. That's I'm it. Cool. You know Come what? On. Come out, show up. Well, both those guys are at a point in their lives. It's just like they, they're they're in full fuck it, like whatever. They don't like they're yep. they're, they're going for it, and good for them because they should. God damn it, damn right they exactly. should. Mm -hmm. Okay, but, but Brian, I, 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 I was gonna get this anyway. If there was ever a match I was ever gonna be jealous of, you guys calling this year, it's gonna be him and Osprey. Because God, God, get, uh, get yeah. me to freaking get me to dynasty. Get, get me to dynasty. Two weeks, two weeks, three weeks from tomorrow, guys. I'm, I'm telling you. you Will Osper is the future, like no cap. <laughs> Bar none. No. Yeah. And All right. and I would like to request to be on commentary for Willow versus Julia. Oh God. Absolutely. Please. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. 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 Yeah. We'll, James. We'll, we'll definitely get everybody in there. Yeah. yeah. They're ready. Are you ready, sir? I am ready. Joe Esposito, you're you the doing best, next. Right? Figure out RBD. Uh, okay. Joe Esposito, you're doing right? the best next. Yes. Yeah. yeah, yeah. For Frankie Kazarian, maybe. All right. So, for Frankie, 
is crazy. Dude, I listen to this shit religiously. This is on my wrestling themes generic playlist because that's got like is. everything. Yep. Here to scene, Joe Esposito's You're the Best Around, originally from the Karate Kid, but made famous on the indie circuit by Frankie, the future Kazarian, the Heat Man, James Heber. Try to be the best because you're only a man and a man ain't going to learn to take it. Try to believe through the going gets rough and you got to learn how to... Ah, oh, fuck. Oh, no. <laughs> redo, 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 redo. Okay, okay, redo. You're good, you're good. Redo. Take two. There we go. It's been so long since I heard this. Try to be the best because you're only a man and a man's got to learn to take it. Try to believe through the going gets rough and you got to hang tough to make it. History repeats itself and try, you'll succeed. Never a doubt that you're the one. Oh, jeez. Hold on. Hold on. That you're the one and you can have your dreams. Yeah. Thank you, Jeff. You're the best around. Nothing ever going to keep me down. You're the best around. Nothing ever going to keep you down. You're the best around. Nothing ever gonna keep you down. Oh, oh. All right, there we go. Woohoo! <laughs> I bought. Sorry, sorry, Frankie. I don't hate me, Frankie. Uh, right. Good times, man. Good times at that Jewish community center. Right. Somewhere, somewhere, listening to the ether, him and Chris and Sky and SoCal Val are all sitting there sobbing like idiots right now hearing that shit all over again. <laughs> or, 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 or they're having, or they're like, oh, who the, f oh, this kid's ruining our <laughs> no, 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 no. They're looking at it, it's like, who, dude, this kid sounds like nails on a chalkboard, bro. <laughs> no, 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 no. no. <laughs> All right. No, no, no I, uh, I got to convince them, him and his band to cover that song just once, just to make him pop. Anyway, for real, let have gutter candy doing you're the best around. Dude. Like that would just be such a meta moment, dude. Freaking, we are wasted. Did Danger Zone, and he and I were across the yard, and we both went, God damn it. And nobody was like, What the fuck did they do? Like, they didn't get it. We're the only two that are going, Yeah, we understand. I understand that reference. Yes, yes. I wish Top you'd have been there. <sighs> Top Gun Maverick, good movie. Go see it. Top Gun Tower, the wrestler, came out to that song, but he started this song before it went to the do the God, you could walk out and go God, for no reason. Uh, fair enough. Well, I mean, yeah. the, the reason in character was he was like high on cocaine, but you know. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> yeah. He I mean, like powder like powder, powder donut oh, yeah. all up <laughs> under his face and then top lip you know, and everything. It, it's funny you mention that, JJ, because like uh <laughs> <laughs> God damn it, James. Oh, you dude, freaking uh, idiot. idiot. I, I have. Noah, are you ready with your ECW team? Uh, I think you said Pantera, right? I think so. Again, I said ago. either Pantera Walk or The Offspring come out and play. I'll do the Pantera. It the seems like it's easier to keep up with. It. Yeah, it is easier to keep up with, to be fair. What's up, Big G? Yes, the show oh, is going Big good. G. Six more days. Yes. Right. Shit, five now for most of the country. Yeah. <laughs> hey, we're still West Coast. We've got 29 minutes. East Coast represents yes. also heroes. Very Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Anyway. Oh, so, man, it's crazy. It's under All a right. week. So here to do Pantera's walk. The whole fucking show. Noah Foster. Hey, oh, man, with that here. one. Oh, hi. Hello. So hype. <clears throat> One of a kind. Oh wait. It's she oh. obviously bothered by persistence. Ooh. One step from lashing out at you. We did. You get a skin and call yourself a friend. Well, I've got more friends like you. What do I do? Is there no standard anymore? But it takes what it is, who I am, where have I been too long. You can't be something you're not. I don't know this one. So he by yourself, yourself. By yourself. Stay away from me. Yeah, it's, it's one of those like uh, heavy metal lessons learned in life. No, from that time. Oh, yeah. damn, get out. Uh, I just wait for that part because that's the only part to play. Ready? There it is. Get out. out. Back. Don't get out. Out. Walk. Don't get out. What did you say? Don't get out. Out. Three. 
Back. Fuck. You talking to me? Are you talking to me? That's, you know that's, what? That's that different metal vibe right there. We were talking yeah, yeah. about people to clip. We had Swerve with Greg earlier. We have uh, Frankie. We have uh, we have Danielson. We forgot Van Dam. Like we can tag that to Van Dam. No? Yeah, yeah, Maybe, yeah. 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 Why not? Yeah, why not? Jeff, hey, Jeff can probably hit RVD up on the DL. Be like, hey, bro, I tagged you in something on Twitter. Uh, yeah, I will. I will. I will say if if NXT does indeed cave to WWE and NXT goes to Vegas, since it's going to be a small show in a small venue, I might have to do a side trip. Oh, good lord almighty! That is fair. Because damn it, I got robbed of my 420 experience. Not that I would actually smoke, because I'm not going to. You know, I mean, I would have. I, I would have on April 20th with him. I I fucking would have. But I, I need to go see him and Katie if I go out there. Yes, that's fair. That's fair. James, are you ready with either your NXT or WWE theme? I am ready with my NXT, or I was ready. Where the fuck did Rebel Heart go? I had Rebel Heart ready, and then it, it disappeared. Uh, I was ready. Rebel Rebel with it. I just need to search it up like one more time. The, the Rebel version. Heart. Where Rebel. has Rebel See, And I thought Rebel. the next NXT person was going to do Trick Williams. That way I could do the ad libs. Yeah, I don't know right. the I don't know that one to even be able to do that great. justice. So there's that. It's pretty much you just whoop that trick over and you, over again. You just yeah. can't wait to whoop that trick at stand deliver. Damn you? right. See, I am so torn in that match because I respect and love Mello. Right. The trick needs that win because uh, Mello is more than likely main roster bound. Uh, yeah. yeah. He's not the only so, one. Yeah. So, so I'm this- very much torn in that match because I I, I love yeah. them both. So yeah, that. Go ahead. Good. I was just gonna say that that card now is the only reason I'm not going out late Friday night to my friend's debut show at the Bourbon Room because I I want to be here to produce and watch that show get called. That show is gonna be fucking lit. Yeah, this stand deliver is extremely promising to me, and I look very right. forward to watching and con it with JJ. Yeah, I, I I have a feeling this stand deliver is going to be harder to follow for the main roster kids that the kids listen to me, Jesus Christ, for the main roster folks than last year's because last year's was solid too. Yeah, but this and year, I, 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 I didn't see last year's because I was out gallivanting around famous. So, um. You know, I you know, you know, Undertaker and shit. Look at me. Um, so, you know, but uh, but yeah. yeah, I mean, you know, yeah, that's true. They were next door, but you know, I paid twice as much to meet one person because I but, have no fucking sense. Um, it's, <laughs> you know. I wonder if Walter is going to the world, dude. I hope he is, because he he was originally going to get there on Friday, but now that he knows Jade is going to be there on Thursday, right. like I think he's right. going to go early so he can meet Jade Cargill, bro. Dude, That's fair. if if he, God, I wish there was a way he could like, like not not sneak a video because that just sounds way too freaking like. Uh, wrong. I know what like, you mean though. I mean it does sound wrong, yeah, but right. just a way for him to like get a little Say video hi. clip of her like saying hi to me. Yeah, saying hi to you. Of given how much I've supported, you know. Right. Well, I mean, I've got we'll her figure it out. We got a shirt. Yeah, Whichever right? night she's wrestling, I am wearing that shirt that night. Yes, that's fair. I just I just realized right now that Till still has my MJF shirt. I just remember that shit right now. <laughs> oh well, damn it. that's fair. All right, that's anyway, fair. No, anyway, I, that's, I'm ready. All right, so here to seeing Johnny Gargano's Rebel Heart is the Heat Man, James Ebert. I am Under- singing. I am singing the CFO version. I don't know the new lyrics to the freaking Def Rebel one. And no, fuck, Def Rebel. <laughs> fuck Def Rebel. Uh, be yourself. Be yourself. Can be no one else. Another day. Gotta give him hell. It's burning straight through the dark. This Rebel heart. This Rebel heart. <laughs> Can't break what I've been building up this far. Yeah, you'll never tear me apart. 
that, that, that's it. That's all they have. That's it. That's all, folks. Beneath, beneath, that's, that's, that's all, folks. Good night, everybody. Good night, everybody. <laughs> Good night, everybody. <laughs> Sorry about that. I, I was a little bit slow almost. on the draw because I had to go get me another drink. That's fair. That's all right, man. You're good. You're good. You're good. This portion of Open Mic Night brought to you by Prime. Bro. Oh, fuck. Bro. Bro. No, I ain't even going to lie. This shit slaps. And Noah. I, this shit slaps. And Noah, I have three more of these for next week and two of the energy ver- versions of the same flavor. You're, 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 you're trying to push me to buy one for the thing, are you? Dude. Dude, the I'm final not boss push. has his own energy drink. Come on, what are you doing to me? I am not going to push because I don't force people. That's right, you don't. But I'm right. just saying, I am prepared. Be prepared. I might be doing some stuff on Friday. I am saving, I am we'll saving the energy drink versions for Saturday and Sunday because, God damn it, NXT is starting at 8 o'clock in the morning for our mm-hmm. stream. In our your time. case, yeah, I get that. So I'm going to need an energy drink, and then who knows what time the Slammies are going to be the next day. I Hopefully we'll get that announcement Monday. I said that, that would be so, nice. So damn ridiculous. I'm just gonna put looking it out at there you, right Paul. Here. Need a little help there. Um, my favorite. Yes, one, this portion brought to you by Prime. I, my favorite version, by the way, is man, uh, orange mango. I'm still representing the final boss. Whatever. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> None of the stores near me carry. So, uh, <laughs> they don't either. They, they they don't carry me either. That's why I got the Amazon. Prime <laughs> delivery. Um, there you go. I use Prime I delivery for a long time. What is your favorite do, energy drink? <laughs> I do plan to pick up some Slim Jims also, just in case they throw yes. Slim Jim yes. around for like they did the last couple times. Cheap so, I'm, Cheap sure LA, I'm sure LA Knight, yeah, yeah. Will, yeah. will likely have a Slim Jim spot simply if it's not. Hey, JJ, it's WrestleMania. Grab you some Snickers. Just don't mention it out there. That's hey, true. you know that, what? That's very true. Okay, have you guys seen the new commercial? With the street profits and out the mud. Yes, yes, yes. 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 It's the GTA rejects. <laughs> Noah, the GTA rejects are in the new stickers commercial with the street profits. Oh, that's such bull. No, it's, no, it's hilarious, he, Noah. Actually, he, Montez is a dick in that commercial because he's hungry and he needs a sticker. It's so funny. Angelo Dawkins invited him over for a roast. And so Tez is there roasting OTM, like, you know, a comedy roast. And Angelo's like, what are you doing? He's like, you invite me over for a roast. And he's like, yeah, my mom's roast. And he brings out, like, this pot roast that he just finished cooking. Oh, and like, so Tez takes a bite of the Snickers. But, dude, you I, yourself when I, you know, I know you're not a big fan of OTM, but it shows me that they have some serious faith in them if they're putting them yeah. in a fucking Snickers commercial with the profits during mania season that I says mean, yeah. huge things yep by the way for the record uh, uh, jeff's favorite energy drink is zoa <laughs> that's right yeah, that's right i mean that's how they should advertise that should have roman do the commercial i'm just you know. yeah yeah um, i mean we're we're doing this sponsorship deal might as well go right? i um but yes I, I will get a couple of snickers i'm glad you pointed that out i'll probably get snickers ice cream because snickers were murder on my lack of teeth so like I probably just do Snickers ice cream. It's a little bit softer. Snickers ice cream. Is that not the right. shit, right? I mean, yeah. damn. Let's let's try to get back on track. Yeah, we still have what? one more for this round, and we still have six more spins. Yeah. Are listen. you ready with your last one, James? The WWE one. Uh oh yes, uh yes. Uh, let me get Orlando Jordan steam up real quick again. I think gotta oh, get, gotta be like so, oh. oh. <laughs> And say, oh yes, so yes, we do in Chicago. Oh yes, so yes, he went for the gun, for the gun, for the gun. Um, you know the the, okay. the the song that sounds like it's from a gangster. I have movie. a, I have a request. It doesn't have to be adhered to, but who, uh, if any of you guys get WWE next, you do your OJ because I know you've been waiting to do this one. Anybody who gets WWE next, do Matt Hardy version one. Oh my God! Uh, okay. Okay. I can slap a tornado. <laughs> Yeah, for every 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 bit of shit we give WCW Slam Jam, I go Matt Hardy version one. Just throwing it out there. Hey, you know what? That dial up shit was a was good of time. That shit was awesome. That part was good. Yeah, and then the yeah. bad facts. That, yeah, that, that, the that, that, presentation. Ver, ver, ver. The bad facts were gold. The lyrics. Of that keeps yeah. his thermostat at a toasty seventy two degrees. <laughs> It's like, what do you live in LA now? What the fuck? Did you live in North Carolina? Like, geez, not that serious. Oh, gosh. All right. 
Oh, sweet baby Jesus. This is getting ridiculous. Hello on Twitch. That means you're watching Tatilla's chat. So hello to Gibbs. Good to see you as well. Yes, yes. Hello. Oh. Hello, Gibbs. Good to see you on Twitch. Yes. How you doing, Tatilla brother? Twitch is here. Thank you Everywhere. for supporting Tatilla, even though yes. she is tapped out for the evening. She was oh, tired. Fuck. She was awesome tonight. She was great. Yes. Good okay. Sport. She came up quite a bit. I am, yeah. uh, I am in fact, ready with my rendition. That's but I, ready for the mission is the which key. which of your characters is seeing this, or is uh, it just James that's actually? It was just gonna it? be me. It was just gonna okay. be me because I don't I don't so, know how you do this really. So Carefully. here to do Orlando Jordan's theme song is Wait, the who? man James Hebert. Who'd you say, Jeff? I said Did careful. You say you Jordan? That's true. That's true. Okay. All right. Here we go. Uh, uh oh. Uh, uh oh. No. Nothing new but the money, huh? Yeah, I'll do what I want to, and I want to say what I want to, make who I want to. When it comes to cars, I do it big. When it comes to money, I do it big. When it comes to making moves, I do it big. Whenever I do, oh my god, I should have done Donald Trump, <laughs> but I can't. Uh, whenever I do stuff, yeah, I do it big. <laughs> Man, it's good. It's got to be a gift and a curse because I'm feeling my best and y'all feeling the worst. Simply means somebody's going to get hurt. No pain felt here unless y'all are feeling it first. Don't play with me. I mean, you should know I might dress up because I might be going to a funeral. Okay, then that's kind of right, dark. Then. I didn't know that part. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all, right, all, right, all right. That's that's a bit dark. Jesus. All no right. stopping me. That's unlikely. Wow, and I can just do it like Nike. Man, yeah, they want to be like me because the girls want to creep <laughs> me <laughs> nightly. Wait, oh, no, 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 wait, wait. Pause. I think the James girls, has regrets in his life, George. No. <laughs> the girls want to creep with me nightly. Ladies, yeah, I'm single, but I'm far from a from the wedding thing. But I have married women switching up their wedding ring. Okay, so okay, so he's he's just all over the place with his morals. <laughs> Jesus. WWE uh, socks that don't age well for two hundred else. Yeah, and and I'll take wow. on anybody for the right price. I don't know what he means by that. If you want to know really what my life's like. Manicure check, masseuse check, chef check, and I demand my respect. Wow. And then it goes on. Wow. What the fuck? All right. That's, wow. <laughs> no, wait. Dude, I, I have regrets authorizing that one. <laughs> Dude, no. And, and for the record, folks, I I always found the song catchy. This is the first time I'm, like, digesting right. the lyrics, like, full so, on. Wow. So, so uh, what we do is. I have a request. If, if, if somebody wants James to do Orlando Jordan next year, he can do it in the Scooby Doo voice that we can go rut row instead of uh oh. Like Scooby. Okay. This song is in 2024 proof, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Before we do our last set of spins, <sighs> I'm going to throw to the Friends of the Multiverse trailer so you can see how to follow all of us affiliated with the Multiverse of Media. Which will hopefully keep the shills toned down a little bit because you'll see how to follow us all right here. Oh. And now, preview time. So let's take a look at what's coming your way. We want to take a moment real quick to once again thank um, the Cleveland combatant, Josh Mansfield, Maddie Laws, Walter Cruz, Mr. Reliable, Datilla, all for coming and hanging out and participating for a little bit. Greg Cherry. 
Yes. Awesome to have him on. Yes. For a little bit. Did I miss anybody? I think that covered everybody that's coming. I think, on. So. I think that's everything. And then, of course, the four horsemen of the multiverse. Yeah. <clears throat> Jay, but before you spin, I, I just want to shout out uh, Mattel. SummerSlam 2024 Elite figures. Lex Luger from 93. Um, Kane and Undertaker from SummerSlam 2003 and X-Pac from 1998. The build a figure is referee John Cohn. I need this set. <laughs> I love me some John Cohn. I don't know why. I, I have an unnatural love for that man. He's just funny as hell. So yeah, I, need that I need that figure set. Anyway. There you go. Carry on. Freaking round son of a God bless it. All right. I was, I was mad. I went into the Walmart over here by me the other day, and I actually found the Roxanne Perez figure. Oh. Somebody had gotten into it and stolen the NXT Women's Title. What? I hate. God damn! I hate when they do that. It's so yeah, insane. Right. That's all they want. They went through every elite figure and stole the belts out of all of them. Wow, yeah. that is uh, next level uh, subterfuge. That's bullshit. Yeah, bro. Uh, yeah, I mean, part of I'm it like, is I'm not. I'm not huge on the figure game anymore. Like, right. I want right. to get the people that I saw come up through the system on the indie circuit. Yes, yes. And then, like, I've decided that I want to get people that are my NXT. Like, I want right. to support them. So I want to get Roxanne. I want to get Mellow. I want to get the pretty deadly set that's coming out. But if yep. they don't have their mish tops on them, I'm not buying them. Right. Because that's a fucking fail. It's an elite figure. They never wrestle shirtless. They always wrestle with their fucking mesh tops. Yep, exactly. Mm -hmm. That sounds completely gay of me to say, but I don't freaking <laughs> care. No homo. Everyone here knows I've got a woman. That's it. That's but if it. they don't have those mesh tops, I'm not getting it. Hey, listen, nah. to, to be fair, I want to get a Ron Breaker Hardy, figure. Yeah, I want to get yeah, everybody sure. that is my NXT. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. There's, there's very few that I actually want. I was making a haha -ha with the the figure set, but like, like I want the Undertaker from the Dead Man Show set because that's cool. Someone to get to the Undertaker that Dad and I pose with, like for real. Yeah. Same with the uh, the the Paul Bearer blue variant because that's about as close to Percy as we're gonna get. So just a little stuff like that. But yeah, I just and I get Walmart security's top priority is not the WWE section. Like I understand that shit. They got some high end stuff in there. Okay. Hello, but, human um, person. Good to see you. <laughs> I mean, he's not wrong. Whoever they're not, wrong. they're not wrong either. Um, but uh, anyway, all right. Uh, so let's get to these last six spins so that we can go on the OT tonight. So. Yeah, I think we go OT on, on karaoke night. It's almost always a thing. And pretty much all of these were paid for by Arlene and Emmanuel. Like, there was two that were from Dwayne. Yep. So God bless you guys. Oh no, again. <laughs> oh Jesus. The Domingo so, uh, siblings every, came through today, man. Yeah. yeah, pretty much every performance we've done have been courtesies of the Domingo siblings. Thank you for everything you guys do for us. Yeah, seriously. If you all want, if you all enjoyed tonight's show, find their socials and kiss their asses today. Yeah, wow. seriously. Oh, I, it, me again. <laughs> Welcome to James After Dark, everybody. James After Dark, it's going crazy. Keep it unplugged. Keep it unplugged. Ah! Waka waka. <laughs> oh, good lord. That's fuzzy, man. Hey, hit me. Okay, cool. Number three. Hey. Well, number, number three is me. God damn it. Fucking thing popped. Yeah, it does. Ooh. Uh -oh. Uh, -oh. Uh, -oh. Uh, -oh. uh oh! There we go. All right, we got no one. Yeah. <laughs> it's only one, brother. Relax. You're good. Dude. Yeah. To be fair, it, it could have been like three times, like last time. All right. right. Oh, Jesus Christ! That, that wheel fucking moved. Enough wheel. Stop it. Did and there's it? Jeff again. Hey. So three and five. Okay. Hey, hey, hey. I like the sound. The me's my favorite part. I almost think we shouldn't even spin. We should just give Noah the last one. That way, each of you has two. Yeah. I agree. All right. I, I, I agree. You, Noah, are you okay with that, or do you want me to spin, bro? I'll do it. That's fine. Okay. That's fine. Okay, cool. 
Okay. Yeah. Okay, so let's go here then. Things I do for uh. <laughs> James Things as first YouTube. is going to be. Ooh, interesting. Let's see. It's a weird one. It, it is a Oh no no no! Uh, uh, another independent theme. Okay, hmm. I, I know DJ has requests again. <laughs> I can't. I got a couple I can think of. This is no. James's next oh. one is okay. another indie theme. Another indie theme. Okay. All right. Okay, so I need two indie themes. And I've got a few it... ideas. Unless you've got something like definite you want to do, I've got a few ideas. Well, give Jeff me one idea. Table. I'll look for one. All thing for me. <laughs> Noah gets oh, yeah. an indie theme. All right. So we got like to. We like this one twice with the top for itself. You gotta love that. Jeff gets all right. Another oh. thing. Damn it. All right. And Noah. Noah gets <laughs> DNA. <laughs> that was gonna close that with your hand and just JJ off. <laughs> It wouldn't uh, piss me off. I know. I know, I know like, I, know. I don't care. I gave you a hard time, but I know. It's a thing. So many of themes, huh? Well, good thing we should show about that, huh, Jay? All right. So there are three indie themes. James needs a suggestion for one, so. Yes. I have uh, my first <laughs> one. Okay. Oh. Uh, it is the Roderick Strong End of Heartache will be mine for the first nice. one. Nice. That's a good take. It used to be on the indies before he came to AEW with it. So there is that. Yep. Yep. All right. Nobody shoot me. Right, right. Uh -uh. I <laughs> know far. how much this pairing is loathed. Uh oh. But I know you can have fun with this, James. Uh -oh. Bop by Hanson. God damn it all. By. That was the Young Bucks theme. But I know you could have some fun with it. Dude, do Gilbert Gottfried or something doing Mbop, like for real. <laughs> all right, I'll do that. To be fair, that was talking the Bucks are tolerable, so that's okay. All right, all right. I'll we use the I'll word tolerable that. loosely. Mbop, give it. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Yeah, thank you, you, thank, you, thank, you, thank, you thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, Noah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Noah. We're going to hell. <laughs> do I need a hero? <laughs> for Chris Hero. Bonnie Tyler. Yes. Wow. Dude, we're hitting, we're hitting all the PWG feels today, dude. I love you for this. I have not heard that song since Frackin' Shrek 2. Can somebody oh, send me? I go back farther than Gorilla, I think. <laughs> so true. Can somebody find me Mbop? Or whatever that song is called. <laughs> well, you need so, the lyrics? Uh, yeah, I need the lyrics. Oh, my lord. Just the lyrics. Okay. I got I you. I'll do it in Christopher Walking. But I got I got End of Heartache first. I'm actually going to sing this as Christopher well. Walking breaks everything. <laughs> yeah. True. Okay. I know we don't like these assholes anymore. But yeah, like, just to see if they'll pop for us. Chris Walken doing Umba for these assholes. Well, somebody else is tagging them because they absolutely have my ass blocked. So <laughs> that's yeah. not happening. Of course, they haven't blocked me yet. Jesus. I'm honest to God, shocked. Yeah. They haven't blocked all of us collectively. I know, right? God. Lord knows they should. Lord, Lord knows they should. Well, I don't know. Maybe it's oh my God. So mine's, mine's, mine's Hall of Fame and, and WrestleMania. Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm ready. James. All righty. So I am ready whenever you are to introduce my. And you're doing Roger Strawn, End of Heartache by Kill Switch Engage. All right. Nice. So here's you Kill Switch Engage's End of Heartache, made popular by Roderick Strawn, the master of the backbreaker, James Hebert. 
Seek me, call me, I'll be waiting. Yeah! Have to hit the blah if it's a metal song. This distance, this disillusion, I cling to memories while falling. Sleep brings release in the hope of a new day. Waking the misery of being without you surrender i have to whisper on that one i give it another moment is another eternity for comfort for solace for the end of my broken heart completion i'll be waiting for the end of my broken heart you know that whole thing all right there you go I, I can you tell I really like kill switch and cage. No, but <laughs> <laughs> there you go. So next time you get a WWE theme, which obviously won't be tonight, but next year, got to do this fire burns. Yeah, yeah, oh, for sure. Know. Oh my god, I love that song. Also, 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 Randy Orton's theme. True that, and also Judgment Day 2016. <laughs> 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 It was recycled three times, exactly. I'm a dick for it, and I know it. (laughs) (laughs) All right. Anyway. Jeff or Noah, are you ready with your next one? Um, I'm ready with the WrestleMania one. Get a break in between. Yeah. I'm ready with the WrestleMania one if I need to be. That's fine. Okay. Which WrestleMania one are you doing? Uh, 20... Seven, but I'm I'm not starting at the at the beginning. I'm starting in the middle and then going to the second course. Whatever. Okay. So here to sing one of the theme songs from WrestleMania 27. The man whose name is on the marquee right there next to him. Jeff Meacham. Wow. All right, here we go. Damn. <coughs> what, what, what? Damn it. Stick you two. Oh, 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 Yeah, I needed a change. I don't know the damn much of this song. I forgot. Oh, no. I'll start at the beginning. Oh, written in the stars, a million miles away, message to the main, oh, season's coming, but I will never change, and I'm on my way, yeah, yeah, you're listening now, you say they ain't heard of like this in a while, hey, on so many different, I'm over the rap part of this. <laughs> Everybody, I feel bad now. Oh, God. I hit the wrong fucking WrestleMania, clearly. I just like WrestleMania so much because of the damn chorus. All right. I clearly wasn't ready, so let me, I'll, I'll pick a different one. Go to go to know if he's ready. God, that was fucking you know awful. I'm said, sorry. You know how we said to Greg, this is going to be a white ah. boy summer? Nah, not Chip yeah. right there. That's, the, the, yeah, that's the white boy song. Yeah, that's I, wow. the white boy song. Bro. That's the white boy song. Okay. Dude. Jesus Christ. Yeah. <laughs> yes, sir. I'm coming home. Oh, God. Yeah. That broke right, me. Now, me. That freaking broke me. Let me get there and make sure. Yeah, man. 
because I, I I know the words. I just don't like. It's you know again. It's it's it's, it's a rap song. Um, oh, <laughs> Did Jeff Jeff? I, I know. Duh, d- d- WrestleMania twenty two. Peter Gabriel. Yeah, just do that. Uh, yeah, that's about as wide as it gets, huh? Um, it's better. <laughs> to be fair, at least it works. There's or that ladies many and gentlemen, WrestleMania twenty three. Yeah, that's true. No, you know what? I can I can do I, I do coming home. That's fine. Okay, we'll do coming home then. Black. I mean, at least I didn't ask him to do MGK Invincible, yeah. dude. Oh God, no, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll put that one to fucking death. Freaking Florida, could you have imagined? No. <laughs> oh my God. Golly. We don't talk about. I'm sorry, I'm broken. I never, back where I belong. Oh my God. I never felt so strong. Feel like there's nothing I can. Oh, if you're with me, put your hands high. It was like four. Yeah, yeah, if you're with me, put your hands high. Jesus. <laughs> the tears of a clown. Oh, I hate that song. I always feel like they're talking to me when it comes on. <laughs> another day, another dawn. Another Keisha, nice to meet you. Because Beth, I'm gone. Wow. Most to do when there's no cogs. Come on, it's easy to be puffed. No, it's not right now. Be Sean. <laughs> hey, you ask me why they ain't in the mom. Damn. Do I respond? If my son face a face like my own, he wants to meet like me when he's growing. No, you don't, kid. Shit. <laughs> I'm just throwing. I'm tight. Wait, another day, another dawn. And then Keisha and Tamisha, I'll be back in the morn. Oh, Lord. I'm the lie that I carry on. I'm used to get back to the place. I'm coming home. I'm coming home. Tell the world that I'm coming home. Let the rain wash away all the pain. Shut up, Jenny. <laughs> and they forgiven my mistakes like this shit. I'm coming home. I'm coming home. Tell the world that I'm coming home. God damn. I'm glad I did that one first, not the Hall of Fame one. Wow. Well, that was a thing. All right. I'm just going to throw it out there to YouTube. I'm going to call you about their bullshit. I get the the freaking lyrical version of Diddy, Dirty Money, I'm Coming Home. The next suggestion is Michael Hayes inducting the Freebirds. I'm just going to leave that where it is. YouTube failed me today, so I'm just throwing that out there now. Anyway, uh, wow. That, that was about as appealing as strangled cat sound. What the fuck, bro? I could do that pretty well. I... <laughs> what killed me was your Noah as cat lips. <laughs> right? I know, right? Well, because, like, dude, like, it's probably the wrong time to be doing a Sean, uh, Sean Combs song. I'm just throwing it out there. That boy's oh, serious as shit right now. Oh, God. So, I swear, uh, you all thought you heard mumble rap. You hadn't heard mumble rap until you heard Jeff MC Meacham go and speak. MC Meacham, that's right. <laughs> James, James? <Word. laughs> yeah, that's right. What word? My lyrics be lit and shit. I understand that reference. I understand that reference, too. What? Oh snap! What the hell? God damn you, neon white. Anyway, um. Oh my god. James, are you okay? <laughs> no, he's not. James is dying. We're literally airing a live dying right here on the air with everybody. We're gonna have James expire, and we're going to jail for this shit because James is gonna die right in front of the world right now. Fucking hell. Well, at least I died having fun. <laughs> That's it. Die with smile, freaking smile like Joker smile. The, the, the best way to go out, I guess. <laughs> you can't do that no, to uh, me again. Are you ready for one oh of your performances, good sir? Uh, what am I, do, what am I doing again? Feeling. Sorry, Jeff kind of broke me a little bit there. Uh, in the room, I can't. I, yeah, Jesus. Word. You need to do an indie wrestler, which right. I suggested holding out for a hero. Uh, <laughs> or you need to do a team. Yes, it thing. is. Which we all pretty much figure you're probably going to do Joe Hendry. If you want. Uh, or okay. you could do RVD's TNA. <laughs> oh, damn, damn. <laughs> you could do, you could do the whole show. Uh, you're hurting me. Uh, best, uh, and you have, it is mandatory if you do the song, you have to sing the second verse because. <laughs> no, no. The best on what you bring. Everybody's on crack. <laughs> <laughs> Monster, <laughs> <Bird's> 
It is mandatory, oh, though, that every time it says Rob Van Dam in the song, you've got to do the thumb point. Oh, God. Uh, that uh, might break me worse than I broke the room if he does the RVD TNA thing. I'm going to mess you out there right now. I will be on the floor. I'll be dead. I'll be dead. <laughs> DVD expired. I forget. <laughs> this is what happens when you get through. <laughs> uh, 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 all right. All right. Fuck it. All right. I'm not <laughs> I'm not sure the indie thing yet. I'll try the RVD TNA theme. Yes! Oh no! <laughs> oh god! I need to find it. Done. Give me a second. I'm trying to right. I'm trying to work here. I'm sorry. Oh, oh god! What is this? Oh, it's, like? oh Lord. it's literally just Rob Van Dam. The whole episode. <laughs> no, no, no. They actually, they actually say fucking. Well, oh, yeah, the no uncensored version. Yeah, you're right. Ah, the whole oh fucking show. You're right. I'm hurting, I'm hurting from laughter. Van Cushionator. Van oh, Cushionator. Van Cushionator. Yes. Van Cushionator. It's not even a thing. Van Cushionator, man. It That's going to be what one... not. Dude, your boy, Van Dam, he's going to open up the dispensary. He's going to call it Van Cushionator. I hope you know this. He's going to call it Van Cushionator when he opens it up. Oh, no. Oh, no. Here, here he tried that business, and he got fucked. Like, those guys fucked oh, him over so bad. Oh, That's fair. God. That's fair. Okay. Oh, oh my uh, God. Everybody needs to take a deep breath because we, we, we got the giggles, dude. This is bad. Okay. All right. Serious face. Uh, Oh god! Uh, Don't laugh. You're making it worse for all of us. But you all fucking broke me. I fucking broke you. <laughs> oh god! Just don't put it. Don't think about it. Don't think about word. Don't think oh, about god. word. Okay. The rarity think about, here. Think about Van Dam. Lord, give think me. about Van Cushionator. That's all you need to think about right now. That's not gonna make him laugh anymore. Oh god. Okay. Fuck hell. Okay. Oh. Uh, you geez. ready? Yeah, I, 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 I think so. Oh my gosh, it really does say the same damn thing over and over again. I told you. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh lord. So here to sing the whole fucking show by Cushionator, <laughs> the TNA theme song for <laughs> one Rob Van Dam. I don't know if I'm gonna do the hand face while doing this. So y'all can do the hand face in the background, but here we go. Okay. okay. Here is the Superman Noah Foster. Okay. Oh, okay. I'll. <clears throat> Yeah. Okay, I'm fine. <laughs> what the fuck was that? Fucking hell. Jeez. I'm sorry. I'm going to die. <laughs> okay. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. I'm going to make an ass of myself. Okay. Well, I got to do is yell his name. And that's to start, right? Yeah. Okay. Rob Van Dam! <laughs> the whole after show! God, fuck <laughs> <laughs> <Van Damme. laughs> The whole after show! God. Oh, my God. The Terminator. Oh, Jesus. <sighs> the Terminator. Van everything. Jesus. Van Cushionator. <laughs> Van Assassinator! <laughs> Rob Van Dam! That's <laughs> me. The whole episode! How the hell I get oh my here? God. Rob Van <laughs> The whole episode! God. A chance to shake your brain! It's <laughs> all cracked! Oh, yes! Yeah. All right, that's enough. Seriously. Yeah, I, I, I wanted you enough. said it once. It don't matter. God. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. That's the actual thing. Dude, dude, I told, I... You, I told you we weren't lying. No. Wow. <laughs> How, in the name of everything that is good and pure in this world, did so freaking. Did freaking Dale? Did, is, is, it was, it was Dale Oliver. Dale Oliver. Oliver. Dale, Oliver. Yeah, Dale Oliver and Serge and Rob get together and create that. <laughs> like, I, 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 I don't know. Oh, oh God! I love you so much, like Rob. I like Rob, I get the gimmick is you're high, but what the fuck, bro? I'm laughing so hard. <laughs> Harmony on crack. crack. <laughs> the fuck. 
<laughs> this like, whole band was it's on. Like the freaking lyrics say he's on crack. Like that. It, 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 oh my god, dude. The, the disturbed domina 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 drums are what fucking ruined it for me. It's like the, right? the crazy ass guitar every time. Yeah, if oh it was just the lyrics, it wouldn't be near as bad as the freaking music behind it. Like it just, only, it just completes the, it just completes the what the fuck package. The only thing <laughs> is five star frost blast. <laughs> <laughs> That's yeah, true. It, it, he had the Van Daminator and the Van Terminator. If he if he pulls out a move called the Van Assassinator, I will be at that show. I will find a way. Like uh, seriously, God. it's just him doing no. the. It's him doing the Van Terminator, but it's the Nate Webb fucking springboard moonsault kick into the chair. Right. <laughs> the chair no, the, right. the Van there. Assassinator is New Jack throwing Vic Grimes off that scaffold. <laughs> oh, that's, 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 that's valid. That's valid. Uh, that's valid. I, I got nothing to say. <laughs> that is valid for all the wrong reasons, Jay. Because Jerome had that, said in interviews that. he was literally trying to kill him. Yeah, that is that's true. true. Yeah, 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 Jerome, that might not be one of the justifiable ones. I'm just throwing that out there, brother. Man. No, it wasn't. Oh, God. <laughs> Damn, I forgot he passed away. I could have done natural born killers for my deceased theme. Right? You could have. Totally hey, could have. Hey, Damn, I great. forgot about that. Oh, I was fine. thinking WWE deceased. Oh, my God. I can't breathe. I, my, my entire body hurts from laughing. Like, I'm just Dude, I it. felt it in my kidney. That's how I hard do. I was laughing. Yeah, I was trying what? to get for at least that bit, and then I heard while, James laughing. He almost broke me again. Dude, while we are all you laughing, James, yeah. are you ready to do Christopher Walken doing mm-hmm? Oh, my God. I <laughs> to Christopher Walken doing the song. I, 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 I completely I, 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 forgot. I think, I think James needs to. I, I, I have I it up. Man. Okay, I'm ready. I'm, gonna, I'm ready. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna mute myself, but leave us all on screen, Jay, because we gotta get the reactions to this shit at least. Yes, yes, you do. Fair. Yes, you do. I'm gonna mute myself too. So here to do the right. Hansen classic Mbop as portrayed by Christopher Walken. James Heath. All right. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Oh, 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 yeah. You have, you have so many relationships in this life. Only two, one or two, will last. You go through all the pain and strife. Then you turn your back like, like this. You get to turn your back like I do with the unbox. <laughs> and they're gone so fast. I wish that happened to the Bucks so fast. Go, go away. Gotta go fast. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and they're gone so fast. Yeah. Oh, so hold on to the ones who really care. In the end, that's a Lincoln Park song. Good song. They'll be the only ones there when you get old. Start losing your hair. Well, I'm balding. That's not great. Uh, <laughs> I feel that, Jeff. Can you tell me who will still care? Times two. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. Mm bop da duba da bop do da shit hold on try kilo do bop bop do bop it's cause he see this ass so laughing up the bar Baby Jesus. <laughs> Why did you do that? No. Why did you do that? 
<laughs> dude, dude, for real. I, I, I cut my head. Oh, God, God. Ah, I did. Oh, God. Oh, God. Help me. Ow. I, I tried so damn hard and then as soon as it ended, that fucking last big, and I just rammed my last <laughs> four of that thing. Forehead Dude. first into my glass table. Oh, that's so you know what's great about this? The majority of the room is straight sober, and we're giggling more than we should be. I love it. That's great. This should not, be, oh this should not be a thing. Oh, God, oh, man, that freaking hurt, too. Yeah, no I, shit. I, okay, all right. We need to find a way to use the power of the name Jeff Meacham in the multiverse of media to get Chris Walken to actually cover that song. Oh, yes. God. <laughs> we have to find a way. Oh. It needs to be a duet. It needs oh, to be no. Bill Shatner. Oh, no. Yes. Oh, oh my, my God. God. Yes. Dude, oh. Shatner needs the money anyway. Why not? I mean, for oh, real. Oh, God. God. Oh. My oh, head hurts God. so bad right now. I think I put Shatner, a, I, Shatner on leads and walk in on the ad libs and harmonizing the chorus. Uh, Dude, I put a legit bite mark in my hat. I was laughing so hard. Like, <laughs> sweet God. Oh, I Lord. tried so damn hard. Oh. I got so far. At the end, it didn't matter. Fuck my head. Ow. I laughed so hard during that it's song. Doing the song. In the end, it okay. didn't even matter. Uh, I need to go. Bathroom soon, or I'll piss my pants. Oh, <laughs> Jeff, are you ready for your Hall of Fame song? I am ready for the Hall of Fame. Please don't be another comedy one, please. It won't, I promise. Oh, thank God. I'm gonna try. I'm probably laugh anyway, like an idiot. <laughs> no, no, we'll be all right. Finally, oh, something. something. All right, here we go. Semi serious. I am doing a WWE Hall of Famer, but I'm using his WCW thing, brother. Okay. With that introduction, here's Jeff Meacham. Oh, my God. <sighs> Okay. Here we go. All right. Wrong shirt for this song, but that's okay. He's got the red, white, and blue running through his veins. He was born and raised in the U.S. of A. We're not, we're not, we're not real American, we're really not. He's government inspected. He's U.S. grade. If you mess with the flag, it's like a slap in his face. He's American made. American made. He's American made. A real American. He's American made. A real American. He's American American made. Yeah, that guy had real American in the freaking under. Like, dude, dude, stop being an asshole. <laughs> Just, I mean, <laughs> right. Jesus. Oh, yeah, God. I mean, Jimmy Hart, you did it again. <laughs> hey, you know what? Jimmy Hart had some underrated shit he was doing. That wasn't one of them. But no, um, no, no, no. no. Like, I, I personally like the Hogan theme, but I'm biased as fuck because it's Hogan. Of um, course. How, how's your head, Noah? It, it 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 still hurts a little bit, but I'm fine. I All can't right. do it with that shit. Like, oh my god, dude, dude, it was just one fucking dude. It was one chromosome dying after another with each right. one that we did. Like that was nuts. I'm glad we All had right. this semi serious one. Uh, oh. I'm glad. I'm glad that we had these to kind of like right. get the ha ha in. Now that oh. we're wrapping the night up, yeah, that's true. We only have one performance left. The simple man with his independent theme. Yes. I've been saving this little snippet to run on karaoke nights for our final song. Oh. Oh. Hey, look at John, will ya? What's the matter, John, love? Blue meanies? New and blue meanies have been sighted within the vicinity of this theater. Oh, there's oh. only one way to go out. How's that? Singing! <laughs> <laughs> nice, that, nice, right? Uh, I always wonder why, like, what the, like, I, like, what the fuck do you use this for? I'm glad you, because I, that's been bugging me for months. Like, why is this even in here? <laughs> now great. we know. Now, now we know. know. And knowing is half the battle, but yes, uh, I have that in there for our final song, uh, the karaoke uh, show. Uh, God, the Beatles. There's only one way to go out. How's that? Singing. No, sir. Noah, good sir. Are you ready to do holding out for a hero? Did you come up with something else? 
I uh, couldn't really think of anything else that stretched out her bum of my head. So, yeah, I guess I'll I'll do that. Oh, All right. <laughs> oh Here to do Bonnie Tyler's Holding Out for a Hero, the theme for Chris Hero. One half of the Kings of Wrestling. God, yeah, man, that's right. Yeah. Noah yeah. Foster. The real, the real Kings of Pro Wrestling. The only team that ever got to be named that. I figured that's a long run up too. Why does every damn song have to have a long run up? It's called the Indies. That's it's called the Eighties. I'm about yeah, to say, is, is, yeah, is this from the Eighties or something like that? I don't know. Oh god! All right. Ugh. Where have all the good men gone, and where are all the gods? Where's the streetwise Hercules to fight the rising odds? Isn't there a white knight upon the fiery steed? Late at night, I toss and I turn and I dream of what I need. I need a hero. I'm holding out for a hero till the end of the night. But he's got to be strong and he's got to be fast and he's got to be fresh from the fight. I need a hero. I'm holding out for a hero till the morning and light. He's got to be sure and it's got to be soon. And he's got to be larger than life. Larger Yeah, that's so 80s. I want to say that was on the Footloose soundtrack. Right. <laughs> Probably accurate. Yeah. If there is an 80s Go. dance movie besides that or dance, Dirty Dancing, I, 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 I'm I, fighting Flash on it. Dance. Uh, okay. Black okay. Dance, okay. I remember okay. freaking okay. Yeah, What a yeah. Feeling and then freaking Michael Cimbello's oh. Maniac. Oh, and, my God. Okay. Uh, dude, so I have – like, I need the – yeah. I need medicine. I need. Yeah, let, let's try not to have this go much longer than we already have had. Yeah, it. I think we're done. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Pull, we have gotten later. through all the performances, Thanks. I believe. Yes. yes. If if there's anything that we missed, I'm sure the Dominguez's will let us know, and we'll have to owe them that. Probably not next weekend with open mic night because of mania, but maybe the weekend after. Yes. Yeah. We if we missed anything, oh. but I think we got everything oh, for our final commercial break before we get into the shills. We're going to hit everybody with pretty much every shill that we've got because it's the WrestleMania week trailer. It Yay. kicks off with tonight's event, which is now the dust is settling on and going all the way through the Raw after Mania. Oh, Lord. We will be back. And now, preview time. So let's take a look at what's coming your way.
Ooh. Everything ahead. There is so much content coming up. Yes. In the next week, the next 10 days. Yeah. I've said it before. I'll say it again. I said it last year. I'll say it this year. I'll say it next year. If you cannot find something to sink your teeth into this week, get the fuck out the fandom. Yeah. I'm the yeah. You were the problem. Yeah. What was that? Yeah. Yeah. Reign of Honor, Stardom, GCW, what? WWE, NXT, AEW, TNA, NWA. And I'm sure there's stuff that I'm spacing out on. Yeah. But, but eight different companies running televised shows this week, whether it's regular TV, pay per view, PLE. If you cannot find something to watch, something to sink your teeth into, something to be passionate about as far as professional wrestling, sports, entertainment, go take a long walk off of a short cliff and get the fuck out the fandom. Yeah. Because you are just causing problems for the people like us that love this shit. Yep. And especially the people like this man down here who watch what, Noah? Uh, oh yeah! All the wrestling! 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 All and so, in the words of Trick Mellow Game, that's all it is, and that's all it's going to be. The great part about the sports entertainment part of things is they're calling it professional wrestling on the air now. That is true. So you are literally watching all the professional wrestling again across all the brands now, Mr. Foster. That is true. Because yeah. The Rock said it almost every week. Hunter's come out and said it because he's the boss and gives no fucks now, so he can. Um, yeah. So the no next wrestling isn't taboo anymore. No. Since, since since tonight's almost over, the next fifteen days, going into and coming out of WrestleMania, are going to be something special, and I am so ridiculous. Deep. But I've got you three along for the ride, and everybody that's on these on these commentary teams, everybody that's going to be part of our <clears throat> chats, everything is going to be part of everything. We've got nearly forty streams. To be fair, most yeah. of them are him. <laughs> you know, I mean, between, you know, between for the love of wrestling and the gossip reviews, five yeah. reviews—that's nine right there. And that's just this week. So yeah, it's I am, and I'm hearing will, grumblings. Nothing confirmed. I can't can't you know etch anything in stone yet, but I'm hearing grumblings that either Saturday or Sunday between Stand and Deliver and Night One or the Slammies and Night Two, there may be another review that pops up. Okay. Because there's an A and E biography that premieres tomorrow oh. about a man who's headlining both nights of WrestleMania. Uh, and if I am covering his opponent and his cousin yeah. and his wise man, it mm. only seems fair that I acknowledge the tribal chief as well. That is fair. I found out in the course of my travels this week that Paul Heyman produced that special. Yes, aired. produced and directed. Yeah. Oh. And there's a clip. I don't know if it's going to be on the special or not. It was on, and they didn't get all of it on there for whatever reason, but there was an Instagram reel talking to Paul, and Paul's naming off like the, the, the Rushmore, freaking Bruno and Hogan and Austin and Rock and Hunter and Undertaker. And they all, they, they show them all sitting down with, you know, mic'd up, ready to go, including Hogan, like modern day. And the, the, the theme, basically the themes around that. They all lead to Roman. And I find myself hard pressed to argue with that. 
you know, and and I'm sure over the next seven days or six days, God, five days now, fuck me. Um, there will be a lot of talk about his place in history when everything is said and done. And it's it's gonna be a week, folks, and I I encourage everybody to tune in and hit, hitch on the back of this trailer because we going for a fucking ride. Yeah, yeah. It, man. And and I don't want to sound like some public broadcast telethon. Yeah, <laughs> but it's gonna sound like that. Yeah. Number one, it's viewers like you that have us doing this. Thank you. And number two. If you enjoy the content that we provide to you over this next 15, 16 days, whatever it is, mm -hmm. show your love and support with super chats, super stickers, yes. super thanks. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Because it is not easy. No. Some of us are not going to be able to work our day jobs because of how much we're going to have to put into this yep. to make sure that everything runs smoothly. Yep. Yeah. Thankfully, significant others understand that. And we love them for that. And yeah, and we love them for that. But some of us are not going to be working. Noah is taking Friday off from work. Right. I am not going to be able to work Saturday, Sunday, and probably yeah. Friday. I may be able to work Thursday. Yeah. I'm contemplating working Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday just to make up the shit that I'm not going to be able to work on the weekend. Yeah. yeah. So, if you enjoy the content we provide, if you love us and what we do, like the Dominguez's, and thank you again, Arlene, for your donations thank you so much. earlier. I, those two people sponsored the show tonight. Yep. Pretty much, yeah. Right out. With the yeah. exception of the man called Stain, which yep. was paid for Going into revolution for Noah yep. to sing. He was supposed to sing it after revolution. That was it. And the other one that Dwayne did where he super chatted for Greg to do swerve. Yep. Everything else we sang tonight was sponsored by this lovely woman yep. and her brother. Yep. I'm so gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna get entertainment that you guys have received this evening. Yeah. yeah. Acknowledge the Dominguez. Yes. Yeah. Them the Amen Amazon. with that one. Yeah. 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 Seriously. I, yeah. Um, yeah. I um I was able to get fresh um equipment. I was able to get a lot of things done in the last 24 hours because of their donations. Yeah. To get this to, to keep this shit rolling. And at the end of the day, they fed me last night when I was stuck. There you go. Like I was stuck at a train station for hours and I had no nowhere to go and nowhere to grab food. And I was able to have breakfast yesterday morning. Because that's of, so dope, man. So like Dude. fucking oh, like I, I can't express enough how much I love those two. No, yeah. seriously. Uh, I, I echo Jeff's sentiments. There's more people. I mean, we say this a lot about Noah, but like there's not enough people like Noah and the Dominguez's around. No, and I, I mean that for real, like yeah. seriously, and not just in the internet wrestling community, but in the world. And yeah. I include myself in that category too. We all need no, to no, 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 like yeah. to a degree. No, no I'm, I'm Noah yeah. and the Dominguez siblings, and this is going to sound corny because it's coming from a movie, and it's coming from a cheese ball movie. But Noah and the Dominguez's are the epitome of be excellent to each other. Yes. 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 Yep. Amen. Oh my goodness! And all right, well, now we've got Arlene, Emmanuel, <laughs> Dwayne. We thank you guys for your donations tonight. Yep. For again providing all the entertainment that we've done these last almost five hours. Yeah, yeah dude. Every song we've sang has been paid for and sponsored by one of those three. Yeah, yep. man. So thank you. And when you look we at just the tier, ran through the WrestleMania week trailer, but I know Jeff has graphics in there to show just how insane everything is i mean <laughs> this is just tonight for wednesday <laughs> yeah and we can cross karaoke off obviously because the dust is settling on that one but tomorrow yeah. wrestlemania week hype show 
And I'm going to take this down for a second in case you guys missed the memo. If you guys have anything that you are putting up on your channels next week that you want to hype, you are welcome to pop in during that stream and plug it. Yes. No, I know you've got Simply Predicting. James, I don't know if any of your Jay Hebert side of things yes. are going live this week. Please feel free. 7 p.m. Pacific, 10 Eastern. Hopefully only going to run for about an hour to hype everything, but feel pr feel free to pop in and hype the content you guys are going to have going up. Yes, this yes. Week. Had my travels not been extended to longer, it probably would have gone more than an hour, but I'm just I'm just not going to make it home. So No, no, no. I don't want it to go more than an hour because it's oh, okay. we've got so much we're doing anyways, bro. That's valid. That's valid. For the love of wrestling, of course, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Monday is going to be Impact and SmackDown Recap. Tuesday is Raw. Wednesday is NXT and NWA Power. Thursday is Dynamite. Monday through Friday, I'm reviewing wrestling biographies. Super fan, the story of Vladimir is going up on Monday. The epic journey of Dwayne The Rock Johnson on Tuesday. The American Nightmare is on Wednesday. Bray Wyatt is on Thursday. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Paul Heyman is coming on Friday. And like I said, there are grumblings. It's a possibility. Nothing etched in stone yet that the Roman Reigns A&E biography will be either Saturday or Sunday in between Stand and Deliver in Night 1 or the Slammies in Night 2. So be on the lookout. Just Monday. A swinging wake for talk wrestling. Absolutely. As it gets taken out behind the woodshed and put to pasture. Because Lord knows it needs it. Tuesday, Stat Boy Sports Bar. All kinds of craziness on there. UFL opening yeah, weekend. We've yeah. got baseball opening week. Simply predicting on Tuesday, WrestleMania. Looking forward to being part of that with Noah. Greg Sherry show on Wednesday. Again, Greg was here earlier, and we thank him for stopping by. He doesn't usually tune in and join us for open mic night, so... The fact that he was able to give us an hour or so of his time, greatly appreciated. Make sure you tune into the Greg Cherry brand on Wednesday as he, Maddie Laws, and Ella J, is that her name? Did I catch that yes. right? Yep, Ella J, you got it, brother. Give their WrestleMania predictions. Wednesday, simply predicting stand and deliver. Again, man, everybody knows how passionate I am about my NXT I'm looking forward to getting into that, discussing it with Noah and whoever else is on the show. I think Chris Rotz is going to be on that one. Chris Rotz, Jeff Chadwick, and possibly both to me because this is his. There you cool. go. So it should be a good panel on Wednesday. Let's love on the air then. Then the insanity really kicks in. I was going to say that this shit hits the fan. <laughs> Thursday, Josh Barnett's Bloodsport X featuring Masha Slamovich versus Shayna fucking Baszler. Oh, yes. Dude, James Hebert and Walter Cruz will be on the call for that. Yeah, baby. So oh, goddamn I do have no idea. Oh my god. I I am I am looking forward to this probably more than anything, at least till we get to these things, because goddamn that's gonna be a hell of a show. Meech's yeah. musings with his WrestleMania predictions. Yes. Reign of Honor, Supercard of Honor, simply predicting the top 10 women's championship matches at WrestleMania from the dads not always on wrestling. Yeah. Supercard of Honor, watch along with Noah and James on the commentary. Hall mm. of Fame, watch along with myself and whoever can join me on commentary. Yes. Noah and James will be there as soon as the Supercard of Honor stream is over. Yep. Yes, indeed. It may just be me and you to start, Jeff, because I don't know if Tatilla's going to do it, and I don't know about Walter because he will be in Philadelphia. That's valid. Um, in that and case, James yeah. can always produce Supercard of Honor because he'll be on the call. Anyways. I will be on the call with Noah. Yes. I was going to say I I'll go ahead and produce until it's time to switch over to Hall of Fame. But yeah, that's I fair. I got you. 
NXT yeah. Stand and Deliver Watch Long, which again, that's that's my brand's WrestleMania. Let's fucking go. Yes. WrestleMania mm. 40 night one. Oh, Open mic night immediately following. Then we go over to the Slammies. Yeah. I'm TBA on Sunday. WrestleMania night two. Followed probably by a brief post show recap. Not quite a full on open mic night, but a little no, no, bit no. of discussion, I'm sure. No. Probably an hour or two. Yes. yes. Last Meech's time you did, last you did two hours. Okay. Meech's musings on Monday, the Raw After Mania watch along. Stat Boy Sports Bar again. Greg Cherry Show again. Talk Wrestling Throwback. Yep. That's going to be a fun one. Double shot of those. Uh, two of those. The Windy City Riot, which just became official official today. I know it was something that had been kicked around and talked about, but I wasn't sure it had been definitive. And now it is. You saw it in the Watch Long trailer. Yes! <laughs> and then Collision Battle of the Belts on the 13th. Yes. Mm-hmm. And then, and we, then we rest. <laughs> and then on so the next day we rest. <laughs> so next weekend. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, right? I, it, like, yeah. Holy Jesus, hell. Jesus is looking down on us like, what are you mad yeah, men doing? <laughs> We're like, doing the work. Doing? We're doing the work. Except We're doing the work, work, bro. That's right. Yeah. Good. There is one Sunday this whole month. Well, no, two. Yeah. The 14th and 28th. There's nothing booked yet. Bro. Yeah. This is on top of me and my schedule. I got multiple Jay Hebert sides coming out, and I'm doing a documentary trailer while Mania season is going on. I mean, yeah, and I mean. and you know, I've got a, I've got a, I, I, I have a kid turning 16 on Thursday, but you know, but, you know. yeah. <laughs> hey Noah, what's going on in your personal life on top of all this madness? Right, oh, all the simple stuff. I watch wrestling. I sleep. I work in IT. I'll probably do an interview and prompt too, and then of course I do whatever I do of all you. See, see, I, this guy doesn't sweat anything. He, <laughs> he, doesn't, does. he doesn't. He does. He is. He is our fucking MVP and our superstar. Yes. Like I, I, we could not do this shit without Noah. We just nope. couldn't. There's no way. There's no, no way. For real. For real. Oh. And then, of course, tomorrow. The reason why Jeff may be late. Yes, that's valid. Oh, my girls. Finally back together. Rocky's back from back east. Unfortunately, she had to say goodbye to her pop. But um, they're going to be out at the Topanga Mall. Topanga Social rocking out. Thank God from 3 to 6. I can get my ass in bed at a decent hour on Sunday. <laughs> thank you, girls, and thank you, Topanga Mall, for moving that shit up on Easter. I appreciate the hell out of y'all. Um, I'm going to get to see Ariel again. I we, I saw her set, of course, on uh, Thursday night. Play a little bit of that um, yesterday. Yeah, yesterday. Yes. Did um, you show her the clock strikes? Yeah, till the clock strikes. I'm sorry, James. Did you show her the clip of me uh, shouting out her song "Monster"? I did. She popped, dude. She she was nice. so tickled that you did that. She she was so tickled. Um. So yeah, she did four original songs. Part of that set on on Thursday. Um. I "Monsters" not, not one of them. So off to off to Cindy because I got the track somewhere in my fucking thing. Um. But yeah, she's. I told her last uh, Thursday night, and and it was well, by the time we got there, it was Friday morning. I said. She is the most talented person that I have met through my buddy Jenna, who you guys have all seen on various things over the years. If some kind of management team or some kind of force gets behind her, she's unfucking stoppable. She's got the Agreed. look, she's got the sound, and she's humble about it. That's the scary mm -hmm. thing in this town. Yeah. She she's good, but she doesn't act like she's good. She's humble, she's grateful, and she's a badass and you can hear her song till the clock strikes i know the, the track was a little rough on the on the show last night because it was live and the speaker's taller than her because this freaking little venue's like you know the, the venue's about the size of my studio here and she's the size of a freaking pixie fairy god love her so on youtube and spotify ariel bel valere till the clock strikes give it a listen give it 40 listens you'll hear it you'll hear it differently each time because it's kicked so much ass it is the best song she's written it's her favorite song she's written I can't, I can't promote it enough. Um, I, I'm so happy for my buddy. Um, and then, you know, she's with Drag the Musical right now. She's going on, on the road with Debbie Gibson again this summer, late spring. So, like, I can't say enough good things about my buddy. 
Um, and I'll see her tomorrow, and I'll make sure I tell everybody the same thing that you know she kicks ass, and I'll get to see Rocky and Kaya and, uh, and Jazzy tomorrow too. So it's gonna be great. Gonna be a last kind of all right. Today's yeah, you, Calm yesterday was supposed the to be storm. yeah. Dragging. Yesterday was supposed to be the last like the rest day, and then you know maternal people can't get their heads straight. So tomorrow will be the last day that I get to. All right, no no wrestling work because then yes. Monday morning. Off we fucking go. <laughs> uh-huh. But I love you guys, and I love everybody still watching at freaking all hours of the day across the country. God, yeah, no, across the world. Granted, we don't have the same turnout we've had lately. We've still got twelve people watching, and it's almost four o'clock on the East Coast, almost one o'clock here on the West Coast. Y'all are and bloody for, nuts. And for a lot of y'all, you're going to be in church soon. So God bless you guys. Just like the simple man, Noah. Yeah. Is there anything that you would like to promote or show before we get out of here? I'm usually not one to do that because I always say it's not about me; it's about the wrestling. But I'll hype it up because maybe we'll encourage others to enjoy that enjoy wrestling too. Stay off your damn phones. I'll be a Twitter twat. Uh, again, I'm going to do an interview on Prompt 2, 10 p.m. Standard Time on Monday night. There's going to be two, two WrestleMania panels. And both WrestleMania panels will cover WrestleMania in their entirety. It looks like yes. uh, Tuesday will be the Bar Keeps uh, along with uh, JJ. And uh, we'll see if anyone else wants to uh, join in. I know Walter talked a little bit about it. Maybe that could be his uh, free adieu before heading to Philly. We'll see. And then, of course, uh, Wednesday we have NXT Stand Deliver, very illustrious panel with Christopher Ross. Jim Chadwick looks to return. Of course, I got JJ and I got both the Migas for that. I figure if I'm going to have one, might as well have the other. Same thing for Thursday. Make it official. Yes, that Thursday night, WrestleMania panel two. Same okay. thing, different minds. Should be a whole different fun conversation. And maybe it'll even change people's minds based on what they say on Tuesday. So stay tuned for that as that's going to include uh, so far uh, both the Migas, uh, Christopher Roth, uh, other person I can't think of right now. I think I also wanted to join. I can't think of it right now. Uh, James, you want to uh, join in since that'll be after your blood sport call. You're more than welcome to, bro. And no, then, of it's course, that, it's that ATW view, right? No, the uh, uh, ATW view is Tempe to spend on Monday night. Uh, oh, simply predicting. Standard time, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday is the super predicting panels. Tuesday and Thursday is our WrestleMania. And uh, Wednesday is NXT stand deliver. <laughs> all, Eight o'clock all, your time, all three days. Yeah. I will say if my schedule with my uncle doing his documentary allows me to, I will let yeah. you know. <laughs> All right. I, again, I welcome it, bro. And then, welcome of course, uh, Friday, we're doing the Ring of Honor Super Cup RC predicting prior to the show before me and James call it Hikaru Shida versus Athena. Let's fucking go. And can Mark Briscoe, that boy, man up and win the title 11 years to the day that his brother got rest his soul, won his first Ring of Honor World Championship. That's going to be a now. fight and a half, by the way. Just going to say that outright. Uh, yeah. It's Eddie Keys and Mark Briscoe we're talking about. Fight is a polite term. In the land of Philly, in the arena of extreme, I'm just saying. And, and Jeff, course, Jeff wants like, to say something. No, hold on. Well, I wanted to say something to Jeff real quick. I was going to say, if your schedule permits it, I almost think it would be better if you joined Tuesday's predictions for simply predicting. That way, Thursday can be a final shill show mm-hmm. going into the hard sell weekend. Well, I was if I was your schedule to- permits. It probably will. I was gonna say you you, you had uh, Mikey and Dory um, earmarked for the predicting. I I I got I got them to move up an hour, and I've given them two hours on Tuesday for Step Boy Sports Bar. So they'll probably have resume predictions be part of that, depending on if they load the card with twenty five more matches first. Um, but yeah, um, as of, as of now, I can get the second hour to be WrestleMania predictions. And the first hour can do because yeah, just this weekend, Major League Baseball opening weekend, UFL kicked off this weekend. The NBA and the NHL are both hitting playoff stride, man. It's going to be a, a photo finish for those guys. Um, yeah. You know, NASCAR's going to have a night race tonight, Easter Sunday. Rare night race on an Easter Sunday for NASCAR, but they're running tonight. So they're going to be pretty stacked on the first hour, but I think if it's just the two of them, they can get through WrestleMania pretty, pretty, pretty quickly. Did, so if well, they can't, yeah, if they can, obviously we'll hop over and all three of us will join you. That's that's fine, not a problem. And yeah, you said Thursday we can do the. It's the final count. <laughs> Bro, I'm not like, gonna lie, that really was a moment to do that tonight. For me, right? If there's one person that might be second hardest working man in the multiverse of media, it might be Staff Boy just because he's covering all sports and wrestling on that show this week. Well, luckily, luckily we that's tend only to only this week. Yeah, I was, I was gonna say, yeah, we, we, we but Mikey usually st- doesn't go on the wrestling because at the end of the day, as far as 
across my multiverse, both Greg's and Mike shows kind of do the same basic principle thing. And like Mikey wants to focus on sports. That's his, that's his jam. And I promote the fuck out of that. Like, please do that because there's not near enough sports coverage for my role that I, sorry, no, um, that I can actually get behind because it's all corporate, like you know, ESPN, like, man, it's like I want to hear some real fans' opinions, right? Um, so hopefully we'll get everything done this week um, on time. But, again, I will definitely keep Thursday in mind here, Mark, because I'm going to be on at 10 o'clock Eastern. So it'll be the last thing before Friday. Yeah. Like, across go. any of the channels. It'll be the last thing. So but regardless, you got the commentary team literally doing their own city predicting together as a Love minimum it. a duo Tuesday night for WrestleMania in full so stay tuned for that it's gonna be a fun week like i said doing something each day monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday saturday sunday straight up honestly i'm off the freaking following monday too because it's eclipse day if jj and i want to bring back the simple take for one day we probably all might do that before the raw after media who knows you have to uh wait and see but as always i like to say just go live to enjoy wrestling but there are no winners there are no losers there are no betters just fans of fans this patch we all share and truly if you are not passionate about the industry this week Get the fuck out of the industry. Yeah. You know, it's a step I mean, that. really. Yeah, yeah it, seriously. Even on just our channel alone, if you guys can't find something in the next 16 days that even remotely perks you, then on the 14th, please feel free to go subscribe somewhere else. Like, I, yeah. yeah. I mean, it, even outside of that, I'm still watching all the rest. I'm still watching the Stardom show. Nice little mm-hmm. card, by the way. Micah defending the World Championship against Megan Bain. Yeah. Uh, they brought like, out the cards, like five matches. And then, of course, Fucking start us involved and bring up our super car bombs. Fucking yeah, go. I I heard a podcast this week say that 2024 is shaping up to be the best year of wrestling in their lifetime. And I'm again finding it very hard to disagree. Absolutely. All right. JJ, I sorry. Yeah. Um, I was just gonna what was I gonna say? It is late. I don't blame you for forgetting right now. Well, that was me. I kept it over. So. I'll let him think. All right, if it comes back to me, I'll say it. Yeah, I, I, I just James, it's yeah, so great. James, do you have anything that you want to shill and yes. get out there? Yes. Uh, and again, oh, of course, feel free to come on the air tomorrow and hype it oh, too. Yeah. If you've got graphics and QR codes and everything tomorrow. Yes, yes. I, I know you, so. <laughs> yes, yes. Don't I worry do. about it right now, but tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. Uh, if you guys want to check out anything going on across my channel right now, as I as I plugged in the Gary Hubert ad trailer, go check out the second trailer. It's really good. It's an awesome speech, and that's endorsed by everybody in the multiverse, including people that aren't even that close to me in the multiverse have said that. And we're talking high-level people have said this is one of the best things they said, even though it's a bit long for their taste. Unfortunately, I don't know how to even shorten it because it, like to shorten it is to take away the whole purpose of the speech. Yeah, it's exactly. that damn good and impactful. So go check it out if you haven't already. Um, please also do me a favor and check out the Jay Hebert side of things, which has made a very big comeback this year. That was one of my uh, big things that I was going to be promoting. All the graphics are as follows pretty much right after that one. Um, you can see the first four on demand are already up there right now. So go check those out right now. The next set of graphics one has already showed up right now. So episode 11, which is the second graphic, JJ, if you can pull that up. Episode oh, 11 sorry. is... Sorry, oh, I, I didn't know if it was JJ or Jeff. Fair enough. Uh, episode 11, check that out right now. It is available right now. Uh, unfortunately, the start is a bit rough around the edges, but I felt it was important to cover. Uh, it's funny that we talked about how you need to learn to lay up a little bit because that podcast goes into a lot of that when it comes to the James Summerton situation. So we update people on that. I give my thoughts on the bloodline versus uh, story, uh, bloodline versus story thoughts, the whole arc that <laughs> WWE did a masterful job, by the way. Check it out if you haven't. Their, their little playlist that they put together. Oh, God, yeah. That, that was great. awesome. That was yeah, so good. And coming up tomorrow, you can check out the premiere of this at 12 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time why WWE should hire independent YouTube musicians. Hell, you could put Ariel Bevelair in there as well, I think. But I, I, I wish I had actually mentioned her now that I bring it up. Damn it. Uh, but anyway, 
Uh, Nick Nocturnal, Jonathan Young, Andy James, they're front and center, but they are not the only ones I go over. So if you want to know who I think WWE should hire, go check out that podcast. By the way, fun fact, I got my theme. Uh, I got my start on YouTube doing WWE theme edits. That's how I got a big freaking following on YouTube. So there you go. Um, coming up on Mania Week itself on Friday, 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, Episode 13 covering the Jake Paul by Tyson stuff along with Sneeko and my not so pleasing thoughts about him. Uh, and a person who's a legend in the anime industry. Ironic that Anime Boston is actually happening right now as we speak at this, but the legacy oh, wow. of the Dragon Ball creator and artist Akira Toriyama. We're going to be covering oh, that. Oh, man. We're going to be covering that um, because he he had a large impact not only on my childhood but on a lot of people's childhood. So be Definitely. sure to check that out. Damn right. So there you go. Oh yeah, and final final one. I forgot about that. Will <laughs> Will Smith uh, done with Jada about fucking time. We're going to be covering that and exactly <laughs> why that's a good thing for Will Smith's career. In fact, literally as as I talk about that, his movie Men in Black is finally greenlit. <laughs> Finally, it's coming. My bloody time. My bloody time. After all that crap happened, it's coming. So be on the lookout yeah. for all that, guys. You love it. I remember what I was going to say. Go Usually, I don't promote people unsubscribing and leaving the fandom and being that toxic, but I co sign and agree. And you heard me say it earlier with everything there. I mean, it's. It's just crazy to me if somebody can't find one thing to like, even if it's just a match Damn right. out of everything that's happening this week. It's just, I don't get it. Perfect. And I don't know why you would hang around a fandom if you can't find one match, one moment to just sink your teeth into and really enjoy. Yeah, right. Oh, and, but, and for the record, JJ, just to add uh, a little PC version of what you said about the cliff, walk to a therapist and get yourself some help. That was that. There, there's the PC version. There you go. I say. I, I will, I'll, I'll, I'll even do the fandom a, a courtesy extension. If you have to wait till the 21st to watch Danielson and Osprey to get that one match, cool. Good on you, bro. Like seriously. That's fair. That's fair. But after the 21st. If you haven't found something you don't like, if you found something you like in any wrestling company, you are not a wrestling fan, at least not a true one. And please feel free to go bye bye. Go, go. I'm I'm looking forward to everybody everything on every yeah, single I am too, including Mania, which is like yeah, again the first time since last yep. year, and before that it was like ten years ago. So right. no, all I gotta say is, as much as you and Noah are looking forward to Mania. If Cody falls again, I don't want y'all to leave. No, no I, I, I y'all are about this. I'm not like, gonna lie. Know, that would be what turns you guys away. No, I, I am grateful that I will be here or at, at the home for WrestleMania this time. That way, I can be there right at the start and be like, okay, boys. <laughs> so let's let's wind it down quickly. <laughs> Because last year was such a like I was so emotional leaving that stadium, and I come in and all I hear is this poor bastard just like oh, oh I was oh. pissed, dude. As you should have been, to be fair. I still am. But if the payoff is what you guys want it to be, or if there's a really good, and I mean, it has to be a fucking solid payoff as to why we continue with the, the, the fingers up in the air after next Sunday. Either way, I'm good. But if it's just a rehash, I don't like hash browns. Fuck that shit. And I'm good. Love hash I know browns. you do. I know you do. I don't. Even, not not even cheese, which is weird for gravy, me. Like, yeah. Smothered yeah, and covered like my Waffle House hash browns. It's got to be the right place. Like just generic, like any shit, not so much. No, no, I love Denny's, but yeah. Anyway, we're getting uh, there. We can't say anything on that. So. Go ahead and put a bow on all this. Sorry. Thank you again to Greg Cherry, Maddie Laws, Josh Mansfield, Walter Cruz, Detilla. Thank you again to Dwayne Atkinson, Emmanuel and Arlene Dominguez for the super chats and essentially sponsoring the evening. 
Right. Thank you to all of you guys who have joined us and tuned in for this five plus hour Saturday night shenanigans that are open yes. mic night. The official kickoff, WrestleMania week plus. For everybody in the multiverse, thank you. Have a good night. Happy Easter to those of you that celebrate. Yes. Amen. And we will see you guys tomorrow for our official official WrestleMania week hype kickoff. Have a good night. The Jeff Meacham Network, Multiverse of Media. For over 15 years, the recognized symbol of excellence and the standard bearer in coverage of sports and entertainment.